All right, welcome everyone to a spe special Christmas edition, or eggnog edition, of Playing by the Pound. Today we have Starbound, a game I haven't played in way too many years, way before they had the intro mission stuff. But we're back because there's some very uh, fun stuff to do in Starbound involving Vor. So that is what we are here for because this is, of course, Playing by the Pound. Uh, of course, before we begin, if you like my content, give this video a like, and uh, you know, if you haven't subscribed, give it a, give me a sub. It's a good Christmas gift. It's a good way to it's a good present. I haven't gotten that many presents actually, so sub. That's a good one. <laughs> also, if you like my content, you can see it early uh, by going over my Twitch, such as uh, this Christmas stream actually being streamed on Christmas and then released the next day on YouTube, as you guys have probably observed, YouTubers. Uh, but also, I have a Discord community, so check that out too if you like talking to cool people. But, in any case, as, as random mic noise from the background has, has, has it probably clued you in, I have some people here with us. Um, we got Blood and Selena here. Two of the people that helped Hi. me. Hello. Hello, Selena. Hello, everyone. Hello, Blood. So, they, they, those, these two here have helped me immensely on the giant ass build I have done in, in, in Starbound here to set up for what we are doing today. So, what we are doing today is something called the uh, exploit. I would like to actually look at the readme. Thank you. So it's called the Starbound Simple Vormod, and it is not simple. It is not simple. There is there is one mod, and then there's mods for that mod, and there's mods for the mods for the mod, and it's very confusing to set up, especially considering I haven't played Starbound that much. And I don't know much about modding it, but hell, I did it. <laughs> Got it all set up. Tons of content. Tons of mods. I can't begin to tell you who made what. Uh, Body No made the original mod, and then there's a whole bunch of other stuff here, so I can't even possibly credit everybody. Uh, go look up yourself, Starbound Simple War mod. I won't be linking it directly because some of the content in it is not safe for work, but what we are showcasing today is safe for work, so don't worry. That being said, some of this content might still be spicy, so small disclaimer there. Uh, but if you're here for playing by the pound, you're probably all right with that. So anyways, let's go ahead and hop in here with my Lycan docs because I have a Lycan rock character uh, race because why not? Also, dust dust form represent. And uh, we picked that all the safe work, so it's all safe. Yep. Aside from like one thing that is is still fine, but if it's a little bit, a little bit spicier, but still fine. Uh, but anyways. Where are the pops? Well, I mean, like like Doc says, pops. So, uh, so we've we've terraformed this entire planet for this showcase. So, let's go ahead and join in, guys. Here we got blood. Hi, blood. Okay. That's... Hello. Um. Uh, hopefully, I can find the right teleporter. Is it peppermint candy? Peppermint? Actually, yeah. Peppermint mint can be spicy. That is true. Also, I'm. At, it's the one that has the default name, rather than a subtitle name. It's the one that doesn't say colon something. It's the one that has just a base name. It doesn't indicate a sub-area, as you could say. Yes, yeah, so this build is so big, I actually have multiple teleporters put around it. Um, <laughs> wait for yeah, Selena like, to figure out... The thing is, everyone's landmarks are different, so... Oh, that's fair. Um, it's the right one. <laughs> whatever, you, whatever you name the right one. Hello. Oh, that works, too. I come from the future. <laughs> All right, fact, so I, even, I, I've, I didn't even have this one. Well, there you go. <laughs> I did put new teleporters down at some point. We only had one originally, but then I made it more convenient. But anyways, here, because because uh, it is indeed Christmas, we have set up a candy field. I feel like this is a good way to start. So, uh, if we go across here, we have uh, we made a, we made a Christmas building because Candy King building equals Christmas building certainly. And also up here we have a little, we have a little Santa scene here. In addition, one of the uh, one of the one of the Vor characters, which is actually just these are just armor stand thingies or whatever you call them. But um, yes, you can see one of, the, one of the fatties up there already. But uh, we'll get a better idea of him uh, moving to the left. So so over here we have this is the Vor this is the Vor showcase as I've called it. And that side is not... Okay, there it goes. Like, why is that animated so slow? Anyways, yeah. 
Bye! Charm. Blood. Slayda. Also, I swear this was moving faster before. Dragon Cat! Beerus. And Lucard, a little bit. Thanks. Guys. And then bouncing head. Very slowly. I don't know why it's animating so slow. Whatever, it doesn't matter. But, uh, yeah, so, uh, I made a little... Also, these are Lego blocks. You can, uh, you can color them. Like, well, you can color most blocks, but... Lego blocks color to the primary color, so you can do art with them. So I did this little thing. <laughs> it's just a Charmander and a belly. It's just a dumb thing I did. Uh, up there is some storage of some old, like, items. We don't need to worry about that. But, uh, over here is our first tower, because there's multiple, mind you. And, uh... So here's, um... Let's see, how do we divide this again? Well... The first row on this tower are the basic models. The basic... Do they have an official term? I don't really remember. Uh, just furniture. Just furniture. Yeah, they're basically just furniture. But, uh, you can inter... They talk. You can interact with them. To be eaten. So... <laughs> there's a few here that are, uh... As you can tell, there's a few here that are duplicates, but have different belly sizes, which is why they're duplicates. These guys don't do much. You just press the item. You can eat... You press the yeah, yeah. They have some. They have some quotes. In you go. Enjoy your stay. Best bet in the galaxy. Some of these are default quotes for the mod, where multiple characters will have the same quotes. But uh, as you can see there. But um. <laughs> Much less fierce than my cousin, the Bone Dragon. Why build a house when you can move it to me? The Bone Dragon? Anyways. Uh, these also have different belly sizes. And apparently... Sometimes some sound. I didn't actually know they made sounds. These ones, at least. And Blood is typing something. I am taking off my admin because the ones here have the symbol. Oh. Uh, yeah. Oh, the symbol. Yes, that's true. So you may as may see a symbol over there on the on the left. That symbol indicates that those guys can actually hurt you slash digest you. So uh, I don't know what these guys are supposed to be. I have absolutely no idea. A fan character, perhaps. A moment, I'm a moment on my lips, a lifetime on my hips. <laughs> but uh, if they digest you, I don't remember. So you can see up there in the upper left, you can see that I have a little being digested symbol here, and I am indeed taking damage. So so is so is Selena. She stays in the belly. Bone Dragon's a boss. Ah, okay. Fair enough. But, uh, and since these can digest, I think they... I don't remember what happens at the end. I mean, you die, but I think... Do they do anything after that? I don't even remember. As far as I'm not too sure of these don't. ones. They just kind of return to their default state. We may, we, I'd be full of melty things. <laughs> I'm a melty thing. That's me. I don't think I actually want to digest them. Oh, don't worry, Epic. There are a few things in this mod that will more certainly stomach everyone here. <laughs> plus more. Oh, we're starting simple. This is just basic. For I saw you died. Yeah. There you go. You're, you're did, did, the did, it, did, it have a, did it have any, like, special dialogue? Nope. Oh, no. also, I'm... Also, this, there's a little thing that happens sometimes when you uh, die from digestion, I've noticed. <laughs> You just kind of don't exist in your ship, and then you die. <laughs> I don't know what happens there. That happens sometimes. But it's fine, whatever. Here, this way you can get right back to us. You... That's actually a good point. Why not do that? I invite blood, yeah. though. So I won't, be dig I won't get digested by all of them, but we'll go right to left. So here we got some, uh, Avali, right? I think that's what they're called? Yes. And, uh... Yeah, these are uh, Avalis and Apex. Yes. And of course, I claim all the big bellies. They're all mine. Yes, the Apex are a bit busty, but it's fine. They don't, they're not, they're featureless otherwise. So it's all good. <laughs> Honestly, I don't even like monkeys, but I included them for the sake of completion. <laughs> Maybe I should monkeys charge them. Monkeys are kind of good. They're, they, they're really growing on me. I have to, I, I, depends on the, I only really care about Diddy Kong, he's cute, but otherwise, like, not really, not really into monkeys too much. I've got a, I've got a friend who's a green monkey, and honestly, he's just really great. 
<laughs> I do like the volley's nice shiny belly though. It's very nice. Yes. And we got. Oh, take your pick. Bye. <laughs> so you have to find the biggest ones. Only the biggest ones for me. Oh, do they? They also get blushy when they eat you. <laughs> I just noticed that. <laughs> Feels so great. I'm gonna have to keep you inside forever. Ah, perma. The, the other form of permivore, where it's not digestion, it's just. I actually, that's a subset, by the way, like the idea of just somebody living and never coming out of a belly. I believe that's just an endo trap. Yeah, basically. <laughs> oh, this monkey feels like it's like something. A... <laughs> it's okay, you can say it. It's fine. It's not really. Trust me. Uh, some of the dialogue is a little bit spicy. That's the main reason I gave this this, this uh, mod a spicy rain. Now, we in, we only include the safer work stuff, or uh, and but there is still some dialogue that might be a little bit spicy here and there, but that's fine. Dialogue has different rules than uh, dialogue has different rules than visuals when it comes to videos and streams and stuff. So di dialogue can be a bit spicier. That's not really a big deal. Now there's boring humans. Boring humans, but why not completion, right? Look, I don't cover humans very much in my playing by the pound because if you guys wonder why that is, it's because if you were just looking for human fat and vor stuff, especially fat, but also vor, actually both really, it's easy to find, especially female human stuff uh, of that ilk. Yeah, there's there's actually a YouTuber I don't remember their name, but they cover tons upon tons of uh, uh, human fat for stuff, which or uh, fat for, but see human fat stuff, and uh, yeah, that's I think that's the one. So if you're really into that content, you can find them. Uh, Cause I like to actually find the stuff that's a little more, I don't know, humans are fine, but I like furry things because they could be so diverse, unlike humans, which struggle with being diverse. <laughs> but you know, still good bellies here. I don't, I'm not anti-human of course, but like, <laughs> yeah, it's just, just, it's just, good. it's just that when, when people are only interested in the human vores, it's like, well, that's really limited though. You should branch out after a while. <laughs> So come on, you can only I can only go so far. Also, we do have an elevator. We're just not using it because we're lazy. But actually, wouldn't it be more lazy? Also, it's like really glitchy. But whatever. It also only holds one person. That's true. So here we got the uh, what are these called again? They have a bun they have, uh, bunyips. Bunyips here, and they actually animate as you can see. They're a little bit more complex. Uh, that one just the basic. That's the that's like mi micro. You can't even see it. And then we got uh, next size up is this one here, which is. Nice belly rub on this one. Also, the blush kind of blinks in and out of existence, but that's fine. It could do that if it wants. Yeah, so this one over here is even bigger, and it goes over a little belt. Nice little, nice little fall animation too, because of the weight. And this one, this one's blush doesn't disappear. It's cool like that. Also, I don't say say Philly injured. I can help with that. Does that mean they can heal you? These ones? They are healed. Uh, yes, all the furniture that doesn't digest heals you. Oh, nice. <laughs> I guess that makes sense because it's furniture. And look at the size of this one. Very, very beanbag sized. Very beanbag sized. <laughs> and then finally, we've got this one over this here. This one can adjust. I'm going to let other people do the digest. The digestion variant. So if you do the digestion variant, I believe if you do the digestion variant on this one, it does do something interesting. So I'll turn off it admin. It goes through all of the different belly sizes. Yeah, I've turned off admin now. So it's going slowly but surely down. I can tell that this I could tell this animation is so big though that it's kind of like working off it's kind of like having trouble with the sprite edges or like or maybe they just could have expanded more and didn't because like you could tell there's a, like a very straight line on the right and the left yeah it, it goes kind of hello boys us I would have curved that inwards a little bit just for a little bit of room of pixels both on, on. both on the right and the left too actually yeah I was point it, it would be fixed pretty easily by just add, adding removing a pixel of the lower right lo lower left that would smooth it out a bit more but uh hey I'll, I'll speed this along a little bit I'll speed this along. yeah there's hey wait actually just turn on the PvP and I'll shoot you <laughs> no, I just jumped I just jumped and fell but I have this but I have a rocket launcher don't shoot a rocket but I have it's so useful for hurting people so then, um it, it also does break blocks if you do it too much what really <laughs> Well, yeah, yeah. I didn't actually know that. The cracks in the blocks over here, you can, you can break blocks that way. Well, fair enough. So, I, didn't, yeah, no, I didn't actually know that. Down. Down. Well, hello, Josh, and thank you very much. Merry Christmas to you, too. Merry Christmas. But yeah, so the belly is shrinking as it's only digests and gurgles and gets mushier. <laughs> Mushy and soft and squish. 
I like to think of all digestion for in not a terribly mean context. I like to think of it more like, um, you know, something reformable, something not painful. Something because I like I do like digestion of war if it's not too mean. I am a generally a good boy. I'm a doggo that doesn't like like seeing people hurt, but at the same time I'm also a doggo that likes the idea of adding people to my hips. <laughs> so, <laughs> oh wow, there's even a little bit of <laughs> so she's like uh, the the bunyip. I think it's called bunyip, right? Spits up a little saliva yes. at the end and stuff too. It's pretty good. And then I'm <laughs> because we've seen everything there. Fair enough. Uh, Christmas has been okay. Haven't gotten really any guests. Also, this showcase is actually meant for night, so I'm glad it's night now. Okay, I don't know what these people are, just bunny girls, but... These were called dominatrix bunnies. <laughs> I, uh, I don't know if we checked all their dialogue. With a name like that, maybe I should have, but... <laughs> I think it's more the outfit that they're called that for. Yeah. Yeah, they're, they're I think they are generic colors. Yeah, they seem to be generic. Dominatrix. So there's the little one and the big one. Also, possibly demonic because they got red eyes. And the tails in the back too. That and they have a, the outfit. Actually, that's a whip. They're holding a whip. Uh, I just realized. <laughs> <laughs> and we got these guys who are a little more animated, and they uh, two different sizes for them. I think custom coats for these ones. Oh, let me see. We still safe or? Look, honestly, that Dava Matrix bunny outfit, out, uh, bunny's outfit is still way more tame than what I see in a lot of beat em ups. So, remember Poison? Who, who the f look? If Poison's allowed, that's totally fine. I've seen more racist stuff in Halloween shops. So <laughs> I think we're okay. Let's be honest here. I spend a lot of time curating content for play. every single playing by the pad you guys see. I, 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 every, every single one. I don't go in. I, I, sometimes I go in blind to the game, but there's always a staff member reviewing every game I play before I play it for a stream. Um, and honestly, I'm more careful than I think a lot of people would be. There is a, there's a lot more. How to put it? There's a lot more extreme content just fine on YouTube than I actually put out because I have standards for myself. I want to show weird content. And I don't mind showing some stuff that's a bit spicy, but I'll never go not safe for work. That's against the rules for me. I no, you know. <laughs> so while we might oh like this this character's bossy or this character's wearing a Dom Matrix out, yeah, that's a fine. It's whatever. As long as it's not getting explicit about it, it's, I'm not really too worried about it. Um. Anyways, next floor. Because everybody loves FNAF. Um, have some animatronics. Uh, of course. Good ch yeah, chica. chica. <laughs> Chica looks fine. I don't know what's up with Freddy, though. He looks just kind of weird. <laughs> I'm not sure how I feel about Freddy Fazbear asking me if I'm up for some fun. FNAF 4 scares me. Yeah, there, FNAF 4 is a thing, mind you. Like, think of all the machine parts in there that could just fail at a moment's notice. I mean, I guess within canon, there is FNAF, I guess within canon, FNAF, uh, like, animatronic 4 is a thing, too. It's just a little more horrific with, uh, in, in canon. <laughs> I think in the actual canon, the fun time animatronics were designed to catch kids. Yes, his, uh, which... His eyes also, his eyes also turn red. I, I think that, either that or he closed his eyes and blush. I'm not sure which. Yeah, he's closing his eyes and blush. I would have used a pink, I would have used a pinker color for the blush to make it more... It just looks like his eyes are turning red. It looks somewhat demonic, but that's okay, I guess. Anyway. <laughs> By the way, this uh, the, how many floors is this tower, guys? Do you remember? Uh, there was a lot. I would like I would like <laughs> somebody somebody if somebody wants to casually do this, let's keep track of how many floors. Somebody in the chat want to keep track? We're on floor four right now. This is the one we're on. Floor four. Let's let let's let's see how many floors we actually have because I don't remember. It is a pony, not a bad pony either. Has a decent has a decent animation as well. Oh, so it, since it is probably something that was being thought about by a few people, the rule I have when it comes to furries with boobs is if they're actually furred, I don't care as long as there aren't nipples. That's my rule. That's kind of how my rule works as far as like, is this is this is this too busty or is it fine? This is busty, for instance, this pony, but it's not graphic, so I'm fine with it. Again. Nice. Fur is a very convenient thing as, at times. <laughs> or feathers, I suppose. I don't know. Pegasus here. American TV sister rules. Basically, 
basically, look, <laughs> I guess it's like, if South Park could do it, I might do it. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> also, oh, even a spin-up animation. I didn't even know that. Notice that one. I like this, though. I like any, like, belly wobbles during 4. This is a very good animation. And then the spin-up, too. Um, so, wait. So, I don't know. Which one's the, okay, which one's the Homestuck character? Probably the one on the left. This one here, yes. This is the Homestuck. Which is just a single animation. And I, I don't know who this is. Yeah, I don't know who this is. But they are very animated as well. They are. Boing, boing. I think I heard a little bit of a gurgle, too. Also, that frog doesn't shut up. It's very noisy. <laughs> Um, you can hear him, like, from five people. floors away. For those that recognize this, possibly, if you've ever played Fromage before, this is the same frog. Is Fromage the name of the game? Yeah, Fromage. It's a war game I can't play because it gets a little too spicy. Uh, it does, it does. It's a little too spicy, so I can't play it. I guess I could do an edited playthrough, where, like, I, you know, go offline and, uh, just, you know, skip parts, but... <laughs> also, they are also... A digestion variant, so they are. Eventually, my health is going to go down, and they are going to actually swallow. You should probably destroy the frog once you're done because noise. Um, that could be impossible. I'll take the. I'll take it back. Yeah, I'm gonna. I'm gonna fix the bill at the end because I'm just happy having this. But okay. uh, uh, yeah, I'll take the frog afterwards. So. Unfortunately, oh, we know there you go. No, he'll keep doing. He'll keep doing things. It stopped his yes. animation for a second. Also, oh, another rule of thumb: if I don't link. Like, for instance, I won't link the Simple Vor mod and the other mods I used, and I won't link Fromage. It's okay to talk about this stuff, but I won't directly link this stuff if it ha if it contains an SFW material. Because sometimes in my playing by the pound, what I'm showing off is tailored to be safe for work, even if it isn't normally. So that when I'm doing that, I'm not going to share those games directly. You can look them up. Look, you guys aren't idiots. Go Google it. If you really care, go Google it. Um, I will take I will take the frog, and I will... I died again. A frog, a familiar frog who smells slightly of cheese. Why does he smell like cheese? Fromage. Uh, fromage. fromage. Uh, it's French for cheese. Oh, that's true. I forgot about that. Yeah. Very good point. I have so much random crap in my inventory. Well, so that was floor four. Let's go to floor five now. So we got some glitch. There's short ones. Short ones. Of Big Which furnace bellies, it looks like. It looks I, I'm assuming, I'm going to assume the tall ones weren't native to the original game, or were they? No. I no. The short ones yeah, are the... the short ones are, the short ones are the default, and then I look at these and I immediately think to myself, somebody redesigned the glitch to make them more sexy. <laughs> so I was right, right? <laughs> but yeah, it looks like, it looks like they've got little furnaces, furnace bellies. I do like, I do like that. Uh, the glitches just, just in general kind of, are kind of an interesting race. I'm just kind of imagining how and I just kind of roll my eyes a bit. I don't mind the idea of, like, giving a, like, species a... I guess I don't mind, like, a busty female anthro form for characters, but it's so annoying to me how often times people will, like, to make the characters, to make the species or characters sexier, that's what they do. They just do, like, oh, you know, busty hips and stuff like that. It's like, okay, cool. Any other body types, maybe? <laughs> you know? Like, why does it always have to be that one? I'm just picky. I, I'm actually, I'm not picky. That's the problem. I'm pick. I'm picky about other people being picky. <laughs> now there's the Gardevoir. 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 And speaking of which, the most popular Pokemon are Ghibli Anthros. I'm not bitter, says the Feral. <laughs> yeah, like this big, this big, this big, big belly here, kind of. Though I, I mean, I have no problems with Gardevoir. I have no problems with Gardevoir. Good character, especially in PMD. Um, and there's the animated. Yeah, that one's animated. A little, it's similar to this one, but actually better, technically. And blood is your turn to gurgle. Get going. Okay. And then gurgle goes through this two, to the, the two uh, animations, I assume, like, and then just makes you go away. I'm not sure. So thank you for being the gurgle subjects, because for science that makes it easier. Now keep in mind, guys, we're starting out with the most boring content here, and what I mean by that is. As we go up the tower, the content will get more and more interesting. We start I started with the Furrager characters because they're kind of simple, but if we go once we go up and up, we're going to see more things. This is not all that there's going to be. So just keep that in mind. Um, indeed, it is shrinking. I should get the Oh my god, that's the wires. Um, careful. 
It's okay, I'm just trying to switch back to my other hotbar. I'm sure there's a key to switch the hotbars. I'm not sure what key it is. You must not show our shame of Dio Wire. <laughs> What's that? You must not show our shame of Dio Wire. <laughs> <laughs> Gallade's kind of an odd one. I'm not sure what to think about Gallade. For a humanoid race, they need an expanded chest to be able to stand. Wouldn't heavy boobs actually, like, hurt the back? <laughs> Alright, next floor. Also, thank you, Epic, for keeping track. So, Greninja. Okay, that's... Admittedly, I'm cool with Greninja. Small frog. Not so small Big frog. frog. <laughs> also, blush. Yes. Well, mine's not blushing. I guess, I guess his belly isn't big enough to blush. <laughs> And then, small frog again. slightly, slight, what's the difference between the left and the right one? Uh, was male, once female. Oh, feet, yeah, right, I didn't, yeah, of course. Oh, right, true. Look, I appreciate whoever sprayed this one, because they made a male version, and I'm just like, yes, thank you. Thank you for branching out. <laughs> Big girl frog. Again, I have no problems with humans. I have no problems with female characters. I just like balance. That's my- that's always my shtick. I always like, okay, if this is done a lot, then I'd like the opposite to be done too, so that it balances out. That's all. So th for this case, this is a perfect balance because it's both. So the Pokemon frogs won't end up- make you end up croaking from digestion. Nope, they didn't think of that pun was worth doing. <laughs> Gudra! You can't not love Gudra. Gudra is always a good thing. Okay, I like- I definitely like the animated one. That's quite the belly wobble. Admittedly though, I wish the goo dripped on that animated one. That'd be- that'd be perfect. And then the, uh, digestion one probably does the, uh... A little bit of shrinkage. Shrinkage and... Oop. Oh, they also spit up that one. Actually... The swallow animation. There's something, something about a nice throat bulge like that. Real fond. Real fond of that. Yeah, yeah, it glitches a little pretty, bit. Pretty good. It's good. Very good. Sharp's talking about balance in his purple. Thanos talked about balance in his purple. God damn, not the Thanos jokes again. I already had to endure that before. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, the digestion variant just shrank down a bit. No, yes. This is still better than the JoJo references. Throat bulges are good. I especially like, um, like, a pred holding prey in the throat and then wriggling around for a bit before the full swallow. Just take the, take the time, you know? That's good stuff. I should do that in a picture. I haven't actually done that, like, kind of crop holding, so to speak. So this was floor six, right? I think so. Uh, epics keep track, so. This is the Yoshi floor. Every one of these Yoshi's does the same thing, but I had to include every color because that's a rule. Also, they have eggs. The eggs don't do anything, but they have eggs. Yeah. Hey, hey. This is mine. <laughs> my, my Yoshi. Selena is owner of all pink things. Yeah, it's true. I like how they have the egg laying animation, even though they don't do that. Oh, oh. No. <laughs> <laughs> but they can't let you throw a wall, apparently. It just, it just, ran, it just threw me out. It didn't like my, it didn't like my possession. That's a quick way to leave the tower, I guess. Via Yoshi. Exit by Yoshi. Just go right through the wall. Of course, you might have to survive a quite long fall. <laughs> I'm actually surprised you survived that. So you had admin off. And then we have one more Yoshi at the end, you may- Oh, actually, that's interesting. Look at this for Yoshi. The second to last one. Compare- Compare his uh, animation with the other one, look. It's a little different. I actually didn't notice that. Oh, that's because we mixed them up, so, uh... The le the left one's- The leftmost one's part of the, uh, other colored set. But the one in the middle here is a different Yoshi. What does he do? I think it's just a different animation. Just a bit different- I believe so, yeah. Animation. Yeah. Like, you can see the saddles are a bit different. Shoes. And the exit? Maybe it's different? I mean... Oh. This one... <laughs> this one... <laughs> that one took a while to actually uh, un-eat un me. <laughs> even though I had left already. 
Honestly, if oh. someone look, if there's a little bit of lag with the animations or anything, that's completely understandable given how much content is in this build. So, Night Tales. Again, kind of straight lines on the belly. Also, the, they could have done a little bit better with that forepaw on the belly. Looks a little wibbly wobbly rubbery. But that's okay. Wait, Lincoln Zelda? Okay, yeah, not gonna like that. Well, are you one of those people that really hates it when a canon character does like Vor or whatever? I would normally agree with you, but then there's Wolf Link and I can't agree with you anymore. <laughs> I wish they'd spread Wolf Link for this, that would've been great. That would've been great. And then I think and this is Mass Effect Lady? I think Mass Effect. Yeah, this is, is Mass Effect. Yeah. Look, it, well, bit. while it may be human, I would like to point out, uh, tight bodysuits plus four. Good combo. Very, very good. I have to agree. But yes, indeed. I've never, never played Mass Effect. I don't know who you are, and I'm going to say goodbye. Because, yeah, we have to get this out of the way. Not only, not, actually, no, it's not, it's not Zelda and Link. It's actually Zelda and Linkle, or whatever you want to say. Yeah, because girl. Oh, her dress break. Because female human form. Because <laughs> gotta do the fe yeah. Because if you're doing human form, it's gotta be female. Nobody likes anything else, apparently, if you're going for the human vores. God, humans are boring sometimes. Also, that, that, line, that line there was special to her. Which one? Can make it happen again. It's been it's a been pleasure, pleasure eating you. Eat hero. That's also a special one, I think, for her. Um, yeah, I'm out for the human Link Zelda BRB. Are you really that against it? Look, we're only, review we're only checking out for like one minute. What the? I understand an aversion, I mean, really but this is, seems a little This is silly. Fair. <laughs> We're already if done. You really, if you I rode your elevator. Well, these, 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 these have the sway sways. The sway sways. The sway sways. Sway sways. So these are both digestion variants. So these are the. And these are these are the. Uh, these have actually. I'll, I'll look at you guys. Okay. Well, they have. They have some animations. Yeah, it'll probably take us a while to get our health down. Uh, this one's like, going like a time to look at. That's fine. I'm already losing about a third. Question is, do they really shrink? That's a good question. Well, we can compare it to the one I'm in, which doesn't shrink. I don't know what these are. Circles? Yeah, oh yeah, there we go. We got some uh, no, fox and wolf. Oh, they're fulfs. Uh, False? The orange ones are foxes oh. and the black ones are wolves. Okay. Also, yes, the bellies do shrink, which means those are animations unique to the digestion one then. Oop. Indeed. Ah, uh, fatty. The poke down there is nine tails, yeah. How did you put. Why did you put nine tails on floor nine? Well, that's a retrospect sort of thing. Hindsight is 2020. Also, I'm probably about to fall into space again. Yep, there we go. Yeah, you can quickly uh, charm's picture about to beep to a ship. Very true. I mean, I imagine she knows yeah. that because she's the one that forced me to a party in the first place. I just thought it was a better idea. Like, look how look how fast we get back. You know, oh yeah, it's fine. Climbing this giant tower. But over got here, we got dragon. Okay, so I'm of two minds when people take like a lizard, an anthro lizard, and then give them boobs. I'm like, well, okay, but it's a lizard memories. Hmm. <laughs> like sometimes I'm not sure. Sometimes I'm not sure about that. Sometimes it, it works. Didn't, didn't actually didn't Loxton do a video on why they gave the Argonians titties? He did. I love Loxton. He did a good job. <laughs> he's a good. He's a good theory crafter. I'd be very true. And then, past, past the lizards, we've got Ruto. We get more I think Zelda, she has unique lines, I don't remember. I think, I think Zelda... Oh, welcome to a new dungeon, my belly. That's new. What do you mean, Link's first belly dungeon? <laughs> I mean, it's, it's kind of ironic that she's got that line, considering... Oh, I don't like how the blush is down on her face. I just realized the blush? Makes her eyes look really bizarre. Oh. Uh, Again, it yeah. probably could use a different blush color there, just to make it. It kind of does. It kind of like makes yeah. her eyes extend somewhat. I don't know why I'm critiquing these, but I am. 
Here, have some maids, because... More human, because why not? Simple, no animations, just draw a circle. That's the furniture. Oh, welcome back, Fair. I wasn't sure why you spooked out of there. I don't know what this is. I'm not sure if this is human or not. I'm pretty sure it's not, though. Humanoid, certainly, face. but... Very psychic, very big. This thing definitely has fur, so... And then there's the V-Mon. And then there's I just randomly V-Mon. I think for this one, we, re we rejected it's... the bigger belly version because it looks really awkward. Oh yeah, it looked dumb, if I recall. Yeah. Over here we have some burbs and Teen Titans. Obviously modified uh, natural bird race. I forgot the name of. Uh, avian. A avian. Just avian. Naturally bustified by avians. It's very easy to tell. Give the burbs tits. We give the lizards tits. We give everything tits. Everything gets tits. It's just tits up in this situation. And then randomly Teen Titans. Teen Titans. Starfire. Again, She's strangely popular for some reason. Uh, I guess. Human female. Humanoid female. I don't know. Is Starfire it's like, human? I don't can, can people... Look, the people that only look at, like, human fat, human voice stuff, can they ever get... Do they ever get bored? Do they ever get bored of the human stuff? I should think so, honestly. It's always... Like, they're always looking for a particular... I guess the thing that bothers me is, like, again, I'm not at all anti-female, but I am a little bit irritated how it's always the same female body type. It's like that idealized, like... What about the fat girls? Come on! It's like, you know? I mean, yeah, Vor kind of makes you fat, but like, you know what I mean. Like, why not... Why not alternative... At least alternative female body types? From, what, from actually what I noticed, Shantae and Starfire's bellies, I think, were basically the same. I think they just kind of reused it. Yeah, I think you're right, actually. Oh, if you jump in one, you'll be able to use Alter check. Actually, yeah, those look very similar. I can barely stretch over there to see, but yeah. Yeah. That's the same it. shine to it. It is, it is. And then we have shark. Shark, shark, shark. shark. Small shark, big shark. Also, they were out of order. I thought this was going to be the big one based on the pattern. It seems so. <laughs> Blood messed up the orders on some of these. <laughs> I must get in the big belly, though. There we go. Okay. Wait, I thought we already did maids. Wait a minute, did I duplicate these? No, they're slightly. They have a different skin tone. That means they're different. I guess uh, a little true. bit. Well, I mean, they do have a different skin tone. Also, they also have the same belly shine, I just realized. Same belly, but it is different size. It is. So I get, I think, I a little I bit. Well, different. yeah. But then we have Chocobo. Quare, quare. Or Wark if you're a classic like me. Quaz. And the blush. What are creatures TF comic for the, where the Chocobos is going? It's a good one. All right, next floor. So, we fit trainer? Feels random, but you know. Hey, look, I'm okay with the fact that they at least include both. You know, they include both. But uh, I'll help you get fit inside of me. Not, not really. I don't think you'll be getting any fitter if I'm um, with this. They have they have unique lines. I remembered. Train you well inside my belly. Thanks for the exercise, snack. Ferris seems to have very strict opinions about <laughs> strict, very, very judgmental today. Like actually, humans, actually, I'm literally realized. going like Ferris. Like humans, oh, I'm gonna literally leave the stream while these are up. Like, okay, cool. <laughs> and now he's mad about tells, which. Uh, I just realized there's a typo on those. It's not exercise. It's exercise. They they typoed it. And yes, tails. There you go. Tongue. Oh. Very, very noisy tails. I also tell Vor, because tails. <laughs> tail, tail. Look, it's okay to have an opinion. And it's okay not to like something, but... You know, it's just a little rude when you talk that just... loudly. It's all it's yeah. all very platonic stuff here. It's not, not too crazy. And then there's sort of work. Lars sure. and Pouts' wide mod quickly swallowing and purring as you fill his gut. Oh, whoa. Oh, whoa, oh, whoa. That is such an oh, whoa dialogue. What the hell? <laughs> That's the, yeah. That was I mean, very is, oh, whoa. Tails is a fox, though, so that can be expected. Oh, god to... damn it. Maybe. <laughs> Halfway grass and parts is mock. Come to Tails, tasty. Hey, I'm, I'm, I'm a kitsune. I can, I can, I can, I can 
go with the fuck stereotypes. I'm Look, amongst other them. things, I am a writer, so I can kind of... When I see people do certain RP posts, I'm just like, hmm. One trip to the Void of Fur coming up. That's a little more interesting. Stomach gurgles audibly as he looks you over. Let's... Now you, Joe, go. Okay. Hope you enjoy the sea. The sea? The sea? The sea of fluff? The fluff sea? Oh, this is the fluff sea? I have a fluff sea. I might tell. My tail is very much a fluff sea. <laughs> the fox's friend is full of the rumbling food. No one expects a fox something? I didn't catch that line. It said, no one expects a fox's fur to swallow them up like food. <laughs> and that's true, though. And then, yes, we've got Zoroarks. They, they big belly, too. And they, and they smile. Yeah, I guess so. It's kind of a weird here's, smile, but for the snout. Here's the normal face and smile. Smiley boy. Yeah, the second tells is teleporting. Yeah, like I said. I thought that was a little more interesting, because you don't see that very often. Also, it's kind of appropriate. He's got two tails. And they're very prominent about his character. That's why he's named Tails. So, yeah, got, sure. Um, I don't know what this is. Like, human, probably? I don't know. It doesn't quite look human. Maybe, like, demon girl? Yeah, it's good animation on it. Probably has digestion to digestion frames. I always pick it up to see its name. Yeah, but that takes effort. Then I have to put it back down. <laughs> It's more fun just to guess. Somebody can it also encourages comments. The character. Because then there's somebody in the com there's always gonna be somebody like, oh I know the character, and then I get better comment reception because somebody wants to call out. <laughs> it's perfect. <laughs> yeah, so the belly is slowly shrinking down. Uh, wait, is she checking her phone? What is she doing? Does it look like a PSP actually? <laughs> uh, yep, but it's still shrinking down. So I can't really make fun of uh the the, the you know, Sarah Suit Samus, because, I mean, that is basically what she looks like, you know? Avert, avert she, your eyes, Fair. Avert your eyes. Don't look. I'm not your normal... Don't worry. It says... She said, I'm not your normal human being, so Fair doesn't have to worry. She's not... She's oh. not a normal human being, so... That's true, actually. She really isn't. She's... She's very special. Be sure if you want to be next or plead for your life. Not sure if you want to be next or plead for your life. What is, is that a proper sentence? Better be good at this for half seconds. Often I get a rub from the outside. Fraun at the outside. Fraun? Fraun! There was a type. <laughs> yeah, it was Fraun. Hey, Larry, you can give me a rub for the inside and said, I've already got it inside your belly. What are you saying? Well, How I, much I'm more inside can I'm, I be? I'm the one who's actually triggering all these dialogues, oh. actually. I see. See, I, if I press E on a full one. <laughs> but you're not digesting. Yeah, Zero Suit Samus, I'm okay that Zero Suit Samus is kind of sexy because, like, she's pretty cool, though, so. It's alright. And we've got a couple of Avali. Gotta spend the galaxy down the goal and into bed. Now, Charm, are these the are these the Raru ones that we couldn't make work with the other? Is, is this Raru? I don't remember the color scheme. Actually, I think you're right. This is the Raru color scheme. It, yeah, it is. This is Raru. This is the one we couldn't make work on the other thing. Yeah. 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 So, I mean, that's the, fine. Again, we'll a, very, a very flat line on the belly again for this one, I notice. Yeah, this looks like, again, it looks like actually properly cut off, like a mistake was made. Also, we have a couple... Sharkies. Shark. Oi, oi. Is a shark for both of you? <laughs> uh, yeah, they're digest. They're both digestion. So let's see what happens here. If anything. I blame, blame a perfect cell for making me like Talbor. I bet that's where a lot of people first saw it. Honestly. There's also a really good artist on Fur Affinity that does a lot of it. Um, Spazman, I believe? Hmm. They do a lot of oh, tales yes. with their green, yeah. their green sort of dragon-like character. Um, so I don't think these actually have any animations to them. So like blue, just... blue, it's, yeah, some people don't, honestly. I, I get the appeal of fat or vor of humans, but I don't get the single-minded, only one t species, only one body type, only one gender appeal that a lot of people seem to have under this category. Yeah. I get the appeal, I don't get the lack of branching out. <laughs> Oops. I want to hit the lights, not Lights paper. first. Oh, okay. Okay, who's going to hit it? <laughs> Coordination. I usually hit yeah, the, lights. the lights. So here's a couple more burbs. So why not? Burb, burb, burb feels like mom, mom burb. Mom burb. And then we've got bunny. And then we have just a bunny of some sort. Bunny, bunny, bunny. She looks kind of sad with the big belly. 
She's blushing she though. Looks, she looks a little bit more sad with the little one actually. She, she looks kind she, of. She like, closes her eyes. She's just like, oh, or tired. I wanted a bigger meal. Then we have some busty cat. I don't know. Cat. Cat. Simple cat. And then. The, the, the general rule of thumb of a lot of these is busty. <laughs> mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Then again, when you're working within like the simplistic spreading style of Starbound, there's really not much true. else you can do. True, true. To, to denote female. Um, I don't know what these are, but my goodness, the hair gel is really. Uh, uh, sorry from Mass Effect. Ah, uh, okay. All right, next floor. Got some interesting ones. Well, first off, yeah, let's go. The hell lights? All right. Here's Pacoons. They wake up when you approach them. Hi, wake up. And you can eat them. You can eat them. And they have different animations, I think, too. Yeah, they do actually have idle animations, like that one's demonstrating. They are more than just recolors. They have some differences. The blue one is quite tired. Uh, the blue one is quite fat, <laughs> like compared to the others. I appreciate that. And what about what about our bright green friend over here? Oh, they're also quite fat. Ah, yes. And our yellow one. Okay, so the yellow one and this green and blue one over here. Yeah. Are kind of similar. And then these ones are both really fat. Yeah, two of them are recolors of each other, and then two others are recolors of each other. They also have nice little pants with <laughs> little like little like huffs after eating you. Just took effort. We've got two more dragons, similar to the black ones. <laughs> sk 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 kids comment. I love Tidims in all the episodes. Uh, Pan's actual. But please let me see some pecs. I'm thirsty. <laughs> <laughs> so these are that's fair. these are just recolors of some dragons we had below, but uh, here they are. And then these look very similar to the previous ones we saw, but it's a quick little pop are in, they, pop they out. The same? They, they actually same? look very similar. I think they're I think they're a little different. I don't think we actually did duplicates, but next floor. Have some. What are they called? A florin. 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 Yes. Yeah. The kind of. They don't have much. They don't have much of the bellies, actually. No, indeed not. Then we have better chocobos than the other ones because these are like proper. Feral. Proper chocobos. Proper chocobos. But they still talk. They still can speak. I mean, that's fine. They should say. Chocobos. They really should say work, though. <laughs> to stay here for about 30 seconds. I'll be right back. Alright, that was... Alright. Oh yeah, these guys are... These guys are... This is Gnaw. I think it might be an original character. He has original lines. Gnaw eat you! I'm not... No, 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 no. <laughs> this is easier than hunting. Why not... Why not not do this before? And then we got this one. Jaws, jaw tendrils that sh on shoulders snap as you pass. They have his jaw tendrils on his shoulder. That seems slightly random, but my Nas teeth. This one just look at this. Look at this fucking bloat boy right here. It's like what the hell? Not like silly food person. <laughs> this four animation just amuses me on the third one. It's just like a bean bag now. <laughs> Then we have girl that's probably from something. Honestly, the other problem with just like, you know, f female anime girl stuff is like I always mix them up. Like, wait, what's that one from? Is that from that anime, or is it from that manga, or is it from that other anime? I'm not really sure because they're all fucking the same to me. <laughs> okay, I am back. Hello, what? I'm back. It's another problem with the lack of variety. I start mixing up characters because we're just characters that all meet the same like qualifications, you know? To ask, one can wait, I'm sorry, wait, I need to see what he just said. Hold on. Tries to reach out and look at you. To ask, one cannot has food bowl, two can food person sit in it. <laughs> <laughs> That's very cute. He has good lines, I like the custom lines. Then we got some Burbs. harpies. Oh, this burb is facing the wrong direction. That's fine. <laughs> Not a big deal. Also, some gurgly noises. I kind of like the feathery pants look on this big round belly. Yeah, me too. Like, it's a good shape. <laughs> it gives it some stretch, you know, kind of. Then we got some. The car is facing forward for some reason. 
they're meditating. And oh, there's a meditative pose actually. I yeah. guess. Meditating in belly. We spend the galaxy Terraria harpies? Are they? Maybe oh, they are. Okay. No, they Thank aren't you. apparently. There are some other still, harpies though, so those might be still very harpies. Cute. They're still very cute. Lights. So we got more human. Hey, if I finally made the party, Rumble. Jeez, I'm so hungry. If I know you're this tasty, I would have eaten you something. The party feels good. Sometimes they interrupt their own lines. So this this lady this lady talks about parties a lot. I don't really know. She's probably she's, from she's something. Party. Party. She's a party girl. Party girl. This is where the real party. You spot a kangaroo, really. <laughs> Indeed, a kangaroo. I'm just disappointed there isn't a variant of this that's pouched for. It'd be good. Yes, yeah, so that would be nice. However, that being said, I like the big belly on the left one. Huh? So good. I like how this pouch has its own individual seg, which is a nice uh, bit of dimensions and depth. It's good. And up here, surprise, we're females. <laughs> um, <laughs> I don't even know she, what this is. She's a I think these are high levels. Oh, oh okay. Which are is what? She... What are they supposed to be high levels? Uh, high levels are like fish. Um, oh, they're supposed people. to be fishy. Okay. And then we have probably somebody's character. I can't remember. We have a have my, a nine tails. My belly. All nine tails bellies belong to me. It's fact. Harpies charms. Harpies. Yes. Also, a uh, kind of weird Lucario that looks like he's from, like, some sort of spin-off Pokemon game or something. I don't know. Yeah. Kind of like a very just draw a circle kind of belly. Yeah, it's kind of a... I mean, at least they applied some shading, but it's also kind of basic shading. It's, it's, a, it's an attempt. Again, this these were made by multiple people. It's a big collage of all sorts of things. Uh... Melodetta, I believe. Of course, more, more, more busty version of Melodetta, because why not? Um, also, these are definitely these are different belly sizes, but it's hard to tell. Very subtle. They're, they're a little bit different, but. And then we have this one character that just keeps turning into a bat for some reason. So I guess she's a vampire. But they are animated. So there's that too. I mean, it's interesting. They keep turning into a bat. I'm not complaining. But, uh, and over here we have, so these are two segments that you can go into. This is Nagatel, right? And uh, if you're wondering where the head is, it's, no, they're busty, so I can't include them. Well, more specifically, they're busty and detailed, you know, so. Yeah, they got, they got titties, like, all the way out. The, so the, we the, can't it, have it, went, it went a little too far with them, Nagas, so, uh, yeah. Not in this Christian Hatsune, room. here's Hatsune. Hatsune. Hatsune it's okay, it's okay. You have still have Hatsune Miku, so you could be happy. <laughs> Avert your eyes again, Fair. Uh, Fair left a while ago. Fair got sick of this shit. That's unfortunate. I don't know. I, I don't know if she actually got sick of this shit. I don't know. I don't know where they went. Gotta kip out for a bit. I think they just left because they just left, but. Let me see Mel Nagas. There are actually some, I think, somewhere, but. Um, anyways. And then we have the real star of the show, Minda. I'm okay with Minda. Minda's cute. I like Minda. Mostly because she is a variation on the standard, like, tall, dark, and rusty human. That's what we put short. it. She's short and cute, and that's good. Now imagine this big belly on top of a wolf, like, who also has a mother, though. It's <laughs> really good spicy. And then these are yeah. technically just variations of earlier ones, but let's take a quick look, I guess. And then we got this character who I don't know who she is. Short shark. Are you doing? Are you gonna do a quick count at the end to check the floors, or no? You're keeping track. <laughs> so I don't need to. I don't need to focus on that because you're doing it. <laughs> here's a good. Here's a real good floor. A couple of good oh yes, this. Done. Okay, first off, this dinosaur is great. I, uh. So, I'll demonstrate. If any of you remember that um, Dice Scourge game that Charm played, uh, the creator of this, Accidental Aesthetics, this is this is their character, Callie. Also, don't worry, that's not... Yes, that this is one of those spicy animations, but as you can see, 
All that was doing was stuff into the tail, so it's fine. Spicy animation, but again, not sexual. She just kind of sleeps after we burn. <laughs> I really like this one. I mean, let's 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 be honest here. Any character that does like oral vor and then takes you into its tail, it's always going to be a little awkward at the transition point. You know what I mean? It has that kind of like, odd like oh whoa like kind of thing that also she does a cute little wake up. <laughs> then of course we've got everyone's favorite Digimon. Ever. Pretty good. That Rinomon might be from that one fighting G uh, GBA game, Digimon game. With a belly, that's very good. <laughs> yes. Honestly, I'm just, like Oral the Telvor always kind of has a crotch belly thing going on, which is always a little bit on the awkward side. Not necessarily the bad side, just a little bit awkward for some people. But again, not actually, it's then, still yeah, it's still very chaotic. A couple of inferior arenas, smaller, less detailed. Inferior so arenas. Just, <laughs> inferior. Well, they are. They are. That's also, true, they are. this one this one also has a different animation that we might see Wait, really? during the course of this. Um, oh, they, right, they if we wait they around. Pull a they pull out a Tommy gun. No, 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 they... shush, 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 shush. You don't, you don't fucking tell them. You don't, you, you, you wait for them to see it. <laughs> don't, you don't just spoil it. But we might be waiting for shush. like 30 minutes. We'll, we'll see it. It's not, t I think it's like, we'll see it. Don't worry. I think you interact with it and then you leave it alone and it'll do it. <laughs> Here's a plant. It, it has actually kind of a cute animation. It's panting. It's kind of adorable. It's like a big puppy plant. And then we have this thing that isn't a Nidoran female, but or a Nidorita, but it kind of looks like a Nidorita to me. Kind of looks like an off-brand Nidorita. Also, it seems to have transparent pickles where it's straight up blush, I just realized. Also, wow, that plant is noisy when it spits you up. Sweeks, please tell me nobody else heard that. <laughs> Tits is up as you walk by. and fight every impulse not to pounce straight now. Leans into your rubs, lay out a purr like noise. Twitch a little higher, please. <laughs> Not like it if you use both hands. Wait, you're gnaw? Gnaw was downstairs. Gently claps your hand and mouth when you rub before letting go. Sorry, I kind of lost it for a moment. You're not going to be the SKD that easily. I didn't say stop. Haha, <laughs> belly rub. Belly rub quote. Like when you're belly rub a wolf, you're like, you're not going to SKD me that easily, but also don't stop belly rubbing. Wait, are you seriously gonna just? Yeah, this is some good. There's some good quotes on this one. I forgot. Really not used to seeing a full view of everyone. Riff didn't scratch you with my teeth, did I? Wait, are you seriously just gonna jump down? Jump in? Okay, then. <laughs> just so you know, I'm not gonna repay the favor. I don't like being eaten. I'm so glad you agreed to be here. I agree to be here. You look delicious. Ah, geez, you're bigger than you look. Honestly, you're like I get used to this. A lot of good quotes here. <laughs> Do the animation. Look, we, we're, we, we'll come down later and we'll see if the we'll see if she, they've done it. It's fine. I'll have Toriel, everyone. Now the Undertale. Now the guy who mentioned Undertale is justified. This actually is a decent. Actually, is a decent animation. It is the dress. The dress riding up belly. That's very good. Yeah. That's very good. I'm down for that as long as it's, you know, it's always good when, like, clothing, clothing, clothing physics with Vor is generally a nice thing. I would definitely place Toriel in the S tier. And then we got, who the hell is this? Welcome to my darkness. Oh, thanks. This is, this is Fire Emblem. This is Tharja. She's a mage character. Oh, okay. Huh. And then we've got a couple of cheese, cheese wedges. Mm, you feel all soft and squishy. Is this his default dialogue? Can you feel your friend slowly just inside of me? Oh, well, we're gonna oh, skip that oh, line. Oh, 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 don't, don't look. Don't look, everyone. <laughs> There's always this. What the hell? Low health sound from Zelda? I am <laughs> what the hell? Oh, there we go. Goodbye. Uh, Sorry, what was that? Okay, so I'm gonna reiterate what I said earlier. A moment on my lips, a lifetime my ass. Well, I'm gonna reiterate what I said earlier. Rule yeah, this one's actually quite unique. It has. Or you can interrupt me while I interrupt re while I reiterate what I was going to say earlier. Thanks for that. <laughs> Anyways, give me a second. I want to reiterate what I said earlier. Text has different rules than video. For instance, 
Oh, by the way, uh, actually, I will interrupt myself for this reason. Uh, this. Th this is what we're talking about. I don't know oh. why this happens. There we go, yeah. She's just... She's got, like, something on her head, too? Like, or is that just really thick eyebrows? Uh, eyebrows. I think it's like a... Yeah. Okay, so... Yeah. Alright. She just kind of goes... So, to finish does. my statement, let me explain something to everyone. There's this guy on YouTube, right? He's been doing videos for two years where he covers Rule 34 games. And if you aren't aware what that means, it basically means he goes look, looks up uh, not-so-safe-for-work Flash games. And he, he, he does very silly playthroughs where he doesn't take them seriously and he just goes through them. And there's, those are YouTube videos. And he's never had his videos removed because he censors every visual element that at all matters to censor. So his videos are usually 90% just censor images, but when it comes to the text, he reads it all straight. And that's because when it comes to text and voice, while you can age rate your, while you can uh, age limit your video by discussing more, you know, explicit things, that's technically allowed. It's it's fine. It just makes your video a mature rated video. Not, not adult, but mature. Um, so, in that sense, uh, that dialogue we saw? So we might see some- look, there's a million lines for all these characters. We curated the hell out of this, but there might still be an occasional like, Oh, whoa, what's that line? <laughs> but that's okay, because again, it's just text. We're not seeing any visual issues. We've- we've definitely curated all the visual stuff. So if you see a spicy text line, well again, this is a- this is a mature raid stream. Not adult, but mature raid stream. It's a mature raid video, that's always the point of this, so. Oh, so it's worth knowing that when Cal is in this like, I'm gonna shoot you phase, you can't, you can't get the eating. Yeah. You cannot do the eat. Also, I should just extend this in general. You get unique dialogue. True. I should just extend this in general. If I'm doing furry stuff, like playing by the pound or doing some furry like for art or whatever, those are gonna be spicier streams. We might discuss some more mature topics uh, that might just happen. So if that bothers you, then don't attend the, the stuff that's more furry, the stuff that's more like playing by the pound and stuff. If, if it bothers you, just attend the, uh, more... Yeah, I have plenty of other stuff where I'm a lot more tame. Granted, I still have some mature conversations here there, because I just, you know... I talk my mind, and I, I don't go inappropriate, but I do talk my mind, you know. So, anyways. <laughs> that character over there might go inappropriate, but that's fine, whatever. It's not me doing it. <laughs> uh, Quarian bodies... Okay, these are more Mass Effect characters, I think. Yeah. If you do know what the rule 34 is, God help yourself. I think everybody knows at this point. I think it's just one of those things. Like, you're on the internet, you know. Say, you're the only one around, she says in a room full of three people. And three other characters aside from that. Uh, I so, think the same. I think this is the same as Starfire. Yeah, well, no, it's Starfire. different. It has a. It doesn't have the sheen. Um, also, Tifa from Final Fantasy VII. Yeah, and a nurse with very unethical um, practices. I mean, if it heals, I guess it's a healing belly, from what I can understand, so. I mean, it's furry, true, so probably. True, true. Yeah, yet, unethical or good free health care? I don't know. <laughs> then we have this character that is sitting down. They do be sitting though. Now I'm getting a massage from both sides. I'm trying to figure out what that means. <laughs> I think that means that she's rubbing the belly on the outside. And oh, the that makes sense. Or, or it, it also happens when someone else on the outside presses the E on them. So that's, it's kind of like implied that you're going in for a rub down too. We miss, we also disorganize these from smallest to biggest, but whatever. It seems so. I want a massage. I would love to give you some. But also, if, if, if you are uh, if you are of appropriate age and enjoy more mature content, I do recommend looking up Rule 34 Showcase on YouTube. It's like I said, they're legal videos. He did he did proper censoring on them. He just just keep in mind he reads everything straight out, so don't like play the video with the audio on around your parents. Probably <laughs> like the <laughs> probably the, why is there like hey if you hover over them why is there like this weird little halo thing to the right? I was going to mention. That. I think it's straight. I think it's straight. Some straight pixels. Odd. I mean, this, this one's the succubus. So. And then we over here we have weirdly compact superior. 
I don't know, something about it just looks kind of like... Yeah, I've got the same purse on the big one as the... with the flat belly. It just looks cut off. Yeah, again, I should... again, just remove a pixel at the bottom to, like, get that curve and it would have been perfect. I'm curious what you're talking about with the YouTube plugins. Again, they're easy enough to find. Like I said, only mature audiences, but it's not adult content because he does censor. He does very good censorship. But keep in mind, you know, sounds, text, they're, they're still there, so keep that in mind if you do see, go watch that. So here, we, here we've got Zinnia from Ores Omega Ruby Alpha Sapphire. Who? From what? Zinnia. Zinnia from, from Omega Ruby Alpha Sapphire. Okay, so you literally said Omega Ruby's Alpha Sapphire so fast to sound like, Omega oh Ruby Alpha Sapphire, sir. I was like, okay, what's that? <laughs> like, <laughs> Omega Ruby Alpha Sapphire. Enunciate! Oh, so anyways. No. <laughs> and then we have uh, this character. I think they did do something interesting. Yeah, Keep hands and feet inside the orb at all times. Orb teleport. Orb teleport for. Yeah. And over here we might have another familiar face. So this yeah. is a bit busy with someone else at the moment. Come back in a bit. And also, yeah, Tardy, which also she was sleeping as you know, and then she woke up. And then num. Tardy, yes, she is a she's somebody's character. Well, she's Tardy's character, obviously. To teleportation, get your goat. It's kind of amusing. A little lower, please. Wait, what was that? Put your hands on top of yours as you rub, gently guiding your hands. He. Don't blink or miss it. <laughs> ah, that's that's nice. A little lower, please. Feeling quite stretched today. Oh, that was the rest of the line. Yep. You enjoy yourself there? I am. Let's see, does Tari have lines? Tari's pretty quiet, actually. No, but she does have some nice idle animations. Let's look at them. Let's look, let's pay attention to those. <sighs> that dragon is tardy. Yeah, we were saying that. Hi, Car. Welcome that's, to the stream. The thing we <laughs> Welcome to the stream, Car. Glad you could join us. That's, that's words that we didn't need to say. You are correct. She does occasionally, if you pay attention to the belly, occasionally you'll see the belly bulges of somebody struggling or wriggling inside. That might require stepping out and going back in. Don't mind if I do. Wait, did you? Wait. Nope, okay. okay. Kind of look like you just poofed into her tail. <laughs> Suspect you tell out of that. <laughs> Oh, well, if... I, I tapped a key. Well, that, don't do that. <laughs> That's the one okay, thing you I don't will. do. Okay, okay. <laughs> also, Car, Car, I hope you're having a good day. They're tardy. Have they tried having a nap? I don't even get that joke. I don't even get that terrible pun. Okay, she won't do the- we, we did see the animation, just don't see it now. Maybe I have to interact while you're- No? Well, we saw it earlier, so it was- it was, it was covered. And, and then over here- to do a quick reset on someone that we know likes to disappear. Oh. That's fair. So here we have one version of the alien that is okay to show. <laughs> There's another version that has such- well, honestly- I guess the dialogue was about all the par with the, the random line that was said down there. Actually, it was no, it was worse. It was worse. Look, just the mention of the H word, that ain't so bad compared to what the other version of this alien does for a cat show. Let's just say she gets a, a little too descriptive for me. Honestly, again, I probably theoretically could show it given the Roll 34 showcase guy has shown, has shown worse, text wise. Um, but I have standards, right? So I, I ideally, I don't show that stuff. <laughs> And then more burps, but they're chubby this time. They get even chubbier. Yeah, a little chubby belly and a big chubby belly. Hmm. Also, what floor are we on, Epic? Why is my jump key not working? Okay, Don't mind the hungry looks my tail is giving you. You've got quite a squirrel thing here. Uh, not again. Also, move, move aside a little bit so we can see the full animation. Assuming, uh, 
You don't happen to know any good books to read. Let's see what The animation is having a little trouble there. Well, because you're going so fast, you gotta slow. Uh, not again. Also, that's another that's another type of Vor situation. The reluctant pred who has a tail that eats for them and Vor's things where they don't want to. <laughs> Speaking of tail, this one over here has quite a lot of it. That's Sekavita slash snake, and also why is there still rainbow tiles? Oh, God damn it, I thought I thought we replaced all those. They were hidden behind him all along. Not even that well hidden. There's also one up here. I think somebody just made a mistake. Oh, there's some up there too. Ah, but they're they're under the they're under the shelf though, so they can't be fixed. Yeah, right. they're on the platform. Oh, fair enough. I was like, why can't I fix that? Oh, whatever, it doesn't matter. Okay, to me. so this one's digestion. I thought we fix. I thought I. Oh no! Wait. Well. Oh right. That's right, because I have to choose between two colors. That's right. Also, we're about to leave the uh, this this set. But anyways, uh, Snake here has a has a nice mouth hold animation. Actually, yeah, charm, shoot me. You get your wish now. Go ahead. Oh, I could. I get to shoot you. <laughs> this is my wish, apparently. All right, hold on. Take, take out your frustrations. All that all that pent up frustration. Okay, there we go. Nope. Oh. Oh wait, no, hold on. I have to PVP. Yeah, that would help. Wait, I need. I also need to do it, don't I? You have to do it too. Yes. Yeah. Uh oh. We're in a party. We're in a party. True. Get into my party charm. I'm a little scared to break things now. Y'all switch the sword. Just use like the regular fire and not the old fire. I have sword. Okay, we're not in a party anymore. Do I, do I just have to leave this party, maybe? There we go. I'll leave, I'll leave this party. Okay, there we go. And now I'm okay. Ah! No, don't kill. Don't, 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 don't. Did I kill you? You almost did. I don't know how much of this animation we'll be able to see now. Might just go through all of it now. Yep, yeah, and then through oh. the tail. And he just kind of lies down on top of it. <laughs> There I am. Going down. Down, down. the tail. Down. So, Sekavius is a character, he's been around, a uh, person that's been around for a while on FA and stuff. He, uh, his thing is just the massively long tail that just, yeah. Snake Wildlife as well is their name, I think. Sekavius, Snake Wildlife. They go all the way down, just slowly getting smaller. Oh, is it X to switch hot bars? Thank you. And then disappear. And gone. Da. Now I have to. Also, no. Beer should appreciate the pause. There's nice pause detail in Sekavitas, too, technically. You're talking to him right now? Oh, that's cool. I haven't. I think a long time ago I may have had a like conversation with him, but. It's been a long time since, so. Or right, we could be party, I suppose. Or. If, if, if it'll make it faster, then yeah. I've just. On the planet now. So here's here's a couple agrons. One's shiny. That's the, that's oh, the difference. Beerus. Oh, Mala has decided you. Be Mala has decided to grace us after all. Okay. Are they going to join the call though? Because that's what they should do if they're going to join us. I I do recommend that. <laughs> X. Yeah, just, I was just told about the X thing. Thank you. So uh, also sixty viewers, we went up. Oh, I should call it out. That okay. always makes people leave for some reason. There we go. I appreciate I appreciate the Agron. I don't know. Agron's good. Agron is a good still type, but uh, not terribly complicated. But oh, I don't know. Is 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 Beerus gracing us or is he having trouble? Uh, Beerus. He just called yeah. me to call everyone again. I think. Oh, yeah, uh oh. For some reason. Hi, Lucario, you can just deny the call, you know, <laughs> if you don't want to join. That is an option. Yeah, I had to do that to join their call. Or if you don't want to be part of the stream, you can always just leave it too. You're welcome to attend, but yeah. I can't get Star Run to work. Oh, it's broken for you? Oh, right, it was. After just yeah. like a short bit of it working, it just broke for you. I remember now. Well, uh, I'm gonna need you to like invite me to a party because I don't have any uh, teleports on there. Okay. There we go. Oh, I briefly had a moth in my party and then I did it. Um, what floor are we on? That's a good point. 
But we have that. actually, yeah, that's actually a good no, point no, because we have too. now we have now concluded the basic furniture vor. Because these these creatures are technically furniture. Now we get to the more interesting stuff. So how many floors was that so far? Um, yeah, sure. I don't think I'll need to PvP again, so it'll make it easier. There's Mala, as you can probably tell, because he's a moth. <laughs> <laughs> 24. So that we have done 24 floors, and we've completed the first section. So, so now, now we're in a new section. Now we're in SPOVs. the SPOVs. SPOVs. What does that stand for? I do not know. I don't remember Here's either. So SPOVs are like more complicated furniture. Is that right? Like scripted furniture. Yeah. yeah basically. Kind of have to... So I will demonstrate. So here's uh So you actually you can't interact with them directly. You gotta you gotta make them do things. So stay in front of them. They no, they get they they're get curious. interested. Oh, oh there's rainbow blocks, there's rainbow blocks. Purge them, purge them. Okay, shush. Oh no. Just get eaten, shush. Looks <laughs> only missed though. I am. There's right always here. there's always some blocks we missed. This was originally all rainbow blocks, but we actually changed it to this color. So uh, no. there we go. Oh well, that's a. It's a bit of an awkward animation, kind of cutting my head off for a bit. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that's a good way to take out your prey really fast, I guess. And then yes, you can struggle, just... right, by pressing up, yeah. down, left, right on your. Massive... You can actually press buttons inside these ones, yes, and it yes, will instantly it's... get you out. There, there you so go. There's up, left. Right. And of course it makes nice sounds as well. Yeah. Which I hope everyone yeah. can hear okay. So, uh... Yeah, pretty cute. Also, if you're wondering why the animations are lagging, I'll tell you why. Mala, what you up to? <laughs> I'll tell you why. The, the animations are lagging because we have so much content on this planet that it's taken a little bit to process things. Not a big deal, honestly, though. As long as the animation still plays out, it's, I'm not really worried about it. We have put so much content in this, and then Blorp. <laughs> you took a second to give you back your legs. Maybe they have, like, a tell for animation or something if you stand behind. Probably not. I think it's just one animation for them. Yeah. But uh, that's that. And here's here's Candy. Uh, she's she's, a little bit of a problem. So she's a dragon, actually, but I think she's like a dog dragon, which actually I... My Shadoxid is a dog dragon, so you know, I'm down for that. So if you're wondering why is there why is there candy cane blocks? Well, so candy has this issue where if she just exists for a while, she'll randomly blip out of existence. She's still technically there, but she turns invisible and you have to remove her and then put her back down. So I put the candy blocks to remind me where she was, basically. <laughs> so she when she blips out of existence. Now she's not she's not that way because Blood went upstairs and fixed that, but also uh struggle out of mission? Yeah. A little bit of fun. Just mm -hmm. You'll have to wait and see. No, you're staying right there. Now, Blood, did we give digestion signs that these guys digest? Yes. Uh, I believe they digest. These are not digesting me, and if I remember... Oh, so I don't believe digest. They just trap you for a while. Yeah. Dog dragons are good. Dog dragons are very good. My Shadoxian is very good, but other dog dragons are good too, like Candy here. Shadoxian is the best. Hey, <laughs> come on. Oh. Pop. You're out. <laughs> now, it's worth, it's worth noting that this one's kind of, seems like a beta version, because I did have to press E to interact. This one doesn't automatically grab. It's just kind of... No, this is one of the only ones that you do interact with. Yeah. Get yeah. going. So the next now, swap, let's go... Whoop, whoop. Oops. Okay, that's fine. So this one has a door. The because reason this one escape. has a door is because this one wanders, so... They are free. To, they are. They want freedom. Oh nope, well. Um, so this is a. Paku, this is basically the same Paku as before, but like has a bit more going on. There's actually some really amusing things you can do with this thing. First off, yeah, he'll grab you if you're nearby him, as you just saw. You go. But yeah, he's a wanderer, so we have a door for him. His outline is technically also in the center of the room still. And I can indeed. I can did again. I can struggle multiple directions. So back. Down, forward, up. I like down. Squish. Oh, and eventually spits up. And he looks very. Oh, yeah. And there's one more amusing thing you could do with him. Uh, <laughs> if you stand on his head, he'll eat you that way. <laughs> I'm standing on his. You could just stand on him. If he sometimes he moves around, and you could just ride him like a like an enemy in Super Mario Brothers 2. 
<laughs> if I press down and then oh nope, I can't lift him up. Nope, can't doesn't can't pick that, him up. Can't pick him up from your head though. Doesn't have that feature, which is a rip, honestly. All right, get get away from him for a second. I want him to walk a bit so I can demonstrate I can stand on him while he's walking. This is kind of funny. He looks very satisfied with himself. There you go. See? Yeah, there we go. Except now you're probably going to be one way trip. Now you've got a good trip. Okay, Malo, let's just leave Charm to his to his fun. Just notice how oddly similar this is to SCP, SCP Containment Breach. Okay, you're gonna have to explain that one. How is this like SCP Containment? Oh, because we have them all. Because <laughs> we all have them in their own like partitions, like SCP. I mean, it's not wrong. I guess you have a point. Okay, this is a good one. SCP cast personnel. So this one, I like. I like how she hugs her belly and gets blushy. It's cute. And of course, struggle multiple directions. Up and oh. I think this one only has a couple of directions though. That's fair. Left and right. Left and right. It's a good point. We did kind of build like a above ground yeah. SCP containment facility. <laughs> Still cute though. Does she have any lines besides gulp? No? Okay. I don't think she's much of a talker. That's fair. I like it. Just a good raptor. Oh, good oh no! Raptor. Go through the door. What? Blood, blood, blood got through the door. <laughs> well, that's one way to ambush your prey. I was wondering if she could got... So this is a this is an interesting one. This is dibs on this one. This one okay. requires you to stand underneath it. This is of course noise Um, you're not staying in the right place if you want to be eaten. Jeez, line up, so silly. Go. So you just hang out for a bit. Get drooled on. And you wait. And you wait. And you wait. Just keep waiting. And just wait a bit. And then goodbye. But you lose your head and you float awkwardly as well. <laughs> and then, yeah. There you, you go. And then you get struggle. A little bit of hovering. So you move back a bit. Selena, we put there. I, I don't know if you've been noticing, but I tried to not overlap the sprites so we could see it. If I'd sleep with you inside, if you weren't this heavy, you know. <laughs> I always do my best. When, when it comes to showcasing lore and stuff, I try not to block it. <laughs> yeah. I, thought, I thought you said so you move back a bit, like getting him to start struggling. Oh, no. You just, like, don't overlap the sprite of the thing we were trying to observe, if, if ideally. If ideally what? Overlap possible. it? Don't get it? Don't get in the way of oh the animation. Okay, I won't. <laughs> I like that forward. I like that forward squish. It's quite. It's quite a quite stretch. This is quite a stretchy noivern. Remember, get all the squishes the squeeze. Kiki. Squish, squish, squish. Can you struggle now, or is it not working, Mala? Yeah, it's not a thing. It seems it, automatically. He's he's the noivern's doing the automatic squishing. That's another uh, thing. I, that's another thing. I, uh, what's that? I think this is what happens if you fail the escape. As oh, in, you like, can actually you struggled enough to get an escape, but it failed. Fair enough. So you can actually escape if you struggle enough. I like. I also like another thing. I really like is uh, I am fond of Orivor and then Blushy Pred, like Pred that is rather enjoying the Eternal Massage, as long as it stays platonic. I'm quite fond of that. I like. Also like a Pred doing this. Ooh, I so love this part so much. Like, just squishing belly against ground and stuff. Like, just... Yes. That extra bit of yeah, domination over the prey is nice. I like that part, too. Yeah, this part is quite nice. Pop, 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 pop. This is a good noiver, is what I'm saying. Yeah, why do you think I called dips on it? <laughs> <laughs> so, we, Molly, you gotta successfully get out of it, though. Because apparently that's a thing. No, I think I'm lagging too much to like struggle. Oh, no, oh, there we go. There we go. I'm also, cars. Oh, nice. It might end up be might end up as my bed one day. I guess that's why he was laying on you. How you oh, doing, car? His bed All right. Let's. Uh, so this one just this is silly. Speaking this is, of beds. This is a sleeping bag of sorts. Uh, if you just hang out in it, it's a bed. But if you hang out too long. So beds and starbell they heal you, but uh, if you hang out too long on this one, you can see a little bit of movement there. A little bit of noise, a little bit of movement. And a little bit more movement. Did 
That's good to hear, Kara. I'm doing all right. We keep waiting. How long does it take normally? We keep waiting. I'm not sure. I think that might be it. I thought it oh. went all the way, though. I think there oh. was a digestion version of this. I don't remember. Maybe it's the digestion version that does. Yeah. But if that's the case, why didn't I put up the? Why did I put up the digestion version? Want to check all that blood? I can go uh, see. I can check. Maybe you need to be closer. No, it's 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 already eats its Lita. It's it is reacting Lita. It's not completely swallowing. It's more like just kind of like just kind of having a little chew. Kind of just like kind of just doing I a little. I will need to borrow him for a sec. Nope. Belch. <laughs> oh, there he goes. <laughs> okay. Um, well, well, that's well, that's happening though. We've got another room up here, full of some very good dinos. Yes. These ones are very, very interesting because if one of them gets you... Oh yeah, yeah, watch what happens. Selena, do not press anything. Watch what happens. So, Dino eats. Dino has cute oh. animation. Dino will eat if you're in front of them, so keep this in mind. So, Selena, can you struggle? I actually don't know. Yep. But you can. So there's outward, there's upward. Fortunately, this swath can't be modified. Outward. Okay, there's... so it's just that way. Outward. Yeah. Outward. <laughs> and then... Wait, you moved. You sure weren't supposed to move. That's weird. But, uh... <laughs> so the funny thing here is that it once one lets you out, the next one eats you. <laughs> That's how... It's a fucking conga line of war. <laughs> well, that's the best kind of line. And you can also feed these dinos. <laughs> yes, well... I'm sure they'll... Oh yeah, we have a we have a kitchen up here for a reason actually. So the Yoshi but Sans egg, yeah. This is a uh, this is about as far as I'll go for content for now. So they <laughs> lick lips afterwards. I realized. I have to I have to move a little bit. I have to just take one step because they don't seem to be putting me in the right place. Weird way to handle leftovers, but sure. But yeah, this is a uh, this is about as far as I will have my content go generally. Um, because, yeah, a full tour is something I'm not going to be showing a ton of, but in this case I'll show it because it's, it's also, pretty limited. Worth, worth noting, if I don't struggle, they just they just have this cute little smile, but if I do, they just like, hmm? Mm. <laughs> they get uh, a very worried look. <laughs> yes, I like their worried look. With like... to, they're a bit unsure of themselves all of a sudden. Then, blip. Big red. <laughs> there we go. So obviously these guys don't have any different differences between them. They're all just different. They're basically they are basically Yoshi's though, because they have all the colors like Yoshi. They also have different names though. They do have that. They do have different names. Oh, How do you check that? The best oh, that's one. Right. You have to pick them up. That's that you would have to pick them up. Yeah, that's not worth it. Hold struggle keys for rubs. Hold struggle keys for rubs. Oh, really? Well, I'll do that with this purple one then. Hope you installed a shower in the tower. Ah, yeah, let's see. <laughs> Slate seems to be coming out relatively clean each time. Here, we'll go, we'll go back I mean, over to the shower and oh. the belly, kind of. There we go. I was going. I was just going back over so you could see Char. Oh, I was like, I thought you were done, so I was going. I see. You, apparently, they can miss. I didn't know that. You can miss. Bellies are the best bathtubs. Yes. So hold for so hold for rubs. I wonder if that works on the other spobs. We didn't try it. Okay, I'll, I'll hold out then. Oh, oh yeah. Hold. There we go. Make a little heart up here. Try different yeah, directions with the holding. Hold up. Yeah, it does. It does. It does the animation, but it, it's like a heart instead. I think I'm good. Try that with the noise on. Yeah, you guys, let me know if there's any others that uh, react to that holding idea. Hold in. There we go. <laughs> That's cute. I think holding out is my favorite though because obviously it makes the belly go warm. I do hope that nobody is bothered by the uh, full tour. But again, like I said at the beginning, disclaimer, this is a spicy stream. <laughs> so. No everyone is the only that's one that other one that does it. Okay. That's new, I just got uh feed altered by the Noivan. Oh. Eh? How did you do that, out of curiosity? I don't know, it just happened. He just flipped around and feed-alted me. 
Huh. I'm not sure I should show that. Depends on how... Depends on what you noticed, Mala. Yeah, it was just regular, like, going in there. I mean, like, how detailed would you say it was, is what I'm saying? I don't think it was that detailed, just him falling on me, you know? Well, what did stream? What do the stream goers think about seeing the cheeky results of that? This is epic spider circle. If it's uh, with you standing in a specific spot or something. It doesn't look like your rubs happen for Noiva. Oh, I've not been getting that in any of the others either. I mean, I, with with sprite with sprite art with sprite vor like this, I just kind of see this like Yoshi. That's the thing, guys. This is a bit weird, but. This isn't really any weirder than seeing Yoshi pop an egg out of his butt in, like, official Nintendo games, in my opinion. So, I don't know. Oh, did the massage work for the... Yeah, no, it didn't look like it did. There were okay. many parts. What makes Dino's more fleshed out, like, it was the first S pop. Fair, fair <laughs> enough. But, uh, okay, I guess now I gotta see about this, uh, feed alt, I suppose. Where where were you staying when it happened? Were you staying That's off the oh. Maybe it's just an RNG. Yeah, I think so. Very rare. Me, now you're lagging so much you can't get out. Yeah, I think it's hard could, for me. You know to get you out. could just warp to one of us, right? Uh, That's good true. point. I heard a burp. <laughs> Where's me getting up again? Go. Ah, uh, being to one of the so I can't walk directly to you. So if I just stand here, then? It just warp if you don't get it. Yeah, I think it's just... Also, hard. I'm pretty sure Noivern is supposed to be hanging on the ceiling, not randomly in the middle of the room. Yeah. <laughs> I just realized yeah. that. <laughs> yeah, that was the normal version. Don't know how I got the Alton up, but... I'll try. I feel like maybe it depends on standing position. Were you moving yeah. at all when you were doing it? Uh, I was just standing in the regular position. Oh. Oh, there, there you go. go. Yeah, it looks like it's standing slightly off center. Oh, yeah, that was. That animation was fine. There's no harm with that. Yeah. <laughs> I'm glad I went to recheck the Noivan now. Oh dear, you're fat. I mean, you're quite filling. What were you about to say? You're fat? <laughs> huh, I can't seem to struggle. Oh, now I can. I'm now struggling with Noivan's prey hard. It was like slipping a letter to a mailbox. That's a nice way of putting it, because that doesn't sound wrong. <laughs> <laughs> so is the sleeping bag edited or something? Oh, none of the others did anything else. I guess I may as well make my public video opinion on this known since we are experiencing some of it. I don't think I don't think things like full tour and uh, feed alt as we're calling it now are inherently like sexual. Some people might view it that way, but honestly, I just see it as a means to an end, quite literally. It's like, yeah, how do you get the belly? Two ways. I don't know. <laughs> Sometimes, anyways. <laughs> that being said, you won't see much of that content. This is probably a rare occasion that you'll see this content on this particular video. And if it age restricts my content, that's fine. I don't know. If it age restricts my video, that's fine. I cannot get out of you, can I? <laughs> You can just beam quick, we've got a party. Also, I'm kind of surprised he doesn't full tour as well, then. Given, well, given he's proven to be stretchy. <laughs> yeah, I guess it's not lag, but just Noivan's hard to struggle out of them. Hey. Whenever oh he does God. have belly squish, that's a failed skip attempt. I don't know how to teleport to a per person, actually. You just gotta beam to your ship and then you can do it. Oh. Yeah, but Oh, I see. I see. I see. Okay, I'll see that then. <laughs> oh, epic. Some people might think it's crappy. Preferences, I suppose. What the fuck ship is this? Oh, it's your ship. 
I was like very confused for a minute. Yeah, my ship has been upgraded. <laughs> Hello. And yes, now that now that you're back over here, we can show off that indeed throwing meat to the. Oh yes. Oh. If you throw it correctly. But uh, yeah, I'll, I'll throw it to the Too black close. one because that's okay. probably the one I can reach. There we go. Just throw meat to him, and he goes um no. Um, um. <laughs> and, to, and to the green one, I'll let him eat right out of my hand. Come here, boy. Oh yeah, he does that. Come here, boy. Got something for you. They won't eat you unless you don't hold food for them. Oh, or nope, they just they just decided to. Have I guess he was instead. just very hungry. I mean, he got both that way, so fair enough. <laughs> no, I, I still have the meat. The meat is mine. Actually, no. Did he? I think he did eat one. And, and also <laughs> me. Okay, I, I'd like to get out though because we do have a showcase to get to, friend. I like how the other one's just munching happily away on the meat. Yes, I think if they're too hungry, they will not eat out of your hand. Oh, that might be why then. Okay, then in that case, just take, take this. So, you might be able to feed the black one with your hand. So, this is where we're getting the meat. Also, these are these are just a couple of the like stations to like... You can put pills in the spawns to modify what they do or how they what the effect they have and stuff. I, we have these machines up here mostly because they're just kind of amusing. Like the swab enhancer here is just. If just a little bit of maw move. move. <laughs> Decoration. Yeah, it's, it's like a it's like a maw. Dog chess. And a tongue Stuff keyboard. Like tongue keyboard. It's very silly. It's this one. Oh, other foods that don't actually work, but we have other foods here because why not? <laughs> oh, it, it's just a fridge full of bacon. Oh yeah, there was the there was the gift fridge that we made for you, Charm. It's got bacon, it's got bacon pancakes. Oh. It's got bacon. Why is this one burping? Uh, I just fed him. Oh, fair enough. <laughs> Alright, moving on to... Let's go over here first. How do you keep... I swear, Selena, how is it that we always think at the very same millisecond to hit the damn switch? <laughs> Alright, so here's some griffins. There's a whole bunch of colors to these guys. They're sleepy. They can be... Be, wo boy. be woken up. Nope, I don't think he. I don't think he enjoyed being woken up. He just <laughs> went back to sleep when I was half. But now you. But you look. You compare the two. You compare the sleepy ones. There's a belly on that one now. It's very good. Yeah. And you got some some bulges. Wake up! No, come on. Some very lazy boys. They're very lazy. I can't think. I'm pretty sure they can wake up. Oh, there's that one waking up. There we go. This one's having a stretch. I know for a fact these guys have several animations. We do have more of them to the left. On um, the Griffins? Yes, because oh. you got the different color variants. Yeah, I know that. They're already awake. Oh, really? I'm looking at Slea's struggle though, because that's good to look at. Oh, got spit up. I can't even get this one to do anything. This one's so lazy, it just won't do anything. Um, oh, there we go. I, I thought I was unable to move for a second. <laughs> this one's so lazy, it won't do anything. Lazy bones, hey. He's too fat to move. Oh, oh. Well, stand in front of the witch one, actually. Or, actually, let's go over here, I guess. I'll pass that in front of which one. It's fine, I'll do it. <laughs> I really can't wake that one up. Huh? That one just does not want to wake up. Yawn. Have you tried catnip? They're griffins. <laughs> They're not cats. I'm the kind of cat birds. Also, how dare? I know by stream apparently at some point drops 600 frames, which isn't that many, honestly. Oh, what's he doing? Oh, oh there oh. he is. Oh, there goes my head and my whole body. <laughs> You're kind of just existing behind it there for a bit. Yep. Uh, no, I'm here. Try holding down, holding down the button to see if it massages. I guess. No, no massages here. Fair enough. They're kind of acting like cats. I, I guess they are actually kind of yeah. Okay, I guess griffins are part feline, aren't they? Technically? No, I like that up struggle. It's the uh, part lion, I believe. Yeah, so. Back. And I'm out. 
On the next floor, on the left here, we have a couple more griffins. Obviously, they do the same thing, but here's a couple other cars to look at, if you're curious. But um, over here, we have this guy. Want to hop in my maw after a nice way to cool, for a nice way to cool off after a victory? So I think it's other quotes. But belly. <laughs> can I struggle this one? Yes, I can. Any belly. Oh, okay. Speed me up already. That was actually pretty fast. <laughs> He has other lines. Blink, whenever you say that, you really. Oh, burp. Does someone know Jess? No. Okay. No, but it can be quite a. My stomach oh, is quite comfortable, yeah. I heard. Hope you can. Hope you agree, Ken, yeah, with that. Hope you agree. Actually. Hope you agree, Ken, with that. What? <laughs> If you remember, this is one that was an absolute pain to escape from, so I modified it to be easier. All right, this one does not let you go otherwise. And I mean, to be fair, Charm, it is a feral dinosaur. Its English isn't perfect. I mean, fair, fair enough. Uh, when you said feral, I heard you say that's a farewell dinosaur. Is that a dinosaur that just keeps leaving? Doesn't stick around. Farewell enough. <laughs> Yeah, you can modify both these to have digestion, though. I don't know if that changed their animations, if any of them. It does change um, one of them, remember. It's a little embarrassing for you. Is it a little embarrassing for you knowing that I love having you stretch my belly out? <laughs> <laughs> oh, also, I think it, I saw in the kitchen that this guy has a special pill that we probably can't show on. No, screen. I know. We already tested it. Yeah, yeah. That one did something, for sure. Yeah. Also, easier to escape, huh? Okay, see you in a thousand years. I'm tomorrow. actually noticing, like, if I struggle backwards, it's not letting me up the throat, which is kind of appropriate, I suppose. I have to struggle towards the throat to actually get out. Nope. Or Too bad you not. can't get backwards, then. <laughs> I think you should have took your escape when you had the chance. <laughs> Perhaps. I'll, I'll get out, don't worry, just hold on. Due time. Struggle up. I am struggling up. Kind of. There. I'm out. There we go. Hey there. S looking for somewhere soft and comfy rested? Yeah, but not ideally for five years. Um, uh, Dr. Beeper, uh, this dinosaur does have something with two pills, which is digestion and a special pill for him. But due to the nature of it, we can't show on stream. Yep. Also, here's the dinosaur. Also, we are now officially in the big boys section. As yes, we have we have now it. reached section three, big boys. These boys be big. They're basically just spavs that were too big for the normal room size, for the most part. This guy barely fit, but these these aren't these aren't spavs. Uh, struggle. Um, none of these, these are spavs. spavs. They're all just furniture. These are just, these are oh, just big furniture. right, these are not spavs. Okay. Still cute though. That one's nice and big, and also. And we'll see the animation with this one because there is one. Yes, I know he does something. There we go. Mm -hmm. That's what he does. That's nice. That's, that's, not, that's not the end of it. He'll do a little bit more. Why don't we roleplay a little? I'll play the Hungry Raptor. You can play the goat. Why a goat? <laughs> the goats are tasty. I guess. <laughs> I think it's a reference to Jurassic Park. Oh. Oh, fair enough. Nope. That would be all the animations for that one, I think. Uh, there is actually one more. There is there? there is Keep holding out. Eventually, if he rolls over again, we might see it. If he rolls over again, please. Actually, I think I remember what you're talking about. <laughs> Should I get the Let's... elevator music? <laughs> okay, there we go. Now he's rolling over again, so maybe we can see it. Ah, oh, do the thing. Okay. 
know what it is that you try to catch the leader. <laughs> Wasn't it a belly nuzzle? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, we gotta, we gotta see it. That's It's a showcase for a reason. You spoiled what it was, but yeah, we gotta see it. I, I actually couldn't remember. Is this map downloadable? Um, the simple vor mod show the simple Starbound simple vor mod is a mod that also has a bunch of mods off shoot off shot from it. You can download all of them. Oh yeah, he also has that little little side that did there just now. Uh, you can download all of them. I'm not gonna link them because some of the content is MSW. We have yes. limited to we have limited to just the safe for work slash and and slightly spicy stuff. So yeah, I think what they were meaning. I think it's term he didn't ask about the mods, he asked about the map. Um, no, this is a map that we've actually made ourselves. Um, Lucard, Blood, Walla, Charum, myself, and Dragon Cat. Yeah. Um, I don't know if there is a way to download maps in Starbound or like share. I the world. think there is, I think I've seen something like it before. I could quickly look up for you now if you like. Okay. That could that I could guess. be nice because I actually I intend to I want to get this map myself or this world myself so I can keep using this Fair. after the fact. Um, you know what? Let me put it this way. Our content rain is definitely PG-13, but this is still tamer than the G-rated film Watership Down. <laughs> if you guys remember that. I'm sure the blood knows what I'm talking about. There ain't what was that? Sorry? It doesn't seem like there's a single British kid that doesn't know about that movie. Watership Down. Ah, yeah. I was just saying, like, you can judge my content all you want, but I'm less. I always will put up less graphic things than that G-rated film did. Oh my god! By the way, that was G-rated. Not kidding. There it is. There's the belly nuzzle. Took a while, but we got it. It's cute. It's not very. It's brief, but it's nice. Shows shows a doting pred. Ah oh, yes, another one from uh, that one game, Fromage. Why is it named Fromage? I just realized like, I don't know why. <laughs> so snake, snake. So this is a this one digestion only because, or this one because, if you don't have it digest, all it does is coil you, as, as you see right now. If you want it to actually eat you, it has to hurt you. Yeah, it squeezes you and eats you when your health is low. Mm -hmm. Quite nice, I must say. Nothing like being squeezed by a few coils. <laughs> Good to know the balls also in the stinks. No. And you go from coils to bulge. There is a way to share maps, but it's a bit finicky. Okay. You would have to know the coordinates of this planet and look for the file itself that has the planet. That sounds like something that I can't do easily, because I don't... Again, it's a miracle I even got the stuff set up, because I am not good with Starbound. Yeah. Thank you. So, if people are wanting this map, we'll just put a pin in that idea yeah. for now. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so that, uh... That's those two. Now, uh, next up... We have uh, Ruby Stoot, I think is her name, who is like a mecha dragon. She's like, actually, if you see here, this is like exhaust port she's got and stuff. Um, she has a few animations. There you go, see exhaust ports. So she's like slightly robotic, but not like completely. Hi, Sinkika. How's it doing? All right, so if I eat, if I get the eats. Pretty good animation. A few stray pixels, I noticed, but I believe a she a, is a, a furager. So, what's that? A little bit of a neck bulge too, where she goes down, kind of rubbing at that collar. She's good. She does a few animations too, so let's, let's witness. Neck bulge going past collars and stuff are really good. Good night. Oh, she's <laughs> sleeping you off. Do these work as beds? Honestly, most of these are furniture, so most of them work as chairs. Ah, nice bulges there. They do technically work as beds and then they do yes. heal you. Like simple four mod too. isn't... Yeah, honestly, like, good luck trying to find all the mods associated with the simple four mod, too. 
And even the simple war mod is a little weird. It, it's honestly not the best title for it, because it makes it sound like it's easy to install, but no. <laughs> The grand certain amounts of Jin are like, I'm installing this. Oh, I crashed my entire game. Oh, I deleted my save. Or corrupted yeah, my save. That happened to me, like, multiple times over the course of... Selena actually corrupted her save while we were working on this project. Which made me aware I, that I, if I, if, if if I blood, had corrupted, it, that would have lost I the whole world. Yeah, you know, blood, yeah. Also, Selena... Selena egged me. <laughs> Because there is player-to-player -player interactions, and we're not doing those because of several reasons. The main right. reason being, yeah, those. Oh, please, what is? But uh, so she 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 made me an egg, and then she disconnected while I was an egg, and then I was stuck as invisible forever yeah. until she re-egged me, and then I was fine again. But literally, day, everything I tried did not fix that. So the day after that, when I tried to log in, my own character corrupted when I went off this planet. Second. Okay, so when she's not doing Vor, I think she could still lay down. Which is a different animation. It's a fascinating story out of context. Honestly, a lot of stuff I say is generally interesting out of context, I suppose. <laughs> Alright, so somebody pay attention to see if she lays down. I don't know if she does or not. I can't remember. Uh, when she's not eating something, I mean. Yeah, because you can see the dinosaur down there as well. They're also. Oh, yeah, the dinosaur. Look, look at this. Di look at how this thing sleeps. This is adorable. I love oh, the I neck. The door. neck thing is very bird-like. That's, That's how, adorable. How they, how they tuck down. Your fat neck is the best pillow. That fat neck is cute. They're awake. You're stuck. Alright, so this is another person's character. I don't remember their name. This is Zonetti. Zonetti, that's right. And uh, several animations of this one too, I believe. Or maybe not, I don't know. Let's give it a little bit to see. Oh, there's a little something going on there. I've seen it that day thing, but moving just took me out. Fair yeah, enough. Maybe. I'll try. Remember, these, these are furniture, not... Yeah, but some of the furniture... Again, though, the other... Like, the dinosaur is furniture, too. Keep that in mind. It has a lot of animations. True, but... Yeah, that one just seemed like it wasn't really doing anything. Oh, it's... There, a little, little tail wiggle. Tail. You were wrong. See, yeah. there is. There, I was right. There are some animations. Just give it a second. Very slight. I think it's like. I think some of these are like tied to RNG. Like every so many ticks. There. See. Look at. Ah, oh, yeah. <laughs> Belly bulges, wriggle it about, and then a, a heart sigh. That was good. I like that. Um. So, I think some of these are based on like RNG. Like every a hundred game ticks, chance of animation. And if not, I'd do it another 100 ticks and then give it another chance. Fair enough. I think that's how it works. Um, aren't we all furniture in our own home? I mean, if you ever had somebody sit on your lap, I guess you're furniture now. <laughs> <laughs> or sit on other places that I won't say. It's I remember the most warped story about... God damn it, Selena. <laughs> remember, there was a story, of, actually, of one person who had a strange addiction of being furniture. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I still remember... Oh. R Ruby hasn't slept yet, but they did just do a little steam puff animation. Yeah, they do that sometimes. That? Yeah. yeah. Also, I think that might be all the animations for... Zamboni. Yeah, there's nothing wrong with being furniture. Inanimate TF happens for that reason. Speaking all right. of furniture... Okay, so everybody... Wait, no, no, don't, no, hold on. Aha! <laughs> <laughs> so uh when i say when we have big when i said we had some big boys i meant it um i mean that's more of a big girl it's true i guess vicar amelia <laughs> yeah she's very, she very big Bloodborne. admittedly though cool character i have to say the only the only concern i have is that when she eats when she eats you, you suddenly become big enough to like make a pronounced bulge in her belly somehow. Like she macro sizes all of her prey. I mean, I mean I'm not complaining. That's my feeling. Yeah, honestly, sure. not complaining at all. Yeah, why wouldn't he make your prey? Now bear? the thing is, I wish that this was comp like scripted in such a way that you could have multiple people get eaten by her. Yeah. Because there's plenty of room for the belly to get big. Like, I, 
I feel like you should make this value way bigger than even this if you had enough. What's that? Forty eight is basic furniture. True. This is this is also a, di a digestion one. Uh, we don't have a sign here. I'm really I'm. Oh yeah, digestion. Is it? It is digestion. Yep, oh, we don't have a sign. I have, look at my health bar. True. I guess we'll see what happens. But uh, yeah, I'm really impressed. Whoever spry this, like seriously, quite a bit of uh, quite a bit of work here. The Even pulse good too. She's got Just a couple of animations. Good. The what? Just look at the big claws. They're nice. They are nice claws. Of course, that's where Beerus is looking. I want to see the not for Why sprite. Why would I look anywhere else? They're the best part. The not for sprite was, well, you saw it, but you'll see it again after Slater digests. She also has a non-digestion version. Yeah, it's just less animations, technically. Also, about a half an hour until I have to go for my festivities. That's fine. Uh, to, like, though your attendance action. would be useful for slaying, it's also not necessary because I planned ahead. Unfortunately, there's just I really can't like change that. That's right. You never made <laughs> well, clear what you were actually doing thing, today. You know? I mean, you were always vague, so I wasn't really sure how long you would be around. I, I did say that my festivities were starting around 4:30. So Fair. Four is when I need to go and actually have a shower, not be a gremlin, etc. Also, I'm surprised how slowly she digests. You consider how big she is. <laughs> Selena is dying though. You can see you can see Selena's half bar to the left. If she makes you the prey bigger, then that's more to digest. I mean, it's true. I don't think she's going to do anything like for a full digestion. It's just furniture, but. Yeah. <laughs> Epic said, Beerus may, Beerus may be the only the one person that you could say they tend to look at what's below the waist and it's not be lewd. <laughs> 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 yeah. Yeah, there is Wait, a, there no. is a digestion animation. I was right. Yeah. Oh, there, there we go. It's nice to see the Vor for her because she's so emaciated normally, like, being a Dark Souls character. Yeah. She's, she's some meat on those bones. So that is all the big boys. So the next category here is the side room here, furniture, and furniture is mostly just furniture. Um, let me turn this on. There we go. Can I See, turn off the view? Well, hold on, yes, wait, wait, wait. wait. Uh, it's a multiplayer bar, but it is a little unstable. Um, let's be quiet for a second. So this saw here... ...is from Fromage as well. The war game that I can't play on stream. So are the slugs underneath it. What? What? This is just silly. I'm having fun with this. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> We're all just fine without. <laughs> well, technically speaking, Amelia's room takes up basically like two floors, and there's a normal floor up there. Actually, more like three floors. You know, Amelia's room counts as three floors, and then there's a normal floor up there, so you can count that however you like. Alright, so. Uh, Remember as well, Charm, you can't interact with the thing on the end. Yeah, uh, don't worry. That's The biohazard sign was there to remind me anyways. Oh, so here's right. a Vort. This is a Vort 10. It's like... It's like a, it's supposed to be like model like a belly. You can sleep in it. It kind of, um, kind of inverts the color. So, or like dark actually, everybody, do me a favor. Walk over here. I need Because there's only one way to interact. So the chess character, right? Can't, can't They're actually a vendor. They sell some things I can't show you guys on stream. But I still include them here. For a non-interactable element? Okay, we need to stand a little further away, actually. Get over here. If you stand far enough away, they change what they're doing. They have to, like, think you're gone, basically. I'm gone. Go away. How far away do we need to be? Maybe if we turn the lights off. <laughs> Maybe if we fall down the ledge. Alright, so let's actually let's go to the opposite side of the... Yeah, go over here. Get a little preview of the skyway. Yeah, there's a skyway over there. Yeah, I've not seen that yet. Okay, that That's probably. New. So the chest is normally closed. When you approach it, the shop op opens up, and uh, there's a few different animations that can happen. So sometimes she comes out with a nice fat belly, as as good. you see here. If we stay, if we stick around when she has the fat belly, she does do a few animations too. 
Because obviously, uh, if you can't tell, this is Vor. Now, you might wonder, what, what did she, who did she eat? Well, I'm gonna back up. <laughs> It's like, are you gonna get a fucking magnifying glass? I'm like, expect it. Like, you're so close. Yeah. <laughs> I'm close look, you know? <laughs> Just watch better look at the paws. Yeah, I can't look at the paws since they're inside, so I've got to get closer and see them. So I believe she only has this one animation when she's, uh, more bellied. Um. Yeah, she gives for a little Let's see it one more time. Let's see it one more time, just to make sure of that. Okay, it's a good animation, but uh, all right, everybody to the opposite side of the building. Everybody out, 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 out. Because there are, there is another thing that can be done with that shot, but we have to get it, the RNG to agree with us. Actually, I would just stay here until I trigger it, so that'd be faster. Oh, she didn't actually go away yet. All right, hold on, I have to wait a little longer. See, if I wasn't zoomed in so much, I could keep an eye from a safe distance, but I can't do so right now, because I zoomed in for the viewer's pleasure. Oh, come on. <laughs> She's still... Alright, I just need to give it more time. Wall, Selena. Aggressively bounces. Selena, out. actually against the wall would be probably good. Thank you. <laughs> I'm on the wall, I can't be anymore. I don't remember, I don't remember what distance is required. It's really hard to tell. Alright, I'm gonna... Yeah, I'm gonna give it a check. There, Damn it! Questions. She is being incredibly picky. Actually, I'm just gonna go up here. There we go. I mean, she should. She really should. Come on. I'm gonna look at the Maybe if we put down a few floors. That would probably help. Probably. Oh, she went away. I, just, I kept. I kept an eye from. The, I can keep an eye from the edge. All right. So, uh, so if we uh, if we make her pop out. Uh. There we go. Okay. Stop doing the. I know the vor belly is nice, but we want to see the other animation, dude. Yeah, I also, think it's a certain amount of time away from them cause them to go. We have reached 666 feet alt, oh my goodness. <laughs> oh good, go. finally Sorry, we got to that number. Nicely done. That means you're forever cursed with feet alts, I don't know. Alright, there! Now she came out without the vor belly for once. Alright, so, when she's like this, there's a few other animations that can play. Also, turn the lights back on. Whoever turned oh, yeah. them off. Like, okay. I swear. Every, if one person is right for the switch. All right. <laughs> you guys could not coordinate with switches. So uh, if we pay attention here, so there, there we go. Here's a bunny. Here's a bunny. This is this is almost undoubtedly who she eats. <laughs> now there's another animation from bunnies out. That. I think they're having tea. A little spot of tea. Just a little tea. Yeah, they look like teacups. Tea, tea. You know, tea, tea and biscuits, except for the bunny's the biscuit, I guess. <laughs> I wonder if that bunny is actually named Biscuits. That's a good name for a bunny, so it could be. Anyways, I think that's all the animations there. I mean, bunny biscuits are kind of biscuit. So up here we have, um, first off we have a shark that's also from Fromage, I believe. And here we have a jar of micros. You can eat I them. I don't think the shark's from Fromage. No. They, they scream when you eat them because they don't like it, I guess. But they don't like it. I mean, it's an honor to get eaten by the booth. And then down here we have another sleepy bag. This is actually just a normal one. This doesn't have the scripting. But yeah. it's just a... Uh... Yeah, get those Z, Z, Z. We have a couple orbs here which are vor related somehow, but I don't really understand how. Like, one's like... But they have the vor and digestion tags. Ah. Oh, they're like the tags things, but they're just like fancy versions? Yeah, these were before the tag things were about. And then if Selena hops off that because I didn't actually go over it yet. That's a tug chair. It'd probably be always wet, but otherwise probably comfortable. This is the most uncomfortable experience of my life. And then this chest. This chest is, uh, oh yeah, so blood is in the, uh, did you lose your clothes? <laughs> Apparently so. <laughs> I just like realized, like, you don't have clothes on. Well, I guess you shouldn't roast something with clothes on. It's okay, though, because these convenient ropes provide censorship. I mean, I mean they are not that you would have... Not that the... I'm naked, I'm fine, don't worry about it. I like how I'm the only one that... Oh, actually, no, Molly doesn't have clothes either. 
Yeah, look, look we don't not. look. If there was a collar, I'd wear it, but there isn't. So the only clothing I care about. Um, sort of so this blue collar. this chest is actually, if you look at it, it's a mimic. <laughs> so uh, it just works like a normal chest, but no. <laughs> so um, there's a cookie jar here, which is just a cookie jar, and then we have this this cat here, which is actually a sofa <laughs> you could sit on. And actually, she has animations too if you stick around. Oh, really? I'll yeah, see. I don't know. Oh, you said you wanted I'm... a collar. Do you like it blue? Oh, there's collars? Uh, the Lycan Tribal t shirt is a collar and wristbands. What? I probably should have noticed this. Uh, God damn it. <laughs> this just goes back to what I said earlier with Belly's well, this is, being this the best. On, this is how it looks on females. I don't know if it's any different on male, well, but. Give it to me, I guess? You know, Blood and Molly, you better put it back up so I actually pick it up this time. <laughs> there you go. Because <laughs> you know, throwing is only one range. Come on, let me... Okay, I have to put it in my inventory before I do that. And then I have to throw it. <laughs> no, wait. Oh, I'm... That's, what I'm... That's what it is. I'm sitting. I cannot be thrown while I'm sitting. Okay, also, stand over here because I think the animations only happen when, uh... When you're not sitting. Oh, really? When you're not sitting, yeah. Just watch the cat while I figure out where this collar went. It's already on you. You oh. have a blue collar and uh, wristbands. I guess that's fine. I don't really care for the wristbands, but I'll take the collar. Good puppy. Good pup. Good pup. So the cat, if you wait around, and it actually wants to do it. It's a matter of time. Goodness me, why isn't it doing this? <laughs> yeah, we'll move on and see if... Well, I mean, I was, I'm hanging out next to it so I can... We can keep, oh, oh, there's one. Okay, that was actually a new one. I didn't know. Okay, so it is a boar. Actually, I didn't know it was, it was actually boar or not. So, uh, okay. Both of, okay, those both are our new animations. I only ever saw one animation that we haven't seen still. But there's a couple, okay. So where's the, uh, there's one more that's a little bit longer and more complex. You've got a vibe with this charm. Summon the animation. Should we have a cat nap while we wait? Look, when it comes to waiting on a cat, you wait on the fucking cat till the cat's fucking good and ready. That's how cats work. I'm having a... Beerus went to sleep. Blood's getting roasted. I like how Blood is crying, by the way. <laughs> I like how Blood is crying a, a horizontal teardrop, which is good. <laughs> Cries horizontally. <laughs> now you're crying. You just you just cry for a while afterwards too. And Ball is upset well, for some reason. Well, if you can get you can emote. All right, so pay attention to the cat, everyone. We're gonna check out the chocobo though. So this is a chocobo. I get a sad face. That's funny. This chocobo is also a chest. You can also put items in him. Um, I'll demonstrate, actually. He has a few items right now, like these bones, which he, uh, quote-unquote generates. Uh, let me take the bones. So has got some rotten food, because somebody was mean and gave him rotten food. I'll give him some seeds, because, you know, it's kind of like I, I think I gave him fresh food. And then so, it... when you feed this chocobo, um, sometimes when you feed this chocobo, something happens. When you, sometimes when you store stuff, you know? So, I'll just store some stuff, and we'll see what happens. Sometimes when you take it out. I'll give him a frog. Actually, no. Put, put a frog in the belly. Put, give him a falling rock sign. And give him a number five. And I'll give I'll him... I'll give him some stuff, too. I'll give him a pick. Oh, station. Hey, 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 now. Hey, now. Let me do it. I want to do it. Okay. Give him the executive light. I'll give him... I'm just giving things I don't need, honestly. <laughs> this leaf if bundle. If anything should be faster, and so you don't have to drag over. Actually, oh, yeah. So. If you just click and if you just click and click on the same item, it should do the same thing. I don't need these lockers. I don't need these lockers. I'll keep those. It's good. This is a good time to just get rid of some items. Um. I'll need... Just object four. <laughs> oh, the kit the kitten wagged their tail too. They flicked it a bit. Oh, they did? Oh, I didn't even see that. It was just a little short tail flick. Yeah, you can also see that I have a little sad. Actually, face let me let me move the menu so we can actually see the cat. 
So pay attention to the cat as I do this. So it's all it's all RNG. I'm putting items into the chuckle book, and eventually we'll see something happen. Now, granted, I could easily just take items in and out, which I think I'll start doing actually. Because basically, just there's a rare chance when you put an item in that something happens. And given what we're doing, I assume you can assume. I assume most there it is. Here we go. <laughs> Goodbye, Right now, now, there we go. If I turn off admin. Oh wait, I was already off admin. Never mind. The thing is, you can't actually escape from that though. So. Um... But I can digest. I can digest. Now let's pay. Now, first off, can I just say I love this fucking fat joke about? It's just. Here, let me see if I can access. I can't access the chest and pull you out. Sorry. I figured it'd be funny if I was just in the chest now. It'd be funny right. if you were just an item. So there is still okay. So the cat did a tell flick at one point. We didn't see it on stream because I was blocking it. But it also did the animation that you were looking for. It did. Oh well, let's keep an eye. So I'm gonna just while we adjust the chocobo, pay attention to the cat too. But yeah, the chocobo is good. Fat chocobos are good. But um, <sighs> the cat's being very well. Of course, it does the animations. When I, of course, it did the animations when I wasn't looking, basically. Such is the way of things. This Chocobo is taking a while to digest me, but also I have another status effect. What is this? Digesting and being savored. Yeah, it's well, taking its toll. That's how it works, I guess. That's why it's a slow digestion, I guess. Oh, but their own bulges have shown up on the Chocobo, too. Look, sometimes four is a waiting game, guys. Can't expect the belly to just instantly gurgle. I mean, instant digestion is pretty nice at times. Do you think Charm became the big boof? <laughs> he had to work for that. <laughs> Those pounds are, are effort. <laughs> Not a so, solo effort, though. There were many meals involved. There! The cat did it! Yeah, so anyways, it looks, you know, does a cat-like leg, leg lick. That was the other one. I guess there's also a tail flick animation, but that's minor. I just mainly wanted that one to show up, so I'm glad that showed up while we were waiting. Hi, hi again, Hyper. Honestly, Hyper, I, I I don't mean to make you feel bad or anything, but honestly, I have trouble telling you if you're around ever, because you tend to disappear and reappear. Thanks for telling me you came back, though. How you doing today? He just appeared earlier to cut firewood. Oh, that's uh, fun. Makes sense. Oh, do you have to sense. do that to, like, for a wood burning stove? Oh, Guan would sympathize with you, my friend Guan. He has to do that. <laughs> So anyways, this, I like this joke, though. It's it's a very good chest, nice big chest, but it always carries the risk of just killing you because it wants to eat you. <laughs> so it's kind of a fun... I like that I, I mechanic, uh, in a way. That's Sorry. an acceptable risk. <laughs> Goodbye, Charm. I'm close. I'm, cl I'm not quite there, but I'm close. It's okay, Hyper. I forgot about the wood thing. I think at 1 HP, don't you just have to leave for it? 10 years. Oh. Oops. No, I can't leave. I think it just... Let's see. What was that sound? I heard like a that was, whoop. That was like that was my energy, energy bar. Oh. And... Oh, maybe I do have to leave. Yeah. Like, escape or something. Or press E. I don't remember. Do you remember, Blood? I thought you said you can't get out of this one. I think um, press, press E. I think it just killed you at some point. I think it just takes a bit. I mean, I'm at, I'm at zero health though, basically. I think so. Yeah. I went to that to my last tick, and I'm just sitting on it. Maybe it was. Uh, oh, what do you do? What do you do? Because there's one more thing it does when it digests somebody. So I'm trying to remember how it works. There. Oh, you there just wait. Go. And it does that. As you see, there's a little extra animation there. <laughs> All right, everyone. Well, I guess I'm taking over this uh, showcase now that Charm has sadly passed on in the belly of a chocobo. So up oh. here in this room, we've got... No. How dare. <laughs> Charm is still here. He's just five bones. I know. It... Also, yeah, that's the thing. We've leave yes. them in there, too. So, so now the, there's five bones added to the chest. Those are mine. Charm's bones. <laughs> those are my bones. I'm stealing your bones, Charm. <laughs> All right. So, anyways, now I smile on the stairs. Anyways, here's here this room up here. This room doesn't technically have anything to do with Vor, but these were added with the Vor mod, so I figured I'd show uh, them off too. Uh, 
And the shopkeeper for that all these were in were a moth. I think actually, Beerus, yeah, Beerus, you, Beerus, you, you don't even have to describe it because we've actually added the moth to this thing. So, also, moth? please do not stand in the way of the figurines. They are tiny and easy to block. So, if you need to crouch, um, but here, let's take a look. So we got on this uh, going for left to right. We got a Mareep, We got a Mudkip, Cyndaquil, Zerua. Got a little, got a little Tyranitar up there. We got Sparky the Chew up there specifically. You can tell because of the goggles. I uh, got a Charizard and a Vaporeon. Got a Riolu, a Shaman, an Aaron, a Eevee, a Pokeball, a Pikachu, our Garvantula, which made Beerus very happy. Um, a Gudra. A Gudra, an Eevee that is somebody's character I forgot the name of. This is it's as close. A a a a Rock Ruff, which is always good. A Torchic, a Gumi, Charmander, and uh, Baneri. Baneri, yeah. Which, strangely enough, the rock roof was the only figurine hidden. Yeah, that one was not in the normal shop. It was in a. It was in a. Instead of being in the custom moth shop, it was in a default shop in the base game. And it was like it was hidden, but we found it because I'm Pharaoh. Yeah. Um, and then in this room is a bunch of characters of people um, that I don't really know, but it's just people's characters. Uh, but also things also like Spyro. Spyro. Oh, yeah, Spyro. I recognize this one from one of the charms of the streams not as fat as he is in uh, the streams i usually do but you know. the skunk up the skunk up here their name's jovial they're a friend of mine jovial okay jovial and uh very important is uh uh no nine is that how you say his name wait actually was it i think i recognize uh, the or body no, one, body yeah. no body no or no nine i, I can't remember uh, either body no or shites <laughs> or yeah that's right the one that circled in orange that is the creator of the original star about civil war mod so there you go huh? I believe the one to his right is Victor as well. Oh yeah, Victor. That is Victor. Victor. Oh, Victor. Victor's a funny story. <laughs> so what floor are we on? That's a good question. Uh, um, oh, we're going, we technically have to go back down. Track. That's an attic. So. This is like a little house inside the tower, essentially what this is. Uh, let me turn off the music. Weird. What floor are we on? And let me turn off the music and let me turn on the default music again. Because, yeah. That, well, we're going to get to the point where we're too high that the music will stop. That's true. This tower is so high, it will eventually the music yet, will cut out. Yet. So, this is a... Let me explain. This is a... Yeah, turn it off. This is a barren world, which means that no wildlife appears on it. But we built this tower so high, the wildlife spawns at the top because it leaves the biome. <laughs> um, so... Wow, what's that giant thing? Oh, you were left for a bit, Fair. That is, uh, Vicar... Whatever her name is. So, Vicar Mania. So now we're in the clothing section. Now, this section, I, I more or less have to show off my... Well, actually, you guys can help me show off, but we have to coordinate, right? Because everybody just starts randomly grabbing clothing, nilly willy will mix up the outfits. So, um... So this is... These are our, basically our stands showing different outfits, and we can actually put these on, which I am going to do because it does let us see the animations. The lockers above uh, each one may or may not contain stuff. If the, if it does contain stuff, it's basically variations on their clothes, basically fatter versions, essentially. Uh, this character here... We're actually going to see some of these characters later, by the way, outside of being clothing, but... Um, I'm going to go ahead and... Uh, everybody can uh, take one of these suits if they want to. Just make sure you coordinate. Um... And make sure to put the stuff back in the lockers, etc., and on the armor sensor you're done. But, I'm uh, a very fat rock. <laughs> so this is um, Axon that I'm at, I'm being right now, and Axon is a, dr a dragon fellow that has a lot of variations on his clothing. I will demonstrate. Um, we'll, we'll go over each one individually. Um, I was only the, like no top half. In oh yeah, you forgot. can take it off. You can take it off the stand if you need to. Be complete. That's what I. That's why I suggest actually start with the stand because that basically what's on the stand is the smallest form and what's in the lockers is progressively to the largest form. So you've already fucked it up actually by taking out the locker stuff first. But whatever. Yeah. <laughs> oh. uh, so this yeah. accent here, I can change out his pants to get a, big, a bigger belly, and a bigger tail, and a bigger belly, a bigger tail. And a bigger belly, so yeah. Yeah. With a good wobble well, too. Well, I'm just a happy little blue cat. Meow, 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 meow. Also, it doesn't really matter too much how you put it on the arm stands again. Just make sure you keep things together. That's all. Yeah. Like all even. This one for this one. In fact, I'll I'll put the fat version of the arm stand when I'm done. And uh, all right, so next up we have uh, blue cat. Whoever whoever's doing blue cat. 
Oh, I already put it. I already put it back. Oops. Okay, I'll do it then. Nope. Actually, no. Actually, it'd be easier if you guys did because you're probably faster at it. Start with the start with the thin version though on the armor stand. Yeah, like, just like, like, like I literally just told Beerus. Equip cosmetic. There you go. So the there's the yeah. So the thin version on the armor take stand take all is... take all the equipment, Selena. Just take it all into your inventory at once because it's a lot simpler that way. And okay. then just swap it out. So yeah, there's there's the thin cat that I'm wearing right now. Yes, yeah, thin cat. Feel free to move around as you show off each one too, because it's animation. And then, whoop. hi fluffs. Yeah, whoop. Two parts of the belly. It's, it's three pieces of clothing: head, torso, and uh, legs. So that combines different ways. And that is uh. Tubby kitty. Tubby, tubby tub. Is that the t is that only two variations? Yeah. All right. Put the tubby version on the armor stand. And put the thin version in the locker. I'm just reversing it when we're done because it's fun that way. So next up, what do we have? We have uh, uh, catfish. catfish, which is an interesting one. <laughs> oh, oh yeah, crash! I didn't even think about crash animations. Squish. Let me let me actually see real fast. Hold on, I need to know. Squish, <laughs> squish. Nice. Squish. There it is. But uh, so catfish is is it have multiple forms? It does. Yes, it has a bigger belly. Let's take a look. Yep, that's a bigger belly. <laughs> <laughs> All right, okay. bud. Put the fat version on the stand and put the old parts of the lock, the thinner parts of the locker, as usual. And Time for uh, Selena festivities. Off I go, everyone. Oh, goodbye. Okay. Goodbye. All Bye, right, Selena. So, Mala, you grab the the one at the end. I'll grab the I'll grab this one then. This one is centaur, so I could be a lichen centaur. I mean, Tor's already always an improvement. But then I can also be a fat. <laughs> so, oh, you just put the dragon away? Well, you haven't even showed it off yet. Or do you well, want me to do I, it? I thought I was equipping it. Whoops. I'm... You put it on the armor stand somehow. How did you yeah, do that? I... Well... Uh, yeah, equip that from armor stand. When in it, just click equip cosmetic, and it'll swap yeah. it onto you. Yeah, that's right. You can actually just click one button. So that's yeah, the, that's the fat dragon. Ready. Walk around with that. This guy. Yes. And the crow. And oh, he yeah. has some bigger bellies. Thank you for the. Oh, you got me food. Thanks. Thanks. Thanks, Elbrick. Not only for the bits, but also you got to be a food about, which I'm down for. But yeah, it's also oh, bigger belly. Medium belly. Medium belly. And there's a third belly size. Let's try jumping when you have it on. We'll see if that... Okay, it's kind of basic. I think it was mostly... This is mostly out of here for walking. <laughs> that's yeah. that's just fine. All right. Go ahead and throw the biggest version on the stand and then put the other stuff in the locker above. No, your wings. <laughs> oh, don't forget the uh, locker. Yeah, the stuff. And the locker. Oh, stickers! Thank you for the sub! Thank you. Um, also, wait, did I just get another food item? No, it's. I thought it was a waffle. It's 2020 mm. Unity. I don't understand that simple. Anyways, that's clothing floor one. Okay. I don't know what Florida is in general. Epic. All right, so. I guess blood could show off the first one, so he's standing in front of it. First one is uh, reindeer. Anthro reindeer. My, my tail sort of sticks out the back. That's, that's, uh, I could do it then, I guess, if you want me to. I don't, I don't have a long tail. All right, so. When it comes to the deer, there's a few variations. This is the anthro. I'm a deer dog. <laughs> a deer -g. Yes. Oh my god. Oh, Crimson. Okay, well, we now have a hype train going on. Because Ooh, people are donating like mad right now. Thank you, guys. <laughs> so, quick, quick explanation of hype train for those not aware. It's already level three? How did that happen? Okay, well, anyways. Tier two subs, that's oh my god, Crimson. Tier two. Thank you, dude. 
Um, so the way tree aptitudes work is if you donate at least 100 bits or do a sub or gift a sub, uh, it increases the level of the hype train and it builds it up and you can get a better. And when the hype train ends, whatever level it's at, you get emotes depending on the level. So uh, if you want to increase the hype train, go, go nuts. That's up to you guys. Uh, meanwhile, <laughs> that was very dorky. Um, <laughs> also, so here's the fat. Here's the after deer outfit fat. And then, uh, which one does this go to? This is like pants. It is pants. Then we have, we have uh, deer. We have deer tar now. Best and of form course, of Dan. and of course, fat deer tar, which is the, no, that's the best form. Fat deer tar. Uh, fair enough. Well, I just use all my bits. That's totally fine. You still built up the hype train. Also, hi shell. How you doing, dude? I was. That's the fat deer. It's good too. Light position's kind of odd in the neutral. Oops, crash. <laughs> but uh Merry Christmas. Enjoy lots of fatty eggnog and squirmy gingerbread mun. <laughs> oh my gosh, guys. I guess next is the crocodile alligator. We we are doing a crazy hype train right now. Yeah, it's crocodile. This is a good guy. This is a good one. The gate. Gator. No brakes on the hype train. Gator. <laughs> Very matter of fact face on this gator. I kind of like it. It's like tossing That's money about your kink or something. Huh? I mean, that is a. I think that is a kink. And we have bigger belly. Obviously. And of course, naturally, we have... Well, it's not so much a bigger belly, it's more like it's engorging. You see the uh, you see the flesh between the scales as, as the scales pop out and spread apart because of the distin distinction of the belly. So. Also, we're a level 5 hype train, so... Wait, I think that we that means we've achieved the max, but at the same time the percentage bar still says forty two percent, so I don't know. You guys are crazy by the way. I don't think we've ever hit level five. That's amazing. Alright, so next clothing, a volley. Also yes, we have left the music realm. You can hear there's no music because we're too high up at this point. <laughs> So a volley. The interesting thing about a volley is it doesn't quite. It's like I'm wearing a covering of a volley. It doesn't quite cover me all the way. It's like it's in front of me, sort of. It's kind of odd, but whatever. A volley has one variation, which is a good variation, even if I'm not completely covering it. Eesh. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Appropriate. I, I accept this. Well, Shell, things are uh, you know overall pretty good. There was some rough, there were some rough patches the last week. Some stuff happened, IRL that was kind of rough. Like, wasn't seeing it coming, but I'm doing all right from that. How has how things been for you? Yeah, so stuff with neighbors, like, didn't directly involve me, but it did affect me. So, Salamander. Again, really silly face on this one. Though, actually, is this one has multiple faces, so... Demonstration. Has Gulp. <laughs> and then... Satisfied, which naturally should pair with this. Well... <laughs> I'm back, and with music. There is. Well, we had already reached the part of the tower where the music stopped, so I was just adding to the background. <laughs> Works for me. <laughs> also, oh my god, okay, so Hype Train level 5, 90%. What happens if it hits 100 at this point? Is I that guess the hardest level of 
It is. Oh. We are eight percent off from I, the Jeez. last bit of that. That's amazing. I don't think we've ever been this far before. Wow. Well, Jeez. guess it's time to get to max level. No. It's done. Oh, there we go. It is we've done. just reached well, it. We just did another tier two. Hypey! Hypey. Does that just end the hype train? Or does it go <laughs> for another... Um, I... 126%! Okay, what? Yeah, this, you guys have achieved it. You, you guys did it. Anything past this is pointless, I think, but I don't know, maybe it does like, uh, but it's probably a bonus at this point. I mean, more people can participate for the rewards. Like right, that. right, this is a chance, if, if you guys have, so basically the rewards get handed out to whoever participated with at least 100 bits. So, basically, oh my god, 145%, 146, this is unnecessary. This is completely unnecessary. <laughs> The hype train has missed its stuff. But then again, <laughs> but then again, I mean, we're talking for we're talking for mods here. Unnecessarily, unnecessary hype, unnecessary amounts of food kind of works in tandem. Speaking of which, here's a fat orca. Go, put the stand back up. Alright, we're done with this room. But don't worry! There's plenty more clothing. Why is that looping so much? Uh, it's the 12 days of Christmas, so it's going Oh, through. right, I forgot about that roll. <laughs> I like me! So here's a, here's a squid kid. You're a kid now, you're a squid now. You're still a no, dog, so kind of behind it. I like how I'm still a dog. All oh, right, we, let's see what emotes we got. Thing. Dogging thing. I got a mage. <laughs> I can get the questionable bug on the far right. I think we all got the mage. Is that because it's max level, I guess? So, of course, so, so yeah, Splatoon 4. Here you go. I like this one, actually. The black belly's kind of nice. I like, well, s s <laughs> the crouch looks, <laughs> the crouch is quite the squish. It's a good belly. Now, the squid kid actually has several variations. This is the boy, there's actually a girl one, too. Uh, as well as different hair colors, but. Then we have... Kangaroo, which is a, a custom race, I believe. So. Naturally. Vor. <laughs> this one has kind of a baked in bulge on it, too. If only we could make the bulge squam. Uh, that is beyond the clothing. I don't know, clothing, does clothing ever have animation? Also, Slippers, thank you for the 25 bones! More money. You deserve lots of love and support, and also thank you so much for putting a smile on my face whenever I watch your streams and chat with you. Aww. Means a ton, and I can't thank you enough, Pudge Pup. <laughs> Thanks, Snickers. That I like was a good uh, hype train. I think that's the highest it's ever gone. No, like, uh, we've never hit level 5 before, so. Yeah. Highest we've ever gone, that's why oh, I said. Oh, let's turn the lights on. I didn't even notice the lights were off. <laughs> also, can you can we all appreciate the sound of this? Boom. Yeah. It's a good sound. Um, very showcasey, I feel. So this is, uh, what? Kiros, which... I don't know. Some grass person? <laughs> I don't got, I don't have a clue. But here's a belly. Seems, seems like some sort of plant cat. Plant cat. A plant. It probably will be, Frank. There's a lot of content to go through in this. <laughs> um, yeah, if you can't tell, this is a rather long playing by the pound episode. Because we put so much fucking time in this. You don't have any idea, guys. You guys, yeah, have, with you guys, well, listen, nobody, <laughs> nobody even spoiled the fact that, yeah, there's more content beyond All what right. you think, but, um, well, right now. I kind of interrupted you, so it's okay. <laughs> Also, I'm a Naga now. Yay, Yay, we can see a Naga without 
naked boobies that are not acceptable. Yay. I don't <laughs> like it, Rock. I'm you my chest is perfectly fine. Naked dog boobs. <laughs> also, I guess that's Vor? Right, let's see here. Oh yeah, yeah, okay. Uh, in, the back, in the back of the tail. What is this jump animation? Look at this. That looks a little weird. <laughs> Your tail as a coil. <laughs> I know, but like it's so weirdly flat at the bottom. What about crouch? <laughs> I shall I shall tuck into myself to hide. It's like a tortoise. I guess that's just like limitations of the or something. Yeah, yeah, something about how crouching works. Time for the questionable bug. Here's the bug you don't like. Oh, it's not questionable though. We verified it on another model. I know. I didn't say I don't like it. I'm just saying look the. It kind of looks Yeah, but thanks for bringing, thanks for making everybody else get a dirty mind. Thanks for just bringing that up again. <laughs> so, welcome. anyways, You're this welcome. is a bug. This is a bug character. They have a carapace belly. That's that, that's why there's a segment to it. But of course, Beerus sees as something else because it's Beerus. How could I don't see how you can't see that? Though. Because I don't always have. Look, I may like a lot of things, right? But I also like things platonically, so I don't always 100% of the time have a dirty mind. <laughs> But oh, come on, though. I don't either. I mean... <laughs> yeah, I believe that. I believe that person who, is, who just... Who literally had somebody tell... Say that Beerus is a person that looks below the belt, but isn't always... Is always going to be in SLW about it. And then you were like, well, actually, no, that's wrong. <laughs> <laughs> also, here's a random generic cat with a belly. It's it's kind of the same animation we've seen on or same model. So it's right we've seen on others, but hey, I'll show it off anyways. Fe felon head, felon. This felon gotta go to jail. <laughs> and we have this is a this is not a custom race. I thought it was the Fenerox. Apparently they just exist. Apparently they're supposed to be like Phoenix foxes, but yeah, they're in the um, savanna biomes of Darbound. Personally, they just look like a particular type of dinosaur that has a kind of, like, ridge head. I don't know, they just don't look fox-like at all to me. They have a more of a koala look. Or, yeah, I guess so, which could explain why I don't like them too much, but... <laughs> I don't like koalas! I don't <laughs> oh my want gosh. To be left out. Merry Xmas, everyone. Thank you, Epic. Honestly, you guys have given the best presents, because I the only, the only presents I received is the thing for the rocks people, which is really cool. Though not, you know, it was just this is cool. It's cool, but uh, the only like personalized present I received was uh, 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 Aragon's mom gave gave me pants. I'm not sure why, but I'm okay with that. It's good to have pants. Just it's their comfy sweatpants, so I'm down for that. But that that was the only physical present I received this year. <laughs> so pants. <laughs> Dog wears pants. I mean. Dogs that are cold, I guess. <laughs> I'm a fox now. Not quite as good as a dog, but close. And, and the fox. Oh yeah, there's several things with fox. If I, if I recall Someone correctly, if I recall correctly, there were several things with fox. Uh, in addition to like one other thing, I couldn't show because fox got a little bit. Fox got a little bit oh, spicy. Yeah. A little too spicy. Um, but here's a fox yeah. belly. But don't worry, there was non -ver there was safe version, so it's all good. But uh, fox no, belly. Wolf and cat. And then we have different fox. But whoop. Hold on, wait, what? Hold on a second. Oh right, okay. And then this is like a variation on the other one. I don't really know why, but okay. Female and male. Oh, that's why. Okay. Then we have. Oop. That was the one I did earlier. Then we have. Boop. Which doesn't actually go with this. That's like that. It's kind of weird. Some of these count as like torso and pants, and some of them are separate. But we got this belly. And then. For the highest quality of synthetic for fox pants, the best one is this one. I like any belly that drags against the ground. It's a good belly. It's part of the joy of being a feral. You can get that experience in a very involved way. Yeah, it's good to have like a big 
belly dragging behind with the paws. Look, I know a lot of people like Anthros, but like, seriously, Feral Vor? Way better on the spine. <laughs> I'll see. It's kind of funny. It almost works with my normal color scheme when I'm like this. <laughs> Alright. So now we have a dragon, which is actually related to the crystal dragon. But it's a little bit different, actually. So It's got slightly different... Uh, beyond just coloration, it's got a few other differences, too. And of course... It's got belly variations. I am moving a little faster this because there's a lot of clothes, if you can't tell. We're almost we're actually just got one more floor of them, so. Um jump, jump. They're actually nearly at the top of the power tower, so I'm going to prepare what should be up there. Yes, that's true. Yeah, Yoshi token. I don't know when I got that. So here's a slime girl. <laughs> Car. You can't you can't outplay a, a storyteller. <laughs> I'm now a slime girl. <laughs> the boobs do bounce on their own. I noticed. <laughs> like as they have their own they have their own thing they do in that animation. Because of course they do. I like the I like the squish of this one though when you crouch. But of course. This is a variation with one person, so you can kind of see the silhouette. It's kind of interesting. When <laughs> you squish, they squish, too. Oh, wait, actually, they lay down, don't they? Oh, that's actually kind of clever. They're in kind of a crouching position normally, but if you if you crouch, then they lay down. Huh. And then a different belly. Frontal belly. All right, so. Next, oh wait, okay, there's two more floors of bellies, right? Two more floors of bellies. Two more floors of clothes, I mean. So let's be a, let's be a wolf, which is I think the other one that had some uh, naughty clothes that I couldn't include. It's like only like two or three that had it. But. Again, pretty solid, nice belly. And then, I think this is a... Is that supposed to go with that? No, it's not. How does that, how does that work? Is that just supposed to be like that? I don't know. Maybe... Actually, I'm not sure if that has a prop repair. I'm confused. No, yeah, whatever. Doesn't matter because there's this, which is the best one, I think. I think you're just supposed to, yeah. I think you're just supposed to have your arms exposed on some of these. I'm not sure why, but if I do that, it overlaps weird. So I think that's what you're supposed to do. Well, the sacrifice you make for the biggest belly, I suppose. Big belly's a good after all. <laughs> and then uh, this one, okay, this is kind of interesting. We'll get a better idea of this later, but this is actually just, um, this is Lucario's belly, right? There's no actual Lucario clothes aside for the belly, so it's just the belly for some reason. That being said, don't worry. There might be a way to see a proper uh, Lucario later. Same with Little Pony. It's just a belly as well. I yeah. think those are meant to go with like custom the actual races. races. The actual custom races, oh, yeah. Custom races. Then we have Yoshi. Which, uh, I don't quite like its face, this one. Something about the eyes kind of bothers me, but uh, 
show it off. Just giving you a deep soul stare. <laughs> it's like there's something a little bit off about these Yoshi's eyes. Not specifically this one. Oh, the crouch animation's unique. That's nice. Yoshi's seen some shit. No, no, th this is what I mean. Like, look at his mouth. Nom. Yeah. I'm inside now. <laughs> I'm inside. And then there's gulp. Look at this I'm face, gulp. though. Just I'm give me a minute. Look at. Is there a way. By the way, is there a way to turn off that little weird list icon above your head? Um. I don't even know what it's there for. I guess it didn't tell me where I am. But uh, you can tell, even with the list I can block it a little bit. Like, this is a. Is that because you've got your inventory open or something? A, maybe that's it, actually. Good point. <laughs> yeah, that's it. That's, that's it. And then we have uh, gulp. Oh, I've been gulped down further. <laughs> it's kind of weird for someone just to run around with. And then other gulp. I guess this one's cr this one has a cranky tooth. I kind of like that. I've been really gulped down. <laughs> and belly. And now I'm in the belly. Big belly. <laughs> <laughs> I think this will be the one I set up with armor set. There we go. Then, um, just an indicator you have that many open. Fair enough. Again, I'm not very starbound literate. Here's a zebra tour. I like zebras. They have a good pattern. I was really into like Zeb Striker back in the day when they came first, like Gen 5 was new. Yeah, Zep Strikers, no, I can saw Zebras. The Zebra Boys have good tool. I feel like the bottom line of this belly isn't quite. Yeah, yeah. I feel like the bottom line of this belly isn't quite good, but that's alright. It's not a big deal. So. Whoosh. Now over here. Shark. I like how der derpy this shark is, honestly. It's a good sort of derpy, though. <laughs> oh, good fish. Good fish. Fatter fish. Good fat fish. <laughs> there we go. And of course, very appropriate for Christmas. I might even keep, I might even keep this one. Where's that Christmas music when you need it? Actually, I actually might keep this one just to show it off as we walk around, but. Very good Christmas reindeer. Oh, there's a belt. I like how the belly squish when I crouch, actually. This isn't even, this isn't even I like the fat how one. Got the present. Yes, we use a present for that. When I'm done showing off all the clothes, I think I'll be a reindeer for the rest of the session. <laughs> <laughs> the next we have Circle. This is Circle. Well, that's a oh, circle. Geez. Yeah, this is apparently Circle. Oh, it looks more like a squirrel, honestly. A Serg squirrel. Yeah, I think, that's, I think that's more of the angle of where they put the head. It's a bit hard to get the wedge first in Starbound. It takes, it takes uh, spraying skill, I guess. The costume is nuts. Oh, great. <laughs> Here's another shark, a little more anthro this time. I guess the other one was technically anthro, but this is more anthro. And also, not completely blocking my characters. That's fine. <laughs> the big belly. If anybody finds the clothing portion of this a little bit boring, don't worry. We're almost to the new stuff. The next the next tier. Here's a unicorn. I got a cool hat hairdo if I put the headpiece on. Look at, look at this headpiece. 
A unicorn tour. It's pro Wait, well, that's... It like it. well, that's odd. I thought there was a fat belly for this, but apparently I don't have it in the in the locker. Hmm. Your unicorn. Maybe they didn't have one. It's possible. I don't know. I, I think... could go check the shop or something. Go check for unicorn. Unicorn pants that are fat. Yeah, was well, the shop was the one in the locker out just outside the entrance, right? That's I, board, I, I think so. You can check. Okay. It was the talking machine. The talking machine. Talking oh, machine. machine. Oh, the token machine. You have to go to the food hall for that. Yeah, I'll go there. This isn't boring. This is pretty interesting. Oh, I'm glad to hear that. Because the showcase, like, you know, it, uh, it takes a little bit of time to go through everything. So, as long as it stays interesting, right? Well, while he checks out the unicorn, I'll go to the next floor. Thank you, bud. So, uh, so this is actually where we get into stuff that Kevin did, um, which... I'm a scientist, and you can tell I'm very professional because I'm covering my hands with the sleeves. <laughs> Fat scientist like a rug. Forty-one floors. We're getting there. Yeah, Kevin has a bit of stuff. So Kevin's the guy. He actually drew me recently. You guys may remember the picture I shared it. Um, now it's a. Uh... Unicorn. He's. Uh, is, there, is there a fat unicorn pants? Yes. I'm going to bring it. Okay. So Kevin's the, Kevin is the guy that likes crotch bellies, or deep belly, depending on how you want to look at it. Basically, it's oral vor where the bulge goes real low and usually kind of smudges under the legs, too. It's not actually anything adult, it's just a really deep belly. That's, that, that's all there is to it. So, anyways, he did some crotch belly uh, stuff. This is one of them. This is a very basic one. And also, this is his head I'm wearing. <laughs> Alright, go Thank ahead. Unicorn pants. Okay, throw those at me, actually. Okay. A zebra me... moth thing. <laughs> a zoth? I don't know. <laughs> Was it really? Okay. Beauty moth. Now, finally, I can uh, be a proper fat unicorn. There we go. Fat <laughs> unicorn. Okay, I wonder how I forgot those pants. Thanks for those. Yeah, good thing I can quickly go double check if need be in the future. <laughs> so, uh, this one actually is not disappearing. That's nice. Sometimes this one, specifically this one here, just phases out of existence. Kind of like. Oh, like it's an Undertale dog. What's that? The one next. Oh, I just nice. It's the Undertale dog. I was wondering what that was. Omega's this has. Oh, I, I don't know who Omega's this is. I think he's a friend of Kevin's, but uh, could be not much to this one. Also, oddly enough, that dog there was part of the whole Vor stuff. Doesn't seem to have a Vor belly unless I missed it. So it's actually just what yeah. you see here. That's the dog that you can pet, and it extends its neck to like really abnormal levels. What? <laughs> It extends yeah. its neck like. Oh, you pet it the longer thing. its neck gets. What? <laughs> no, I understand what you're saying, but what? <laughs> yeah, you just keep petting it and paying it and paying it, and its neck just gets longer each time. I'm surprised they didn't make that. Well, excited thing. the dog gets the longer its neck gets. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's right. I was actually going to wear this for the rest of the. Yeah, that's right. What do you guys prefer? You guys prefer. This like a rock. The wing deal with the Santa hat. Why not both? Actually, we that might work. We could leave that up to the vote thing that you did before. We could do. Yeah, we could do. You want to vote, Fierce? Actually. Yeah. Okay. Uh. So. Reindeer tour. Santa. Or or reindeer. Do you want me to be a fat reindeer, or do you want me to be a Santa like in rock? For the rest of this uh, showcase. Or I could put a mix of both. Let me see what the mix looks like. Actually, I can check that right now. Oh, yeah, that's right. It's in my inventory already. Yeah, let me just set up a poll, I guess. 
A mix is doable to some degree. I'm not a proper reindeer this way, but I am a. I want three options or two. I uh, just two. See which one wins between the two major ones. Or mix. Okay, fine. Mix can be an option. Somebody, somebody was like mix. <laughs> mix is mix is a potential possibility. Yeah, I mean, this ain't bad either. <laughs> I appreciate how the the deer tail actually like waves up into the air as you fall. I appreciate that. Hyper, that is something. That is definitely something. <laughs> I'll put the voting duration to like 10 minutes because I think no, we won't be done in 10 minutes, probably. That's fine. I'll just keep all the clothes on me for now. All has started. So I can just put on whatever people end up voting for. Polls up. Yep. That is true. I'll see you uh, in a second. Right. Oh, I didn't notice how close to the top we are. We were. Oh, I've put to five minutes. So oh, well. It's fine. Yeah, I thought we still had some floors of clothing to go. It's all good. It's all right. Give me a second. I'm just checking something. There we go. Sorry, I was just arranging something. Right. Um. Just gonna kind of casually hide the top, the next floor up because it's a special floor. But anyways, uh, so next up over here, we have wetsuit belly, because wetsuits plus four. Like I said, tight tight four is good. And then we have, <laughs> and this is pretty good. But we also have um, because like because hugging. this was this was again added by Kevin. We have a crotch belly too. Again, oh. I like crotch belly simply because. Okay, now I can't get that icon off my... Hold on a second. Go Big away. crotch belly is a god. Go away, Let's annoying icon. you drag prey across the floor. There we go. It's like a feral. <laughs> yeah, also, I just like... I, I guess I like the squish against the legs. That's kind of a thing that I like about it, too. Oh, well, you like thighs a lot, so... I am a thigh yeah. guy, so... Yeah. This is good. Um, uh, to... To the question, yeah. this is oh. the latest version of the VAR mod. As far as I can tell, anyways. <laughs> I wouldn't know, yeah. personally. Then we have an avian belly. Oh, yeah, that's right. So this is an avian belly. So if I was the avian race, this would match better. And it, too, has... Because Kevin made crotch bellies for every major race. <laughs> of course, I like I like it when I jump. There's also, like, a little bit of a, um upward wobble to the belly as well. It's pretty good. Yeah, jiggling bulge. Crotch bellies are such a weird thing because they seem kind of a little owo, but they're totally safe for work. So, so I like them a lot. They're one of those yeah. weird things that I kind of got into. It's like it's just kind of a it's just one of those unusual things that is kind of creative in my opinion. So we got yeah. a Florian belly and of course whole storage space are really nice. Like storing something in the tail, like one of the ones earlier did. Also, it's pretty funny to crouch of it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, tell story. I like I like just unusual storage spots with Vor. Can be entertaining. Oh, Vor's cool. I mean, I got I got my you know I got Aspen the Leafion. He does he does naval Vor, for instance. Oh. Again, weird but fun. Yeah, Paul Vor's good in that respect, I must say. Paul Vor is barely makes any sense, but I have seen a few good ones. I mean, just slap them into your toe beans. It seems a little weird to me, but do you, do you, that's the thing though. Weird is usually a good thing. Weird is usually a creative thing. Yeah. This is I think it's high level high level crotch belly, I think it was. was it's it? hard to do yeah. well though, I think. When you want to resemble a black swallow fish, maybe I should be reading some of these descriptions. That's not, that's not a bad point, because they yeah, have black swallow. If you don't know what the black swallow fish is, look it up. It's a real fish. It's a real fish that does vor, really super stretchy vor that you wouldn't think would exist in real life, but it does. Uh, by the time it actually finishes its prey, it's already digested half of it. <laughs> yeah. It is exceptionally... Black Swallower, look it up. It's 
it can distend to a ridiculous degree. It can eat things bigger than itself. It's uh, kind of creepy looking too, but it's pretty neat. But uh, Nova Kid Belly. And... Of course. Nova Kid Crouch Belly. Which has a description. Stars are known for their intense gravity fields, after all. Oh, that's the excuse for a Nova Kid Crouch Belly, I suppose. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, yeah, I can just kind of like. Potato plants like to keep their bulk at the roots too. Florian Crutch Village description. How about the uh, avian? Good luck flying anywhere with this cargo. <laughs> wetsuit. Gotta give the wetsuit company some credit here. That's impressive. Let's look at the descriptions there. Some of these. Basic one. Physics would, physics would like to have a word with you. Sounds like something Epic would say about the subject, because he just said he doesn't understand it very much. What's the dog say? It's already overstimulated. That's why I had a long neck for... There is actually a head variation of this, I just remembered, that it has a long neck. I didn't understand it, so I didn't grab it. Oh... Uh. There is a long neck version of this thing. You should probably grab that. I just remembered, like, that's why. I was just, like, so confused when I looked at it, because I don't, you know, I'm not under tongue, oh, right? Yeah. Maybe you should sometime, even with, like, the whole fan base or any, it's, it's still quite a good game. Well, there's still the issue of, but that's an RPG. And that's a commitment when it comes to streaming. Yeah, fair enough. I'm very selective about my commitments, you may know. I'm currently committed to Hey You Pikachu. But, uh, while we wait on that, how's the fuck going? Let's see. A lot of people are saying Santa Lycra. I'm surprised that nobody. I'm surprised there's actually a lot less people that want me to be a fat reindeer. But that's fair enough. Santa Lycra Rock is pretty a cute. Fat <laughs> I actually could be any of these outfits if I wanted to, but I think it was it's kind of down to the two Christmassy ones for me. So most people are voting this. I mean, technically. Oh, this a dog is in the moth shop. I, I mean, technically, I can wear the full Christmas outfit and the reindeer. Because even the what's that? I was wondering why I couldn't find lesser dog. I think it's in the moth shop instead. It might be. I have a lesser dog head. I'm on my way. We don't vote mix. I know, it's one or the other. It sounds like this one's winning, so I'll put this on for now. If it does win, I'll just keep it on. If it doesn't win, I'll switch it. Alright, so let's see let's see about this other head then. <laughs> now that I understand yep. yeah, so go ahead and, no, go ahead and put it on the go ahead and put it on this. But on the stand, may as well. Uh, it's flying it for you. That works. Yeah, the description text is Undertale text line. It's possible you may have a problem. <laughs> See, in jokes really don't work if you don't know the joke. <laughs> so just. Yeah. Oh, Moth hurts himself. Um, I mean, that's normal. <laughs> If it varies, isn't it Charm's choice of what he wants to be? Unless I leave it up to you guys, which I guess I did, so. Alright, so next floor, we have enemies. And yes, we actually reached the top of the tower. Look at that. Uh, enemies, though. There's only a few enemies that were ever created for the war mod. Let's start over here. So, um... Alright, you can back up, because there's only one, one person. Which all of these were... It's actually broken until someone fixed it. Yes, Blood figured out... If it wasn't for Blood, we wouldn't even have these guys, so... These are three enemies. Now, if we now keep in mind, they are dangerous. So, if we open the gate, I like that siren. <laughs> oh gosh. Okay. Well, I'll hop down here. So they mess with me a bit. Do I need? Do I need to be out of? No, I do not. Okay. Yum. <laughs> Delicious. I like how it just like doesn't seem to have a spine, from what I can tell. Given <laughs> how it does the bulge. Nice blob. Just a blob. It's a blobby blizzard. It's like a slug. A walking slug. It's 
Good thing we have it next to a Goomy. Then. Actually, do I turn off Admin to get hurt? Actually, I think I already have Admin off. Yeah, you... doesn't look like you're getting damaged, though. Nope. It's not. It's not just going to be fat. I believe that's all it does. I believe that one. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa relax. <laughs> you know what this reminds me of? He's, eating, he's hitting me with the dog's eye guard. <laughs> it kind of does. Actually, it does have that color scheme. You're right. It's like a lizard's eye guard version. So here's yeah. Gumi. <laughs> Don't ask me no. why Gumi puts you in the ground. He just does. Oh, you're getting damaged. Oh, well, I am, actually. What will Gumi do? Oh, wait, no, I'm, I don't I'm actually getting digested. I'm, I'm eaten. Yeah. I heard some gurgles. Doesn't look like you're getting damaged anymore, though. So how were they broken? They were not functional in the default setup of the mod. Uh, they were not able to spawn because of the way that... Oh, yeah, and Gumi does that. Spawns you in... The floor. Yeah, Gooby does this. This is what Gooby does. Sad to like a rock won by 58% of the votes. That's pretty... When it comes to three votes, it's a pretty l large majority, actually. Gumi just transfers you into floor roll. <laughs> <Stop. laughs> I mean, unless you have a floor slime, I don't think it's really a thing. I mean... The floor is boring you, that's why you get damaged by it. It's digesting you. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Gooey literally, oh, exactly. literally is you stuck so what I actually would like. Yeah, see, look, you're being fooled by the floor. <laughs> I'm just gonna crouch like Gumi beat me up a bit. And, uh, I'll fix that way. Oh, ate me right before. Yeah. Actually, can, can nope. does he do damage? Because if so, he could digest me at this point. No, he doesn't. Yeah, I don't think he digests or does damage for it. And neither does the other one. I've been going down except for when he actually hits you. I need him to hit me to get me out of the ground. <laughs> Waiting to digest. <laughs> that works. <laughs> you think the enemy would do damage when... Yeah, you think that, but... Nope. Yeah, unfortunately, it doesn't. Alright. So back. then over here... Dinosaur. Rawr. Sorry, just... all of its animations were not finished. Yeah. He doesn't do much, but... Does eat ya! I don't say you're delicious. That's good enough for me. It doesn't do damage either, so. <laughs> That's all it does, right, Blood? Just that the animation we've seen. And I'm stuck in him until he lets me out. Is that right, Blood? Is that all he does, what we've seen? I think that's yeah, all. Yeah, pretty much. Yep. Apart from the uh, animation, which is just him opening his mouth, but that's it. <laughs> so you didn't count the floors beforehand? No, did you? The person who was supposed to count the floors? I mean, I, oh, you mean you asked, you asked me if I counted the floors previously? Um, at one point, but I kept building more and more onto it that I finally stopped doing that because it was wasting my fucking time. And I was busy building, <laughs> so no. <laughs> I guess this route, I'm not going to go this way, actually. I'm actually going to go all the way back down. Which I'm going to turn admin on before that, or I'm going to die. Watch how much that Now watch this, guys. What, so this was the top of the tower. So watch how long it takes me to fall, and watch how much damage I take at the bottom, right? Watch this. Just count all the floors as you fall. <laughs> 1,456 damage. Yeah. Did you count all the floors as you fell? Yep. Totally could just count it via frames, I'm sure. Good. So, uh... So, yes. Here's the... here. Okay, so that is Tower 1. That was Tower 1, everyone. Here's the here's the between the tower area. So we have a little bug here and a, we have a little firefly in a jar. And here's a moth. Here's the moth vendor. Now, ever wonder what it's like inside the moth? If you pay attention to her abdomen, we just missed it actually. But pay attention to her, her and she actually has a few animations as well. Um, if you pay attention to the abdomen, you will see a person inside occasionally. Uh, feel free to snuggle. There's a person. Oh, I see it. Little face. 
Yep. That's good. Moths are always good, no matter the context. Yeah, that was Tower 1. Now for Tower 2. And then, by the way, I'm going to specifically ask Maul and Blood, do not walk to the left of Tower 2. Do not do not look to the left of the tower just yet. I wanted to be a surprise for you guys, too, what I did. Um, so... I think she also does a little uh, titter flit. She just did that, like, little... Moving the titter rounds a little bit. And I think she has one other animation. Oh, yes, there's more. Yes, you think that one giant tower was all the content? No. Guys, this is my Christmas gift to you. And we all worked on this together. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, uh, that was just the furniture this mod. So what do you guys think, speaking of uh, unique vor types, abdomen vor for like buggy creatures. I like it. I think it's pretty neat. Yeah, I, I yeah. like it. Admittedly, if, if it's if it's if it's or like normal orvor that goes to the abdomen, that's typically better for like general content ratings. Because when it's abdomen <laughs> entered, it's kinda like sometimes it's done really lewdly, sometimes it's not. It's kinda hard to say. Bugs are great, so that means any bug exclusive vor is super great. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so no bias whatsoever. <laughs> so I think I don't know, maybe there was that was all the animations. So let's go ahead and go to the next tower. So here's a flesh this is our flesh tower. The first tower was the pale tower, as I'm gonna call it. This is the flesh tower. Here's a well, here's literally things. a vor gate. Here's literally a vor gate you can go through. It's kinda weird, you have to like enter it and then press the direction you wanna go. Uh, here's the lobby. Um, it has paintings. There's no vor paintings, sorry. But it has paintings. And there's a cow. What was that one vor painting that came with it? There was? Well, I don't remember. Yeah, it was awesome. on a new to me. So here's the condos. I mean, you can count floors if you want. It's really up to you. So here's the condos. So here, these are NPCs. These are proper NPC characters. These are proper, like, homes I built for them. As, as you do um, in both Terraria and Starbound, it seems to work the same way, more or less. And these are all Vorish NPCs, Preds, and they uh, they have different rules and stuff. There's going to be tags and information above the doors. So, for instance, we're going to start over here. I can actually hit uh, Alt here to see their name. So here's Desi, the Yoshi. He's actually a, a person that is around FA and stuff. So let's go ahead and go in his room. Um, so if you're wondering what's all the, the decorative, decorative items that are in the rooms are basically what they require to... Uh, Live here. I hope your travels through space will be a pleasant and fun one. I got three salves. What the hell's a salve? It's a healing item. Thanks. And uh, it's probably good to turn admin off again because I think some of them. Only the ones with the digest pad will digest. Oh, right. Yeah. Digest is nice. Yoshi. Mm. And nom. Nom. Yoshi knows the best comic. Ooh, and there. gurgles. I didn't actually realize that gurgles. So let's listen to the let's listen to the gurgles a bit then. This is a Yoshi guy who's been around for a while in the community. Yoshi's always nice. He just sat down on something. Yeah. I mean, gotta sit down and let the weight work off. <laughs> and when you want out, you just press E a few times. That was delightful. I hope you enjoyed the trip. So, if they let you out. If they let you out. Sometimes they don't. Your shoes are always great. They've got cute little shoes. And over here, we have another Yoshi. Another Yoshi. This Yoshi is named Yoshi. With the camera a bit. This is just Yoshi. I, I, it looks like they all have gifts for me, so I guess I'll take all the gifts. A silver pickaxe. Wow! Yoshi! Yoshi! <laughs> little jaws that come over you. Oh, a uh, primitive stove actually accessed it. Yoshi! I mean, getting good food while in the belly is not bad. <laughs> Not much to Yoshi. That's basically what he does. So, next we have Chaos Whisk Kool Egg. Finding conversation difficult. Is that why she just immediately fights you? Oh, Kool Egg. 
Yeah, it's chaos. Chaos. Which who like? Play like. Queen like. Play like whatever. Words are hard. I know, but it doesn't mean I know how to pronounce it. It's not like they. Okay, actually, I think they're amazing. Actually, yes, her name is pronounced. Give me se seeds. Okay. The last one was the luckiest you. Okay. Eight legs, six eyes, and one key companion. And also, oh, animation that I didn't know she did. I wonder if you, does the spider eat you or does her eat you? Spider part. Good. And then That's she does a dance part. back and forth for some reason. What is she doing? Spider dog. <laughs> She's just working off her new meal. Yeah. What was that about? <laughs> Also, if they get in the corner, could you guys call them back using the panel? Yeah, I can do. Sometimes they do that, they just sit in the corner. Yeah, it's nice to see a spider part, the better part, getting the... Mm -hmm. The better part. <laughs> yeah. I mean, it's the bug part. It's being way better than a naughty naked woman. Here's Voxrid, just somebody's character. I'm gonna grab their grif gonna grab their gift and we'll go from there. They are also classed as a town guard. Yes, they can fight, I guess. They also give you souls. Hello. No. Play leg. Okay. You might want to. Yeah, okay, never mind. Just let him out, I guess. He could wander a bit. You can close me in. I don't care. Yeah, that's true. Oh, that torch is off. I guess little icons in the corner are like... Oh my god, fix it, Moth. You're standing right next to a problem that you should be able to solve. Why wouldn't you turn the light on? <laughs> Moth? I did not want to turn the lamp on. <laughs> Distracted by all the other lights. <laughs> yeah, I, was right. trying to, I was wondering what like the icons in the corners well I think they're the, the those are oh. the vortex. Those are the tags, yeah, yes. I was like what each meant. That right. looks like Mala has been unofficially volunteered. So Aya here. Or Aya, how you wanna say it. I gave her water because shark. <laughs> but she gave me money. And she gave you money. Bottom feeder. Okay. You like what you see? I like what I see. I mean, bottom feeder has a lot of contacts. <laughs> almost all of them are great. <laughs> I hop out. <laughs> so let me put this damn sword away. Or... We can give it random she items. Huh? He said no every time Marla tried to leave. <laughs> Fair enough. All right, so you can you can let me out now. <laughs> Thanks. What do I hear? Music? I guess I guess this next one. Because we're not high enough. Yeah. No, no, no. I hear music on top of the music. Oh, oh, I got eight oh. again. So, see the sign up there? The Folly Rocks sign. Oh, I shouldn't have done that, actually. <laughs> That's fine, whatever. <laughs> so the Folly Rocks sign, actually, um... Digestion, I guess? No, it means that they have a special property, not digestion. And I turned admin off for nothing, then. Um... Actually, I think it might have something to do with the tradition. I'm not sure. I can't remember it quite how it works. Thanks so much for the time. I hope we can no, get the other it was uh, because the VAR had more than one stage. Uh. Hey, is Selena in the chat? Because I have some question for Selena. No, that wouldn't have been the case. Where the fuck? Why is there music playing? So there's something to the left, but we don't go left yet, so I'm just confused. I'll figure it out later. Oh, there's a music box two floors up. That's what I'm hearing. Oh, yeah. Um, uh, um, so, so how do we trick? How do we trigger our other thing, Blood? Do you remember? Maybe just wait with her. Okay. 
I wash right off. No need to be a stranger. I wash right off. Well, you to turn that music box off. Yeah, go for it. It's kind of distracting you a little bit. You like the slime girl? Eh, it's not my favorite, but that's all right. <laughs> Bye, XY. I mean, slime girl's an improvement on regular girl. Do you mind pressing the thanks? <laughs> It's true, I guess. I'm here, now what? <laughs> um, so yeah, if you wait long, long enough, is this just how that works? Honestly, yeah. I don't know if I feel like waiting. We saw it with the clothing, basically, uh, the slime girl clothing, we saw the uh, special property where she basically dumps you into her lower portion. So I'm just gonna go, because it's taking too long. And let's go up to the next floor. And check out uh, Reen, who is Azora. She's feeling positive, apparently. Last one wasn't as lucky to. Oh, well. She just I grabbed me right off the bat there. Last one. Hi, Saki. Or Saki. Do you see a Gudra? There's more than one, actually. <laughs> Yeah, most of these don't have too many special properties, but a few of them do, so. <laughs> so here we have Sykes, who immediately ate blood. That's fine with me. Volunteered. Sykes has a nice collar. Yeah, collars are always you hear that? an improvement of did you, all. Did you hear that noise? The noise Although is good. You were just mentioning to uh, Beerus about the same issue, Char. What? It's a torch behind you. Oh, hey. Wait, what the fuck? Beerus turned it off! What the hell is he doing? He calls himself I was off. trying to turn it on, but you did as well. I swear, we can never activate something at the same time. We can never I'm activate something individually. We always do it at the same time, every one of us. Howdy! I'm the I expert here. I should be the one turning them on. Also, I shall note, I really like the belly button on this. It's, I don't know, it just works for me. Yeah, the belly button's nice. Nice shine on this. Nice gradient. Yeah, it's just a good belly. Alright, hop out. This would be a good belly to get smushed by. I'm gonna I'm gonna see if I get a different line. Hmm. Not very not very many lines with that guy. Alright, Gudra. Gudra has numerous special properties. Uh, you may notice the number three up there. That's 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 for a reason. Um, What's the green one mean? So this one has a digestion oh. tag as well. So. Ooh. Yes. Good. Dibs. Yeah. Get the lights back. Oh, don't on. worry, Marla. <laughs> digestion is. Digestion is nice. Well, make sure everybody has admin off because here's the thing: the three uh, indicates the number of people this Gudra can eat at the same time. So let's pull the Gudra over here. Ignore the side room for now. Well, what did he give? I give uh, throwing darts. What? Okay. Alright, so, Mala first, like, since you're overlapping the sprite. Wiggles the tail in excitement. Oh yeah, he has some really cute... Aw, oh, so sweet of you. Yeah. I'll let him walk around. I'm not gonna go in immediately, I want him to walk around with that size. There you go. Now going. Oh, wait, I forgot I'm He's coming, myself. blood. <laughs> okay. Fun times Bye. incoming, cat face. <laughs> and big belly. Oh. Gudra cry. And Gudra cry. It's a little, it's a little tired now. Digest at once. Yes. And this Gudra has a special digestion. Does he? Oh, yeah. That's why he has that symbol, actually, right. yeah. I can't remember what the special edition is, but let's stick around and see. Oh, yeah, this is, uh... Spinzaru, which it seems to be somebody's custom Gudra. Hence the colors. Yeah. It's a cute color. I like clicking little yellow. 
Well, I'm halfway digested, so getting along the way. What is wrong with... I'm melting, apparently. I, I, by the way, can we... You know the compass icon that indicates how close you are to another player? Is it spazzing, is it spazzing the heck out for you guys? Yeah. I'm not wrong. in the party, so I can't tell you. Oh, blood. Sad ass. There you go. That'd be easier, actually, to see how far along you are. Look at the look oh, at this compass. Oh, yeah. <laughs> the compass doesn't know where we are in relation to each other. Just cannot find us amongst all the slimy folds, I guess. Oh, Compasses do not work inside oh. bellies. Learn, learn this lesson. I do like that contemplating face at the dispensary house now. <laughs> it's because we're digesting. So we're what is this? What's this? What is the special well, property? Okay. And when we are fully, the health gets pretty much to zero. You will come out as a slime ball, and then your health will slowly go back up to full. Oh which right, will he doesn't. Yeah, we're about to see it because I'm the first one to. Do I have to leave on my own accord when I'm low health? I think it might be all of us that digested. Okay, we'll just, I... we'll just wait. We'll just wait till we're all. We'll just wait till we're all digested. Yeah, I guess it makes sense for the compass to be spazzing out because we're all being absorbed into the goo, which is all around us. I'm sorry to hear that, Pop. Maybe you should bring up in serious topics and have a discussion there about it, though. I'm sorry to hear that, dude. It looks like we're all staying on, like, one Alright, time to leave. Mm -hmm. Yeah, leave. There you go, come back later. Alright, everybody leave. And get immediately eat it again. I am slime. Yeah. And I am now... What am I doing? Reforming. I'm reforming. I'm reforming, apparently. Yes. That is the special yeah. property with Spencer. Ah, you feel delightful in there. Somebody's still in there. Who didn't leave? Bloody still in there. Oh. Oh, I'm still at the arcade cabinet. Oh, well. Oh, wait, hang on. I am reforming and melting at the same time. I mean, oh, look, you if you look at Spencer, he still has a fat belly, so yeah, somebody's still inside of him. Yeah, uh, but I'm locked at the slime balls, but I'm melting and reforming at the slime time. Oh yeah, you can- Oh yeah, I'm... See, you can see the slime ball just changed, guys, because I'm reforming. Yeah. Mine's still bobbing up and down, I think. I see, Pop. If you could like move around just If you want it. to speed the process up, you could use that healing salve. Yeah. It's based on your health. Where is it? Oh, there it is. How do I use it? Cheating. Cheating is fine. Reform the own natural way. <laughs> well, I do have an audience, eh? Boop, boop. I'm back! I do have an audience, I'm here to also, uh, you know, entertain and keep, keep a move on. I don't think I'm gonna be able to get out of Spencer. You're, 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 so. you're kind of soft lock. why don't you just... Oh, there we go. ...or something, I guess. Oh, so, okay. Uh, you could try killing him, actually. So now, uh, the side room. Up there is, uh, Teal. You're gonna see Teal a few times. Teal is, uh, Teal is a prey-only character. Most of these NPCs are, the NPCs in the main room are all Preds. The ones on these offshoots are prey only. I have them here in case I didn't have enough people to show off all the characters and all their abilities, which I don't actually. Even with even with Blood and Mala here, we don't have enough people. But these prey characters are here to show that off. Teal shows up a few times because she was easy. There aren't actually that many prey characters, so I, I had to do a few duplicates and I chose Teal because Teal only requires a candle and a prey sign, and then it will spawn. So very simple. But let me go ahead and drop her in. And uh, see if I can get, see if I can convince her to come over. Looking for a new contract. No, any good ones? Oh, there. That's a little fast. Don't you? Th oh, wait, I can eat them too. Apparently, oh. I can eat them too. You can eat them because they have prey NPCs. Uh, how do I uneat them then? <laughs> I, I don't know. Oh, maybe. oh god. Hmm. Well, okay then. That that's my bets well. for today. Oh, okay, there we go. go. 
Ask me first next time. Oh, you're a walk right by the Gudra. That's perfect. Now, see, here's the thing. The, the NPCs can't interact with each other, as you see. I think they can. Wasn't there a bug? Gulps down. <laughs> gulps down, Ludley. Well, I just got re eight. Well, you should have moved. <laughs> or maybe I'm they want to. I'm on charm. There a bug with Spencer's slime digestion and her NPCs. Wasn't there a bug that yeah, had Spencer's digestion? Uh, with other NPCs, if I'm not mistaken. A bug with digestion of other. I. No, oh. well, we disabled that machine though, Blood. No, uh, it was to do with Spencer's specifically with its slime digestion mechanic with other NPCs. Oh, was there? Okay. Well, we don't need to examine anyway, so... Kill just the eight, I think. Oh, well, too late then. What was the glitch? Um, I'm not particularly putting on the details, I just know there was, like, a bug with it. Eh, oh well. Gertra seems happy. I'm kind of indifferent towards this whole issue. Alright, Morgan. I almost forgot. Squirrel. Squirrel. Well, no, circle. Yes. We learned this. It still looks like a squirrel to me. <laughs> Surprised you stayed undigested long enough to earn this. Uh, thanks. I mean, oh, it well. is a fairly surprising thing in our showcase. I mean, try to get the NPC back in the Gudra's the Gudra's consumed NPC. Try to get her back in the thing, I guess, or later. It'll be hard to do if it. Be hard, but I'll see what I can do. I mean, you could take out Gudra. You could take out Gudra's panel and put it back down. That's true. Oh, well, Gudra's on their way here. Could you call? Could you hit the call, Mala? <laughs> oh, there you go. Okay, you can reset the NPC now, Mala. I don't know. Uh, you hit the panel like that. Oh, okay. I just interacting. But uh, I'll, I'll go ahead and get out. There's not much going on. May I crash in for a moment? What does that mean? May I crash in? You mean in my belly? <laughs> that sounds like what that means, but. That is off center. Not much going on with this circle, honestly. Let's go on. I still don't know how you trouble have trouble getting on Citra when there's literally one right below it. <laughs> I was looking, unfortunately. Ah, fair. <laughs> Alright, next up we have... Oh, yeah, this is a fun one. So, this is Rake. Rake's a bit interesting. Rake has a... Wait, no. Is, yeah, Rake's the one, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Rake has... Rake, Rake has two ways of doing Vor. Let's see what he chooses would be. You look tired. I'm gonna actually go through his dialogue first. Welcome. Alright. Mullen's slipping you into his rear. <laughs> he has two different animations. They're both kinda subtle, so I didn't mind this. Honestly, it's more subtle than those, uh, chain dinosaurs in the other towers. Oh, so. he is a multi -part. Hmm. Yes, he has a multi pred as well, so you can hop in it too if you want. <laughs> Come here to my burrow, it's a bit basic, but it's a lovely place to live. Where's he gonna put you? Strokes over his gut, what can I do for you? <laughs> Are we sure right was bulky? Yeah, he's just not pressing enough. Mm, in you go. Yeah. That was again the I like the A V animation of this because it's just a subtle like kind of tail movement. I, I kinda dig. <laughs> so this guy has a 50-50 chance of uh, eating one way or another, I guess you could say. More than happy to keep you as long as you want. 50-50 chance to feed all you. Call me to our comfy in there, I know it's a tight fit. Oh, he actually does respond to having two. That's interesting. Ah, tight but enjoyable. Let me know if either of you want out. Ah, keep squirming. Well, he's always open for you. Let's see if he eats me another way. No, he is, uh... Hmm, been too long since he went slid in that way. Yes, it's been a whole... 
like 15 seconds somebody slid in that way. It's way too long. Yeah, way too long. Way too long. <laughs> Oof, can barely keep two of you in there. You two in there. Alright, let's see if he, uh, let's pull him back over here. Oh, he just, he's always choosing that method. I, he has a kind of 50-50, but he knows what I like. Okay. I guess. Size, rubbing his gut. It's a lovely day, isn't it? Looks as delicious. You're delicious. Come back again. Hello there. Ah, uh, squirm and I might clinch you in faster. <laughs> oh, I got numbed again. Uh, again, a bit too long. That time it was only five seconds, but still too long. I'm trying to get a few other dialogue. Uh, he has a number of dialogue lines. I'm just trying to see them all. <laughs> also, it'd be nice. Presses his rough cheeks right over you, fill you, squirm your way in. <laughs> again, like I said. Dialogue is a bit oh whoa whoa, but dialogue is different from visuals when it comes to ratings. So, could you uh, could you uh, could you could you pull them? Thank you. I'll center it. Or you could just stab their luck. Oh, hey, yeah, look, Orovor for once, for once, Orovor. Yay! All right, uh, now, because if you look just before doors when we enter, they'll be numbered if they're multi, and it'll tell you how many. Yeah, the, the the giant ass numbers tell you if you didn't if you can't read. <laughs> I actually think what type of ore he chooses depends on his. Notice how he sometimes smirks and sometimes doesn't. I think if he's smirking, he'll pick AV, and if he's not smirking, he'll pick OV. Strokes over you through the warm walls. He has a lot of dialogue too, so I'm just starting to see it all. I have room for another if you want. And yeah, so see, he was smirking there. At least I think he was. No, okay. Well, it wasn't smirking nice. that time. Guess it's just random chance. Let me know when you want out. Go into, uh, his random chance is almost entirely. Pulls you in slowly, throw, squeeze it around you before you slip down into his warm, wet belly. I like these descriptor lines because they're like. They're a little yeah. oh well, but they're not like actually like. They're not. They're not. They're not they're horny. Not they're vorny. They're not horny. They're vorny. There's a difference. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, fair enough. Vorny is the best <coughs> point. Oh. Try to jump I do, over. I really like the tail movement on that. It really just indicates like he's pushing in with his tail. I tried to jump over him and he somehow slipped me into his butt. I'm <laughs> actually trying to do Orovor with no belly, because we haven't seen that yet, actually, that animation specifically. Oh, fair enough. Um, pushes you oh. out the long way. <laughs> what is the long way at this point? I'm not even sure. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> I guess that would be the mouth at this point, given give it, give it it's easier. Shall I give you a personal bed now, then? He. Nope, oh, nope. <laughs> Let's have a burp vi belly vibrate around you. How many quotes do you have? You have a lot. Okay. Thanks, thanks. Hello. He Wait, actually, no, okay, a... finally got oral, I finally got oral vor with no belly. <laughs> it seems like he really prefers the AV. <laughs> I mean, if it there. comes down to it, I think we can edit their preferences or something with pills. True. Well, it doesn't really change the animation, so, you know. Yeah, it means we can get that animation so we want easier. But if pure oil, or you could just remove the air tag. True. If you just want the, if you just want the one way. Um, also hop in. One, one last time. See what he chooses. Ah, uh, chose Orovor that time, surprisingly. I do, uh, once again, though, good belly, just... I like the smirk on this guy. It's a devious. <laughs> Very good, uh, what was his name? Rape. Rape. Caring. His current descriptor is caring. <laughs> the descriptor... <laughs> <laughs> is slipping up. That's, yeah, well, he is a slime dragon, so... <laughs> the... Uh, well, I guess we'll Care for one place to rest might be crazy. It was, he was waiting for fun to enter his lap, so... Yes, he felt wonderful in there. But he's always open for you. Yeah, that's a fun one. I like him. Spotty wants superpowers. Now, well, Spotty have one. wishes they had superpowers. Superpower for the that best is, superpower. That is a superpower. What you gotta give me? Money. Okay. Hi. Come this far to visit our cell, but 
Oh, I think that's just the default text. Yeah, I think that's definitely default. This body has a good belly, though. Yeah. They're practicing their superpower. The power of Vor. By the way, for anybody wanting a descriptor on Vorny, it's kind of a crass term, but basically what it means is somebody who is really into, like, Vorish or some of that fat stuff and stuff like that. But not necessarily in an actual, like, NSFW way. It's more just, like, an intense passion for this subject matter. And, uh... Yeah. A good example is when I was doing, uh... Spire Reignited, there was a few moments where I would just, like, go into a big descriptors about how I really like how the fat wobbled around Spyro's body in specific ways and went into detail. That's that's a bit of, that's kind of being horny. That's a good example, like, just an infatuation and a focus without it being lewd. And there are many kinds of things like this, like you could be porny. <laughs> well, that almost sounds like the actual <laughs> word. <laughs> that it came from, so it yeah. kind of doesn't work. You have, to, you, have to, you, have to, you have to get that. You have to get a proper accent. You have to say parny or something like that. Yeah. <laughs> cool. cool. Alright, so here we have Nightlatch, who is feeling fine. He also has a car bed. Yeah, I believe this is a fox. Here's a little gift, my sweetheart. What? <laughs> okay. See you later in my room, Wink. Oh boy. Oh boy. I, I am- I- but wait, I am spiral. in your room, though. <laughs> now he's just jumping. Okay. I think he's gonna get quite o -o. I think he might be an oo <laughs> fella. He might be an oo fella, I would not be surprised. Oh, he's a double belly, too. Yeah. As yep. the sign shows. Oh. He's all weekend at blood, like, see you later, yeah. cause I can't- I mean- what? After he's done with us, he'll come for blood. <laughs> what is he doing? <laughs> a lot of jumping jacks. He's got to walk out for the way. Got to do some jumping jacks. An overwhelming urge to eat a cutie. Yeah, that's a that's a boring statement. A pred paradise. Sure. He's full of beans. That's We're beans now. Well, we have a few beans, pod-wise. Yeah. Does he say anything else besides... I've got your beans. Oh, well, not anymore since you left. really like winking. He like, <laughs> wink, 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 nudge, nudge, say no more, someone say no more. Come to my room, hint, hint, wink, wink, nudge, nudge, shuffle, shuffle. <laughs> much, much wink, winking here. Yeah. Is there nothing else he does? Is there yeah. else he does? No, that's one of the basic NPCs. Oh, okay. Alright, next room. It's very winky. So, uh... Lee. Lee! Uh, earlier it said he was wanting to avoid social interaction. Hello. Hello. Alright. <laughs> oh, this is an XCOM character. Hi, Hyper again. This, uh, oh, this, this is a multi-pred as well. Multi... Two. Two. Number two, as you can see. There we go. That's a proper belly. So one in this is one in the tail, one in the belly. I got tailed, you got bellied. Oh, the tail's the best. I thought paws were the best. Well, I mean, when it comes to Vor, poor Vor actually isn't actually too good, because there's not many like, good examples of it, I guess. <laughs> But conceptually, it's definitely up there. I don't think I don't think this fella has too much. He has like ellipses dialogue. I think that's his unique dialogue. Come back, Hyper. <laughs> All right, next. Now remember, there was Zarwark and Lucario bellies, and we didn't have the braces for them technically, but we have them here. So this is our, 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 appropriately enough, the Zorok requires a Zoro plush to spawn, which I uh, kind of appreciate. Yeah. Well, you have been chosen. A little sight for you. Use it well. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. 
A good belly hug is a good thing to use. Such a nice person would talk to me. It's a good fat belly yeah. on a very small frame. Zorok's like kind of a li uh, live frame, so it's kind of interesting to see that should, a big belly on it. You're talking about yeah, goggles. I don't think this. Oh yeah, he does make a line. I thought I thought he made it cry. As you can see, or rather here. I don't think he has any unique dialogue though, really. Maybe it's a little unique. I can't tell. It's like generic enough. I can't tell. So Victor is a weird one. I thought Victor Victor has some harsh lights. Not like gulp yeah. when you got a meal eaten. Victor Precious eats four. Some Thank come calling faster. If I re if I release you, I'll have to do it with everyone. All right, go ahead, Mala. Definitely not. Yeah. So here's the thing. He won't release you very easily at all. Come fine. Why would I do that? That's a good question. So that's two. That's two for Vector. Or I guess unleash Victor. the NPCs. So you will need to release one NPC. Oh, we're getting digested in this one. Good. What's up? It is good because it's one of the easiest way. It's like the only way out, I think. Oh yeah. Oh. I forgot that. Ah, oh, so when you... Oh, so what happened with him? He just disappeared. He died, actually. Oh. I think he exploded. I think we have this... Blood, wasn't he do that before he exploded if it was too full? And tried to be trying to get out? I don't know why he didn't do that, to be honest. Oh, well, I whatever. noticed we had two... So two here stacks. we have... Here we have all snaps and teal. So, well, uh... Snap. And that name rings a bell for some reason. Harp fighter and other things. Helix fighter. Ah, oh, yeah. So let's just get him to eat those guys and two of you, I guess. And don't struggle, or you might kill. Him. I wasn't struggling at all. Okay. What's up? We've got two status effects: digesting and being savored. <laughs> Alright, well, they're coming over. Nope, oh, not yet. Make sure to jump in. They're trying to escape. I love when they squirm. Yeah, I'm not squirming. I don't think so, Vec Victor, because that kills you, I think. Um, oh. That's okay, I'll make him walk past them again. No, oh, he just got me out. He did spit you up. I, and also, Blood, you don't remember this? Because I think he... I remember this. I remember him spitting up people, dying, etc. Yeah, I remember him dying, but I don't you know why die he's so doing much. It. If you want to die so much, then be it. So be it. Okay. Yes, please. <laughs> I feel like she's trying to get him to eat her. <laughs> yeah, he's, I think he only wants to eat one person right now or something. Maybe he dies because we're force feeding him too fast. Maybe he does want to eat at a rate. But then again, he also spits up randomly, so I don't know. Our objective is to get. Oh, there we go. That's... Oh, I got eight again as soon as he spat me out. Fair enough, I guess. Actually, try this. Uh, let's see if we can get him to eat one of the NPCs, and then we'll all pile into him really fast. Because <laughs> he it looks like he's only voluntarily eating one person, so. Yeah, so it might be best if uh, Marla gets out to just yeah, back out. out. Yeah, Paula stops getting eaten over and over again for a second. <laughs> he just doesn't want to let me out. out. And I'm just fucking Yeah, now you just gotta wait. And I've got eight and some. Oh, there we go. Yeah, you see. And. Okay. Now you and that's, in. that's three? That's belly size three? And that's then. Three? And then I'm trying to click him, and I'm not, I can't. Oh, uh, you're. I think you're trying to eat him or something. Oh, how? But why? Well, how did I? How did you guys get in? Uh, I think you might have to there. I'm in. I'm in now. Is, is there four of us? Uh, there was indeed four of us in there, so that was the full. Well, he did die, but we got to see the full belly. So. No, I want to get digested though. All right. Yeah, that's fine. Go ahead and get eaten then. What the fuck are you? Oh, I see. It's very confused there. Yeah. <laughs> I hear the excitement. 
mean who doesn't want to get digested by something with good paws? <laughs> I mean, just look at those little paws as he walks. That's so good. Well, you are about to digest. Let's see what happens. Burp. <laughs> Very matter of fact, but okay. So, you dead yet? Oh, there you go. Blarg! Okay. <laughs> I guess I didn't taste that good. How not the, rude. Not the end, at least. Well, that's Vic that's Victor for you. Mm -hmm. He likes he kind of explodes, tastes explodes, but it's also it's also a pretty good, pretty good belly. All right, so let's go to Lucario. Mm -hmm. Here's Lucario. Hi, Lucario. There is a great aura within you. Have a torch. I call help the strength is bond between us. There's a great aura of you. Are you talking about a torch aura now? Mm -hmm. Hmm. There's a great aura within you, too. Now, too. <laughs> <laughs> well, he did the thing again. Oh, uh, uh, <sighs> sorry. I don't know why they like to stick to the edges of the room, but they do that. They often do that. <laughs> yes, did you need something? Sweet aura within you. Yes, you've said that. I think there's great aura within him as well. Oh, okay. Then. All right, I think that's all for the car. He's pretty boring, actually. But not not bad belly though. Not a bad model either. Hopefully, the panel will be better. But I don't it know. Seems Pokemon one. Well, I know Lapunny, I, I only have one, but there, you can actually spot male and female for the Lucario, Lapunny, and the... Lapunny found an item and stored it in the bag. Okay. <laughs> Cute. Hell, Lapunny! Yeah. Okay. I don't know what that means, Hell, Lapunny. Um, Force has a quest. Huh. Okay, I'll have to see about that. Here's Lapunny, but yeah, so I, I chose the male versions for all these, because... As you saw in the other tower, there's enough females, so I figured I'd balance it out <laughs> best I could. Um, has a question mark over its head. I'll check on that. <laughs> there we go. I knew I could get the sound. Oh yeah, actually I didn't get that with Lucario. We need to get Lucario's sound. No. <laughs> if it's possible. There we go. That was actually pretty easy. He knew what he wanted. <laughs> I actually got a slosh sound too. I wonder. Actually, hold on. Wait, wait. I'm gonna wait, wait for him to stop walking. If he would stop walking, stop walking. Okay, thank you. Okay, this is because of struggling. I was wondering. All right, next floor. Bryson? No. All right, here's here's another Gudra. Technically, it's much like the unique Gudra we had earlier, but... I really love hugs, and I really love you, and I really love hugging you! But this Gudra is also has unique dialogue, and it's adorable. As you can tell. I love hugs so much, I'm gonna hug you inside! Hug! <laughs> this is a very cute Gudra. Where'd... where'd Mal, get up here. Mola, he really loves hugs and he really loves you and he really loves hugging you, but not if you're not in the room! There you go. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I just go oh, I actually got in the bed somehow. <laughs> well, maybe it gets better if they got fatter with each finished mill. I think there is something. I think there is an NPC that does that. If I recall. I'm not gonna go through the slime decision again because that would be. Oh, okay. See the other. Hi, hi! I know he has other lines. Hold on. I need to see his other lines. Um, um Forest doesn't have the exclamation point over his head anymore. A very temporary quest. Also, up there we have, uh,. Oh, there I'm Christy. I like to be eaten sometimes. I don't 
mine though for now. I could leave Gudra to eat her, but I just wanted to point out she exists. Oh, I ate her by accident. I guess I, guess I just got out there. Wait, whoa, 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 wait, 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 wait. Actually, back off. I just noticed there was actually, she said something else that was interesting. I need to see if I can get her to. She said something else, but then she interrupted her. So that's the only problem is vo this voice line. Sometimes they, sometimes they, I do not want to be, you are prey. You don't get to decide this. <laughs> There's a, there's a line about her squirming or something. I want to I want to hear. I it think now. I was like, you uh, and I was trying to release her. Oh, you were you were trying to release? Yeah, because. Say, is your stomach growling? It sounds really sexy. Can you put me inside your stomach? <laughs> sure, but then I try again. She's like, I do not want to be eaten. Up with, I do not want to be eaten. She's pretty thundering. Oh, there there we go. So, one press, one e press, just one. <laughs> I don't like. I don't, I don't mind now for now. I like to eat sometimes. I can tell. Time to digest her. I mean, maybe it was when she came out. She had the line. Which release her? Oh, let me out already. That's no fun. He. I didn't realize these prey had. To, I didn't think of trying the unique lines of the prey. As she did, she definitely had another line though. What a lovely day. I guess if I just spam it, I eventually can eat her. I do like how she's like, you tell me sex at one end and then, like, no. Also, never mind, I don't want to. <laughs> like, what? Alright, well, anyways. I think it was just a line that when, when she exited, probably. Yeah. I don't really understand the whole no. The eating thing. <laughs> like, how do I? Actually, now I think about it, she doesn't have the prey tag. Is that the problem? No, she has the prey tag. She does. Just Where? Tucked away there with the avian oh, statue. Oh, okay. Yeah. Like everybody agrees that Gudra is just like just amazing. Yeah, Gudra's good. You don't mind being it's completely a... sticky at any contact. It's a cute. <laughs> Good dragon slug, how can you not find it amazing? Also, I think it's just a time limit thing. Like, after you eat her, she eats like a little while, but. You know, we could reset this really fast, but if we deleted it, delete the thing and then put it back down. Because <laughs> I'm sure that. Because that, that technically will respawn, will spawn a new one, so. A new Christy! Yay. Uh, yay. You won't be seeing your friend for a good long while. Or sorry. Wait, you're not the pred. At least not this time. I do not want to be eaten. How the fuck does this work? You know you could have just asked to do that. I don't mind. Hard. I think she's a cylinder. I've been asking for a long time, but she did mind. <laughs> yeah, no kidding. <laughs> Under a prey, trying to act like a pred. I wonder who kind of could act. Oh, like I don't want to come out. It's nice inside you. <laughs> okay. There was one other line. I don't know how, what it was, but oh, whatever. I guess I'll skip it. It's, it's too tedious. I can't close the door. I can't. Oh right, that's right. I forgot. It's which on me. Uh... Yeah. Hold on a second. Wait. Okay, I missed another line. I'll try it one more time. <laughs> Last try. <laughs> Pre AI is weird like that. Yeah, I didn't really mess with this actually. Mostly just mess with the Preds, which are a lot more straightforward actually. <laughs> Whoever thought the Prey should have a cooldown? Dumb decision. <laughs> Assuming this is even a cooldown, I can't even tell. I don't think it's an exit line that I'm looking for. I think it's a line that she says while she's inside of me, so I'm just gonna 
hold her once I eat her and see if I get the line. There was a long line that looked interesting and I read just like a little bit of it while it was on screen and I didn't see what it said. So let's see if I can spawn one more time. I'm just some general prayer kidnapping. Could be. But I haven't read any of that, so. Now Christy here is uh, somebody who's been prolific in the PD. I've talked to her before too. It's a lot of gift art. Also, there's a straight pixel in front of her when she walks. God damn it! So this is uh, so it helps okay. him come faster if they move first. What's that? Hyper said that the prayer eye it helps him to eat them faster when he lets them move first. Okay. I'll try it again. All right, so I consumed. See if I get the line or not. Because there was a line. That was great fun. Thanks for having me inside. I love the warm, squeezing flesh around me. Especially the noises. That was it. That was the line, actually. That was the one I was missing. Alright, let's close the gate. The thing. Nicely done. Alright. <laughs> that was it. That was the line I, like, half read. And I was like, what is this line? I want to read the rest of it. Afros. In pain. <laughs> Why? <laughs> you could tell. You could just look at his face and see the... Just see the pain in English. <laughs> Why is he in pain? Happy birthday! It's not your birthday? We'll have it anyway. What did you give me? A mall? Three Molotovs for my birthday. Um. Okay. You're not smoking in pain. If you ever just if you ever get lost, just look for my tail. Also, I would <laughs> nice the jumping lamp, animation. Tail lamp. Lamp, lamp. Yep, yep. <laughs> he jumps to communicate. Ooh. I have enough room for you if you want to be in my belly. I'll make sure no one can get you. That, that's cute. I like that. Also, look how blushy he gets. Also, that's the kind of pre That's actually my favorite for a situation. The I'll make sure nobody can get to you. Sort of like prediction. Oh, look, honey has a quest now. Look, look, at how, look how much he's like rubbing his belly as he walks. Ampharos is good. Very good. Yeah, Ampharos is great. He's a walking lamp. And he's got a good guy. Can I eat my lunch first? You are the lunch, silly. <laughs> Just that constant happy face. The world needs more Vora or Ampharos. I agree. My legs need a little break. It doesn't I'm have to be a one-way trip. Let me know when you've had enough. It doesn't have to be a one-way trip. Oh, okay. Yeah. I get it. I'm like, he's just he's a he's clearly a safe bread. That is to say, he doesn't want to digest and stuff. What are you no, doing? It's, it's... What what animation is this? He has some weird hand at movements. I kind of dig. There we go. I was like, where's the Afro sound? There's the Afro sound. Yeah, the Afro sound. Good, I don't think we did. It's just so sad to see my tummy so small again. <laughs> I agree with that statement. Oh, of course! <laughs> you wanna eat? Oh, of course. Remember, he is in pain. I mean, he's thinking about their lost pet now. Oh, Maybe that's why he was, he was in pain, because he lost the pet. That now makes sense. Maybe he ate the pet. Perhaps. Maybe that's where he lost it. <laughs> <laughs> See if I can get any more lines. Aw, I was just having fun. Ooh. I think I've probably seen all those lines. I like these lines. I always like it when they're not default lines and have their own little... Yeah, I'm gonna... <laughs> That's a cute one. I like that one. Alright, over here to the right we have Axon, who's insane. 
Let's get his present. Now we have some prey available, but let's not worry about that just yet. So Axon has two properties. One is the storage, what's the other one? Blood? Adam? What is this oh. what's the special property I was asking? His special property is he has a swallow animation. Oh, okay. Well, so I'll, I'll go into him now. Need for something? Can you just jump in right there? Ah, yeah. Jump right in. So I'm in his tail. I guess we'll need those. I guess we'll need the uh, pre the prey. So we have three prey out here. Kyle, John, Doey, and Nicole. He was thinking how great everyone is. Huh? Currently in his neck at the moment. I am. I haven't been swallowed yet. I guess it, ah, you went for it. You went for it, didn't you? No. Yes, that's right. He, his animation's a bit slow, isn't it? Yes. I guess. I don't see anything going on right now. There it is. So when you're in his mouth, it's impossible to tell. He's currently swallowing. He changes animation. And then eventually, down you go. There. Saw both of us at the same time because of that. Yeah, All right, so so that's two prey. You can see us in there too. Go ahead and uh, unleash the other prey, I guess. And you can you could just be the one. Whoa, watching. Why not interact with the prey a little bit too, without trying to eat them? I guess. See what they uh, have to say. You don't look like a prey. I can use a pole in here if you wouldn't mind. That's not one of your. That's not one of your room requirements. So no. Also, hello. <laughs> Great to see you, pal. <laughs> oh wow, that's quite the girdle. Okay, there's gotta be somebody eating somebody here. Uh, hearts? I don't know why, but sure. Hmm. Actually, yeah, I'll I'll... just take one because he could be very picky. He, he does seem a bit picky right now. Just see the picky eater. Your digestion is taking place, just accept your fate. Well, actually, you don't digest, so at least not with a tag. Uh -huh. Oh, you got the Lucario follow you. That, that's convenient, actually. Just walk her past the guy again and again. That's what I'm trying. And this is why it's better to have actual people to do this interaction stuff. Because... Trying to get the NPCs to eat other NPCs... It's a bit of a crapshoot. And if we want the full belly size, we need him to eat at least two. Yeah. Because he takes a whole five people. The gurgles aren't frequent enough. Yeah, I agree. It could be The sounds could be a little bit more blurpily. Digest into a nice, fattening, nutritional slush. Sounds pretty good. <laughs> oh crap, I spilled some chocolate sauce on my fur. <laughs> Blink says, I would have tried to help, but it doesn't help that I don't have the game. Well then, help is kind of null and void at that point. <laughs> Spilling chocolate on your fur is a real first world problem. Slushy. <laughs> Hmm. So I this. Okay. Only he would eat one of them. At least one of them. On the accent. I thought you were a threat. 
Sure not really demonstrating it. Hmm? Oh, 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 so I do oh, need you oh. I don't know if... Oh, hey. He's moving all over her. Do you like me, Mills? I see you jumping to open mouse like it's a game. Certainly it's a death wish. Why is that dialogue box so high up? <laughs> That's weird. Hmm? Yes, I do, actually. An amoeba for you. <laughs> what does that mean? <laughs> what the fuck does that mean? Oh, it's because he's an amoeba. Ah! Oh! I thought he was a dragon. Makes sense, man. I guess he's an amoeba dragon. He's a dramoeba. I guess that explains the transparency and all. So, uh... We actually already saw the full form of this with the clothing, so I don't really care. He's taking way too long. Just, everyone's staring. I can at least give you the third. Everyone's staring. So. Yeah, that's fair. Mm. Maybe that is what is appetite for the other two. Yeah, I guess he's shy because he's on stream, everyone's staring. <laughs> Oop. Down. Down. There it is. Two people in belly. The way it works, if you remember where the clothing is, then it's another one, of, it's the second one in the tail, and then the third one in the belly. Oh, there we go! Just one of many down my belly. Yes, it would be even faster if you had just taken the pace a bit there, but We I mean, did wet his appetite. Take straw, it just suck up the jelly. <laughs> and tell, right? It just leaves asking him to possibly eat with the other two, which is really... Uh. Moved him over by interacting with the sign. But... Ah. That's right, you can still interact while you're in. So... Yes, go for the tiger. Where he might eat the orca. <laughs> Hello. Oh, well, that might work. Actually, you not you might not want to interact with them because that might interrupt their scripts. Can't say for sure, but yeah. Are we gonna get that fifth meal? That's the question. <laughs> Call your bets. I don't know. <laughs> that is a question. If they move away, I'm giving up. Never mind. Hey! We did it. Thanks for your sacrifice. I was famished. But you should have eaten faster. So then we wait for one more swallow animation and. Are we progressing? Yep. Once the swallow's over, anyways. Very, very slow swallow he does. And three in the belly. Now, if he could just walk himself back to the right so we could see it, that'd be great. Oh, turn. There we go. And you see how it works. Alright, I'm satisfied. Great to see you, pal. I can't get out, okay. There we go. And, uh... There we go. Finally there. Well... <laughs> I just got paid by them. <laughs> I got paid by them while they were inside of him. <laughs> just, op just, like, opens mouth, hand comes out, gives gift, goes back in. That's fine, he can have them. Just let's, uh... Yeah. It's his okay. cabin to cooperate. Now for Yuzuki. Trying to keep their phobies in check. Right, 
bud. Oh, get over here. Just Hi, Blake. I have oh. a ruby or I'm high school, dude. Also, if people are going and coming, I'm not sure who's leaving, who's coming, who's breeding, who's... I don't know. <laughs> I'm getting confused. But yes, welcome, guys. Welcome whoever come... Oh, yeah, the orchid does have unique dialogue. You look tasty. I don't think he has a lot of unique dialogue, but he does have some. Look tasty. I think that's all he says. And come. Oh. Well, that's quite the belch. Come back. Well, I appreciate the belch. That does make up for the lack of words. Concern about their blood pressure. <laughs> Cursed the dexterity. <laughs> Cato. Cato, the Ethan one, is Christian the dexterity. Axon, who ate a ton of pizza, is worried about their blood pressure. And fight inspiration for their blog. Nicole, well being belly, is compulsively licking lips. What is the hell? I just love these stats. <laughs> Eating people to find inspiration for your blog. Okay, anyways, let's go over here. This is Nin the Fulf, rocking the boat. Floor 12. We're getting there. Oh, I have to give you something now? Ugh, oh, fine, I stole this earlier. Thanks, I guess. Hey. He makes an interesting little purr noise, actually. It's kind of quiet, but I think it's there. I the avian base dialogue. You better not try to get out base. before you're done. What's that? Uh, the little coup that you hear. That's the um, avian base speech. Oh. So you'll just be another layer of pudge. Oh yeah, this one digests. Well, I certainly won't say no to free food. Oh, yes, also eats two people. Hey. Did the thanks, belly get... Guys. Wait, actually, hop out. Did the belly get bigger? I believe it did. Someone need a good gurgling? Yeah, it did. did but yeah, I should be letting you go. <laughs> yeah, let's digest together now, then. <laughs> <laughs> a plus burp. Yeah, I, that was a very good burp. I don't even I think I can compare to that. Well, okay, if I drink a bunch of soda, maybe. Though I do have the ability to burp on command, which a lot of people don't have the ability to do. I know how to swallow air just right. Yeah, I can. I think I can actually do that too. Uh, demonstration. Hmm, <laughs> <laughs> I can yeah, still I go can... for more, licky face. <laughs> yeah, I, I need a bit of build up to do uh, mine. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> Are we just having a little burp off now? I mean, burps are. I mean, I feel. I feel like in the middle of a plane by the pound about four. I don't think it matters. Too. I don't think it's too yeah, inappropriate. No. <laughs> <laughs> Not bad. <laughs> yeah, I can do it sometimes. Where is he going? But no, but I shall call him back. <laughs> I am, I impressed the entire Vore service, so I'd say I do too. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> Fair enough, Cinnamon. <laughs> Actually, burp the alphabet. Also, yeah, I how is that. everyone's Christmas? Theme? It'd be a little. Did everyone have a great Christmas? I mean, it's all right. This is my this this stream is my Christmas thing, basically. So, <laughs> do not clip my verse. But... Too late. Uh, next to burp on command, you need to trap the air just behind your throat to force it back out. That's how I do it, anyway. <laughs> I'm trying to think about, like, explaining the motion. The, the, like, the mouth motion for it, but... You inhale a little bit of air. Keep it in your mouth. Close your mouth. And just kind of push up with your tongue, and it kind of gets tucked into a pocket. And then you can burp it. Yeah, that's what I mean by trap it behind your throat and then force it out. I guess it's like, you know, do your normal breathing, but but then hold the air in your mouth. And instead of, like, opening your airways, just try to, like, swallow it, basically. A little bit. Mm. Yeah, There's I'm a good meal. Turn away in a belly like you were designed. <laughs> I'm about to die, actually. I'm almost so what are you doing in that elevator shaft? Get back over here. Back into the light. 
to see the nice round. We will digest together. I think mm, it's when And now you're to all die. mine. <laughs> I will interrupt if you say it a lot. I want to read it out. Burp ASMR? I mean, I can. I already made one ASMR video. I could do another one. Did, uh, did you die or something? It might take a bit. Remember that other one that took a little bit? Yeah, might be like Gutra where we'll be digested if we exit or something. Aww. Uh, um, Skidakade said, You're one of the best presents I could ask for, Churn. Aw, thanks. <laughs> I try. I try. With my content. Yeah. Meh, I'm sure I'll find you something even better. Why are you saying meh? You literally digested me. Alright, well. Um, interesting charm. Axum died. Oh, that's too bad. <laughs> Why'd he die? I, I don't know, he's just respawned now. Huh. He's considering taking up a new hobby, perhaps one that doesn't kill him? Uh, I mean, that's not going too far. Hey, Nicole! He's already eating Nicole! Again. Nicole, who, ate some, who has been eaten, is feeling fancy. <laughs> it really takes a while for you to digest on... No, you have to leave. You have to leave. I, 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 I left. I, that's how I died. Though he yeah, does not see the reap. Get digested, Lam. Well, I certainly won't say no to free food. I'm gonna try to get out before you're done. This feels so wrong! Wait, hold on. I saw that. Bosh and Blango. Hold on. There's a good line there. I saw a good line. Like one I hadn't seen before, basically. Nope. Oh, I'm not trying to access. I swear, I wish the exit button was not the same as the. Yeah. What are you doing? He's shake, sick. shake, free punch. Well, okay, there you go, food. That was that was the line. I appreciate dancing with a belly. That's good. All right, next up. Is not Rayquaza. It looks like one though, doesn't it? Lalim. Lalim. Let's see what he gives us. He's a scientist. Shuffling towards us. You taste different today. Mm -hmm. Oh, let's get out of the way. You can have this. The other guy will be needed where he's at now. <laughs> what? What? So you see, there's yeah. a bulge in the belly. So is this? Uh, this is just. This is just eats. There we go. And there's a bulge in the throat. There's a much I could say except yum. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. There is an animation on this one, actually. I'd like to keep you for a long time. And you're in the tail. Yeah, the battle place. Screw the stomach, I'll take the tail. And in the top left, the prayer for this one is rich. Thanks for making you a place to stay. Can you stay a bit longer next time? Yay. Over oh, too soon. Mind those teeth there, very pointy. And I was enjoying myself. Look at all the stars around you, so pretty to look at, right? Are they in. What, is there stars inside of you? I mean, maybe. Oh, well, maybe it's like a galaxy dragon or something like that. And I thought we were. Spend quality time together. Move more. I want you to move around more. I, I dig that. Very demanding. <laughs> All right. So about this guy. So this is so this is another rich the Zerua boy. He's like a Zerua demi boy guy. Huh, like human cute. human Zerua mix. Try, I, I dig demis. Demis are cool. Um. Anyways, let's see if we can get. Hello. No. 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 He didn't want. I didn't mean to eat you. It only took two interactions. All right. <laughs> no. I guess he wasn't fond of that. Well, he's lucky. Yeah, like I'm gonna need a really long shower. I do not want to be eaten. I don't want you coming too close to me. Yeah, there just seems to be a prey cooldown. It's not a glitch. It just seems like there's a prey cooldown. Uh, Why? Uh, try doing what Hyper suggested and letting him walk first before trying again. Actually, I just, let's just forget about what happened. <laughs> That's fair. I'll wait for him to walk. I just was using this opportunity to see the other lines that he had. So, Marla, I think you got a new admirer. <laughs> <laughs> so, 
So delicious. Oh wow, you do. Look, you're even creating hearts on him now. He really likes you. Yeah. Fine by me. <laughs> well, Zoro doesn't. The, the rich is not moving, so. Oh, don't interact with me. He hasn't moved yet. <laughs> you broke your. You broke the rule you told me to follow. Good work. Well, he's just being eaten anyway. Don't fire. This is a one-way trip. <laughs> well, fair enough. Hi, Asler. Christmas festivities finally left you alone. I wish the one with real dog. I like how I like how he's moving. By the way, it's like what move what looks like he's too heavy to move very fast. Looks like I'll move in this case a little bit faster, but. How much more preds that had like digesting lines actually digested? Thanks for making me a place to stay. Hello. You're an eager one. Oh, wait, what? Oh, I guess he hadn't had three yet. <laughs> I miscounted, that's true. Uh, I'd want tucks away somewhere else. <laughs> <laughs> Sheepy Missy Amphros, yeah, that's true. How dare he have Christmas events? <laughs> Alright, well. I don't think I can get Zerua out. The Zerua out, the rich. Unless I'm lucky. I mean, that why would you want to let him out? He's better off inside. Oh, Car, you must have been in that call for a while. I haven't heard head nor tells you in a bit. Rich, what's Rich doing? Rich is out. Rich is looking for a romance. Is this the right place? Rich is thinking you're a lovely person. No, Lalum's looking for romance. Sorry, Wait, what was that sound? Wait, that's why. What What did he say? I missed that dialogue. Like I was looking at the stats. said size and bliss. Sighs and bliss, I like that. The bliss yeah, of bloatedness. Um, I can't get out because I keep interacting with Rich while inside. <laughs> <laughs> I do not want to get eaten, says Rich. Too late for that. I love... That just put the mental image of just Marla trying to get out, but Rich just sat on top of him. <laughs> Rich just sat on top of me, talking at me. I don't want to be eaten! <laughs> there was an Afros? Yeah, this is why, uh... This is why, uh... I mean, if you gotta it's go, it's... E if you gotta go for the stream... If you gotta get away from the stream, you gotta go for the stream, I completely well, understand, but, like... it's two floors down, I'm sure we can make a quick detour back to the Afros. What's he doing? He's flowing. What does that mean? Uh, well, he's, like, <laughs> maybe, like, Tracy's flowing? He's getting ready to go Mega Afros with a flowing hair. Rich and Lollum are, like... What the hell? I guess I'm gonna beam up since I'm trapped in here. I'll look down so the Ampharos is shown again. <laughs> He's jumping very happily. Hundred dollar bill each? Oh, that's pretty nice. Alright. Let's go ahead and, uh... I guess let him have those two prey, I guess. Trembling with excitement. For you to be in his belly again. Yep. Yum. <laughs> I'm in Lamp. Lamp is mine. I received lots of money from my grandparents that I feel kind of guilty over it. I don't think you should feel guilty, Car. I mean, especially considering you tend to. You've helped other people, such as me, with money before, so. I mean. I am so big! Look at my belly! Okay, I'm glad we came back because I hadn't seen that line before. That's adorable. It's, it's like a very, like a, like a new pred thing to say, like, I ate this guy and oh my gosh, I'm so big now that I have eaten this whole person, wow. <laughs> That's cute, I like that. I'll just stay in here for a while. Okay. But I need you upstairs, but okay, I'll need you upstairs I'll in a minute, in a few minutes. In, so I'll just stay here, I guess. 
Also behind you. <laughs> I am hearing a lot of gurgles. Why am I hearing a lot of gurgles? Uh, yeah. <laughs> I, I, Lynn upstairs wishes they had a coloring book. Okay. <laughs> I see. All right. Hello, Newt. How you doing? Hello. This is not Yoshi. This is not Yoshi at all. Who said that? <laughs> Their name. Their name is Yoshi. Their name is Yoshi. They just want to be at home. Relax. What are they doing? <laughs> having a mild freakout. If you remember, they did eat so quite similarly to like Yoshi. That's a good. That's a good cheek puff. <laughs> it's very silly. What is he doing? Working off his new charming. That's a good girl. Looks charming. <laughs> Family social gathering Afro's for. Look, it's just a different type of social gathering, except for the gathering's inside of a belly, and it's very social because you're right up against them. <laughs> Anyone else want to track the floors instead? Come on, getting bored out of getting bored there, Epic. <laughs> All right, I don't think this guy does much besides what we saw. Actually, no, yeah, he has a unique swallow animation. That's his thing. All right, next room. Hey, black mom. I know. I if I close the door on him, he'll notice. He should get the fuck over. <laughs> that's, that's that's my logic. <laughs> All right, here's a naga. I, I, this is kind of a naga. Yeah, Why should I pay naga. you? I should eat you. I mean, this is true. And this guy is a four, so. I will need to do this. So, I realized only after the fact, but so we have another teal here. But we also have Shin Kitsune, who I was like, I know that name. And then I looked it up later and I was like, oh yeah, that's right. So, um, I actually, oh wait, hold on, actually. I gotta do another double check of something now. Just a moment, please. Oh, I love this animation. Going yeah. Bad. Yeah, I, I actually did a commission for them. Shin Katsune, that is. Who tripped over ah, a rock good. earlier. So, uh, I mean, I hope this doesn't trigger somebody, but I will go ahead and point it out, because I'm sure somebody will wonder this. Um, if I can get them to, like, move. Um, hi. So... Talk to them enough that they should follow you. Yeah, that's true. If I, but they're on top of each other, so... I do not want to be eaten. Your last use. Oh, he has a... Custom swallow animation. We didn't mark that. Oh, no, we did. Yes. He does. I was mentioning it earlier. But, uh, anyways, what I was going to say is that I didn't realize this first. I thought you just had shorts. No, um. Shin's a diaper fur, so, uh, oh. yeah. Yeah. Uh. It'll be a rough trip. Well, oh, he's looking a bit chubbier when he swallowed that time. I know that's going to trigger somebody, but I just figured I'd go ahead and just say it. It's whatever, man. I don't care about that, Wait, honestly, as long as it's... Here's the thing, guys. I I only think that's a bad if it's uh, a bit filthy, which, you know. If as it's not, long it's as fine. they're clean. Yeah. So. Yeah, people like when they're like... Actually, funny thing. I've mentioned this story a few times now. Um... But it's, it's what psychologists call little space when people are interested in, like, age regression stuff. It's, for some people it's a kink, but for other people it's actually a form of therapy. Um, which is completely understandable. It's like a, bringing yourself to a simpler comfort zone. Which I actually identify with because, um, while I don't do that, um, I am a dog. And sometimes it's nice to just get away from my sentience and just be a dog and keep my, and simplify my brain for a bit. Which I don't really get the opportunity to do very often these days, but... Basically, the idea of, like, regressing, whether it be age or sentience, is actually really therapeutic. I could speak from personal experience. Just simplify your mind. It's like um, it's like a form of meditation. Literally, some stuff can't bother you because you've simplified your brain to for, you know, a period of time. So you cannot be bothered by the stresses of life. A lot of stresses of life. It's really refreshing, actually. So I totally understand the baby fur aspect in that regard. Um, it makes a lot of sense. Mm -hmm. 
You won't escape. This is just temporary. This is this is what you would call escape. But let's hide there. Do you have unique dialogue? My hi, my name's Shin. Nice to meet you. But anyways, anyways, what I was trying to get to. I know some people have a problem with this, but uh, Shin's actually a nice guy. Like I said, I did a commission with him. For him, um, I did a joint commission with Flame for him, uh, where my Charmeleon self ate his Vulpix, uh, which is cute. His Vulpix had a diaper, but honestly, it was, it was all safe, you know. It's still a really cute picture. <laughs> Meep, you sh I, at least you should have asked first. I don't ask, I take... I'm just bringing us back to the, the old days, sh Shed, when I ate you with that picture. <laughs> I said was helpful as a father figure. What's that? I'm just wanting Carmen to at least eat a ball. <laughs> Meat blush as well. That was fun. Oh, somebody's gonna eat in here, I think. Oh, they're having a conversation. Enjoy your freedom while it lasts, my prey. We need to get four. We need to get at least one NPC into the snack to get four. Yeah. I'm trying to get you. Eek, you, sh you is someone new to be eating me. Well, thank you for showing me your tummy. Are you someone who wants to eat me? I do not want to be eaten. The rate, because the Kotzel will not like this. I wonder who that is. I don't think it's him. He's That's Carmen. Teal, <laughs> create awkward man. silences while standing talking with somebody. That's good. Quetzalcoatl is a Mayan god. I think it's Mayan. Hi there, person I don't know. Nice to meet you. <laughs> Creating awkward silences with the person who is compulsively licking their lips. So people there act we like, go. There we go. Your last use. Okay, well now we can all file in, I guess. Well, let's use to this one. I like his little jog with his arms when he moves. <laughs> that yeah. power jog is kind of great. He likes your jog. He does seem to. But yeah, the uh, pet space and little space. I actually didn't hear the, the term, hear the terms pet space, but little space I have heard. Also, it's not even a thing for furries. There's, uh, the, the regression, the age regression thing is totally just a thing. That, I hope the loot is plentiful today. Enough waiting, oh. I must eat. We need to wait for him to manually eat us now. That's fine. We're interacting with whoever's yeah, eating. Yeah, that's fine, he'll do it. <laughs> No, uh, you can double tap and get on him. If you hover over his head, it sort of interacts with his tail is getting thicker. It'll be oh. a rough trip. Yep. Oh. Okay. I'll call him back over here. How are you doing, Shen? I'm um, high. I will eat you, and then I will get eaten, and then he'll have five. <laughs> <laughs> I have to compress pretty. Mm -hmm. <laughs> there, I did it. <laughs> All section. Home sweet home. Yeah, little space is nothing to do with furries. And it makes a lot of sense, honestly. I mean, like, obviously it can be used... It can be used... A lot... <laughs> I like the... There isn't much I could say except yum. <laughs> I don't think I saw the Rayquaza knockoff say that before. Furry <laughs> has a really big thick tail. Yeah, it does. But uh, what I was gonna say was like, uh, with like, like with any odd interests or anything that um, does encapsulate a part of your, uh, I guess you know what you do, it can be done harmfully. Anything can if done excessively or done incorrectly. But honestly, I think the little space thing is actually really a good thing for a lot of people. Yes, there are some. All right, time to leave. Oh. Food as you always have been. He did not let you leave, did he? Oh, he did not. <laughs> Pop my tail on the way out. <laughs> He's not letting me out either. Come on. He's right. He's having the issue with the. Hmm? Should be able to get now. Out now. Teal's my name. Treasure's my game. Hmm? I'll just be mouth again. Okay. <laughs> oh, well, um, um, Shin. Shin. The best way to exit a predator, I guess, teleporting away. 
Alright, there we go. Problem solved, except for Glenn's running around for some reason. <laughs> there we go. Oh, uh, Mallow. Okay, um, call him over. Call him to the left. There you go. Okay. So, um, next up, slightly spicy character. Let me gift. So this character talks in emotes, <laughs> which is kind of silly. Uh, well, and means... I believe that this is an android character, and that's why it's nothing but emotes. Oh, okay. And also color oh. emotes. All right, fair enough. So this is a human. Actually, I'm kind of fond of this for. Um, this is actually a different tag, but basically it doesn't bother me any because it looks like Orovor, regardless. So, because this is, has no animation, as I can demonstrate. Boop, belly. <laughs> and there are no voice lines to talk about. That's a bit of all you are totally in the belly and nowhere else. <laughs> Wait for her to walk around. It's a good wobble. For some reason, I like this particular human better than the other ones. I don't know why. Maybe it's the fact that the fucking breasts are reasonable or something. I don't know. Android characters are interesting. They're not over the top. Yeah, it's just like, and also I just, I don't know, the belly has nice, I like those little like midlines. It gives a good distended feel to it. It's like good shading. Why isn't she moving? <laughs> she is not. She's just, 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 just basking, I guess. There we go. There you go. Like, it's a good sway. It's a good sway. Like we got proper death and okay. And then we walking. Okay. That's interesting. <laughs> Which actually that the Android aspect would explain why she seems to have like some sort of green thing over eye. Oh, exclamation. Oh, right. She has a special character characteristic too. If I spend long enough in her, uh, she will, sh the belly will shrink. So another reason to stick around. Also, I did. I do think at one point I did catch one single line from her uh, that wasn't emotes, but I don't remember what it was, and or how I got it. There we go. See, the belly's getting smaller. Which also makes it hard to get out. Yeah. Of your Pleasure. <laughs> <laughs> I guess that's talking, kind of. Close <laughs> Honestly, seeing that she uses colored text, I'm surprised the other characters don't use colored text for some stuff. <laughs> Pleasure. <laughs> That's very straightforward, but you know. How to announce my emotions from now on after I've just ate something. Satisfied. <laughs> Sated. <laughs> It does take a while, but if I keep waiting, I think it gets smaller. It's straight to the point. Yeah, it is. Doesn't she get smaller? I'm pretty sure she gets smaller. Maybe not. That, I thought for sure. <laughs> uh, yes, it gets to the point where you can't even see the belly. Yeah, it just gets to like neutral. It uh, just there, takes there, a while. I was like, yes, I, I was like, I thought there was at least one phase. I was right. Da bump. Superior seems like a chubby steak. It is kind of. Except for. <laughs> it's not Christmas anymore. What? No, it is. Hush. It hasn't been for two hours. <laughs> I have three more. <laughs> now, if only we could force, like, snow weather or something. Actually, is there a way to change the weather of a biome? 
Or uh, one, not with without Punisher. Wow. Okay. 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 Man, this takes a while, doesn't it? Technically, it should be one more phase. It would appear that the um, new name for the superior above you is Smug Period. Mesa? I see Mesa. Oh, Smug Period, everyone is naming them. <laughs> oh, we did it. I think it went smaller. Is that is that all the way? Um, I believe so. No, it goes even smaller than that. Oh my thing. god. You have to wait like fucking 10 minutes to get all the way down. <laughs> well, I'll be damned. This, this, star, this Starbound Vormod showcase will actually be the entire street. We just have so much content here. None we're of not, it is long winded whatsoever. We're not done. It still goes up higher. <laughs> when I said this was a second tower, I meant it. It is, admittedly, I don't think it's quite as tall, but it is, uh. Oh, it's not as tall, actually. Well, but but there, it's, still, uh, it's still decently sized. Oh, yeah, we've still got a uh, bit to go through. Honestly, this is a Christmas stream, so it's still Christmas until the stream ends. That's how it works. <laughs> can't really, can't really deny it otherwise. So we're waiting for the final little stage of this, just because. Why not? I guess since we're this far done. What are you doing? Oh. There you go. NPCs take up more time than furniture items because there's more nuance. Than warmth. Warmth. <laughs> the final reward of warmth. <laughs> oh. What? Oh, what? So if I, if I struggle now, the belly will actually go up in size, as you can see. It's like I, I re, I push my way back forward. There. It's been very tightly compressed. <laughs> very tight compression going on. Not digestion, compression. I'm... Um, do you not know? Have you seen their new status? I don't think we want to know why. <laughs> I left the toilet seat up! There's no toilet in here! What toilet seat? <laughs> That's what I want to know. I'm trying to see if they have any. I could have sworn they actually said one. Actually, maybe it was just the warmth and the pleasure. I think that's the, the lines they actually said. But that's all for that guy. That. I again, that human, not bad actually. I really like how the sprite work was done. So here's one of the. Well, okay, I got immediately eaten trying to enter. Um, the bug. Who let you inside? You? <laughs> are you talking about the room? Or are you talking about the belly? I should. Okay. okay. Oh, they have a book. I need to speak. Okay. I think he's already gave whatever his gift was. Yeah, also it's... Somebody took my gift. How rude. Also, he's pretty boring. He doesn't do much. We also saw his costume before, so... Oh, uh, Fox took it. Oh. How about... Mesa wants to break free. You might want to... Here, don't let them run. Don't let them run free. NPCs feel more alive while furniture more personal. I say they have each other own place and belts. Also, furniture is more straightforward. You can immediately get to the. Uh... Perhaps you'll pay me for rent. Perhaps. What is your special property, Superior? You keep saying don't eat me, but that hasn't stopped me yet. <laughs> we haven't even started, technically. Let's just see what kind of lines we got here. I guess the uniqueness will be in the animation. Rake said, yes, how yeah. did you get that mod to work? Which one? <laughs> Delicious. So it's a unique swallow. Nice Good place to rest of a mill. 
Rest off a mill? I think you forgot an F there. No rest of a mill. <laughs> He's having the rest of a mill. But I'm all one mill. Maybe you are he's walking off another meal while eating you. He's escaping. All mine like a duck's. Oh, he's eating my Ooh, That's unique. That's right, they can call names. Well, don't do that, but... So, I wonder uh... wonder if you'll go deeper. I imagine... Keep trying to interact with it, see if it has any other lights. I'll show you who's master around here. Hmm. Bulk has gone down. Yes, yes, it has well. actually. He's moved his he's moved his uh, 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 vine position. Yeah. Very yeah. slow slide. Well, it's a snake. That actually is appropriate. I think everything is moving so slow, just purely due to the amount of entities on the map. It could be. Also, I like how the Edward girls have a pleasure of nothing going on. <laughs> Oh, I wonder what they're doing in the corner over there. They're systematically, they're systematically counting every pixel. I guess that gives them pleasure as an android. That's... <laughs> There's a nice hefty throat ball, I agree. So this will move lower and lower if we give it time. Yep. And as far as animation speed, um, I agree. It's probably due to the... Well, this is a huge tendency, so there's there's a lot of... There's a lot of script to go to. Oh, yeah, we just went lower. I progressed further. Oh, thank you, Tubby. I have been trying hypnosis. I felt Chael Phantom Seance just now, and it was really something. Oh, that's a cool, that's a cool mode I got. Also, hypnosis and Tell Phantom. I get you what you mean. I recall... A long time ago, that Caleb had a dream where he would turn into a Charizard, and then when he woke up from it, he actually felt Charizard attributes for a while, until you tell. That was a long time ago, and perhaps the first inkling of the attunement to us, the personalities, perhaps? I'm not sure. Hey, Charm, Prima Victoria. Um, the Vor one. Okay, you're asking how he got the Vor to work. I just... I don't know at this point. It took so there's so much time. I don't actually remember. And Prima Victoria, okay. I don't know what that means, but all right. I went even lower, by the way. You can see a bulge there, uh, right here, where my yeah, mouth is. Yeah. Where the uh, yellow arm line is. is. Yeah. So the question is, and the other line too. The question is, is that as low as I go? I'm not sure. Oh. I think you'll go deeper into the tail for sure. Oh, you've sure. just gone into the tail now. I did. So, go for the yellow mark now. Oh yeah, I see the I see the uh, curvature of it. Now the question is, is that the end? Of the of the t of this little trip, <laughs> I'm sure it will go deeper, maybe. It could, or it could just be there because that's the middle, ish. Yeah, and I guess it isn't. Oh, there you go. There you go. Oh, yep. <laughs> oh, look how it's wet, wobbling too. That's good. So it's that as far as we're going. Well, I assume you're gonna go deeper. That doesn't really seem like a good end point. True. Now the question is, do we want to do this with the snake to the left, which is technically also like this snake, but we'll also do this for the same amount yeah, of time. It's a I don't uh, know if I. I mean, if they're reskins, we don't really need to see them both, do we? At least not all the way. I just want to see how far this goes, if any further. Seems like it takes about a minute and a half for, per phase, feels like. 
You flipped your tank? What the hell does that mean? Oops, I just like dumped my entire goldfish tank over again. I should really stop doing that. <laughs> oh, I did go lower, I think. Where am I? Guys? I think you've gone past the second yellow mark, maybe? I'm also gurk. I'm also lots of gurgling. Soon I'll be your master forever. Uh, is this progressing to something? Yeah, I see it. Uh, I see what I you're talking you did, you would just be hard and body now. Yeah. And World of Tanks. Okay, that makes more sense. Now that we're kind of in the background, it's hard to tell where we are, though. <laughs> just accept that you're on my Especially mill like a dox, you'll never escape. It's hard convincing people they're nothing but my food. <laughs> I mean, how can it be that hard? Like, you've just been true. trying to convince the wrong people, though. Hmm. Possibly. I can't tell where I'm in am anymore. So if, I'm, I, if, if there's progress, I'm I can't tell. I'm pretty sure you're like where the second yellow mark is. Yeah, I think so. The question well, is, I, I really I'm sure don't. You'll go a bit deeper. So that might be the end point. That would be a reasonable end point, but I'm not yeah. sure. Just give it a bit more, just to make sure, I guess. I guess watch the rightmost part of him and see if that bulges. That would probably be the next thing that would. Yeah. The Sephira might be a tad bit obsessive, just a little bit. I think most Preds are in this. <laughs> Quite a few Preds can be. I mean, it's not like that's a bad tray. No, no. Also, I think it's been high. I think it's been long enough for the it to progress if it had if it went further. At this point, you know. Yeah. I think I'll get out now. <laughs> Why should I? You belong to me now, like ducks. Yeah, your his now. No escapes my coils, except your place. Struggling you is do. pointless, just relax. It's your fate. Mmm, thanks for the belly rub, but I'm still not letting you out. If only this was a digester, that you would be so, so much nice as a squirming bulge. Luckily, you'll be that way forever. You really should learn. I'm going when I'm reading voice lines. You maybe should shush. <laughs> sorry. Yeah, sorry. I only I have to read them immediately because then they go away before I finish reading them. Otherwise, <laughs> oh, I saw something new there. Hold on. It's okay. Fine, but only so we can do this all over again. There's like one other line I missed, but whatever. <laughs> Oh, blood is also experiencing the other snake. Anyways, what were you saying there, though? I was saying I wish ones that acted like that would be digesters. What is that sound? Goggles? They gurgle. No, there was like a high-pitched noise. Did you not hear that? No, I don't. It sounded like running can. water or something. I'm sure the stream goers heard it. I'm not sure what that was. Flying around just makes it easier to enjoy you. Well, this guy has different lines. Oh, she's jumping. <laughs> Keep saying, don't eat me and I'm not food, but we both know that's a lie. Yeah, I don't know what that was. I suppose I can drink this out a little longer, but I'm still not letting you out. <laughs> oh, I see the more you struggle, the you go back up. Yeah. Delicious. Oh, mouth, mouth shot. I like. Oh. He didn't like it. Yeah. Um. There he is. He exploded. <laughs> uh, hi. Hmm. Well, okay then. That's a good slime. That's a good mall shot, though. Like how it hangs for a second. Yeah, the nice slow descent is very nice as well, to a point. Oh, Albrecht, I, that would drive me insane if I had that. I'm sorry to hear that. You could have made that an option, Esla, but there just wasn't really that much difference between them. What was an option? 
uh, baking every single one of them a digester. Oh. That would have been... Yeah. So what was that much difference between them, apart from just poofing out of them? Hmm. Mm. Teases you. The tongue loops around your neck, giving a squeeze, letting you know who's in charge. Oh, wow. Oh, he has, like, maw specific lines. Hold on a minute. I gotta test this out. He said something else that would look interesting. Mm -hmm. See if I can trigger it. Mm -hmm. You're going the wrong way, but I suppose it's only temporary. I'll try to get his voice lines if anything else. Mm -hmm. There was another there's another like action line he said that I missed. The tongue explores your form intimately, distracting you from escape. Hiss. Oh my. That's a slightly oh whoa there. Yeah. Oh, them doubles are tongues. I mean... A, a good snake tongue is a good thing to oh whoa at. It's easy to have fake swallows, letting you know where you'll be heading. Okay, I'm satisfied. I think I'll get out now. Or attempt to. Oh well, another time perhaps? Like now! Apparently, because you really hate me again. <laughs> hey, that's not nice. Oh my. <laughs> so let's see. Here we have um, Jump Desi really Jump like Desi Jumper. Feeling confident. What the hell name is that? Alright. I'm not mistaken, they're a kangaroo. They, would, they appear to be. Well, what did you expect from something called Jump Desi Jumper? Were you again, Traveler? Like kangaroo. Gift time. <laughs> I'm sorry, I didn't bring you anything. Gives token. That that is a sub. That is e anything though, technically. His lines seem pretty boring, so. Yeah, I think he's. Not really saying much to me. You can tell which uh, mod artist, uh, which character makers put more effort into the characters than others. I mean, beyond the visuals. Visuals are nice, but like the dialogue really does kind of create a nice accent. Also, I think you broke snack. <laughs> Has a great uh, an an antecedent to share, though. Forever. Trinity Swordfish is eating me. Um, okay. <laughs> That's Shibani. Here's a gift for all your help. So this is another one with generic dialogue, so I'll probably just get out and uh Yeah. Nothing too exciting there. If you want exciting, this harpy's pretty interesting. Ooh. First off, I kinda like the design. Yeah, two wings. Pretty nice. I found your present. Harpy token. Oh, Hello. Mm -hmm. Would you help me brush my feathers? Mm -hmm. I'm hearing like gurgling to the left. I'm not sure why. Mm -hmm. There's another line she could say though. Hold on. Mm -hmm. Besides the brush line. I know there's another. So what's the unique one of this? Uh, time. It's one of those time in. But unfortunately, I don't think it'll take as long as the snake. <laughs> Thankfully. Shibani? Turn for the person to pronounce your name correctly? Nice. I seem to have that knack sometimes with weird names. Okay, I cannot. I want to get the other. She does have another line. You don't need me. I'm not your mother yet. <laughs> I got eight, so is that the other line? Oh, do you want to be the one? I guess you can be the one doing it. No, well, I just got eight, so I guess she chose me to be the one. Alright, just, uh, I think you need... Actually, what takes do you have? Like, status effects. I just have the devoured one. Okay. Eaten. I can't wait for you to meet your new brothers and sisters. 
This one's a, this one's one of the spicy ones technically, but you wouldn't tell from the visuals. Come back, come back. You're being taken away. <laughs> but no windows for it to fly away. <laughs> Good, because it would just crash into it. <laughs> You just stay in there for a while. Are you adjusting? Or just no wait. You know that's right. No, I remember how this works. You just have to stay there for a while and then eventually exit. I'll let you know when it's probably a good time. Yeah. Alright. It's hard to guess with the uh, delayed animations. A little bit. It's okay. That being said, it doesn't take that long. So. Mm -hmm. Honestly, I think you're good now. Alright, so I'll get out then. Mm -hmm. Oh, no, I was no. wrong. Uh, Curses! <laughs> oh, well, um. Well, My turn. your turn to try now, I guess. <laughs> Let's set a timer. I was going to suggest, actually, if you like, one of us sits in a while, the other one starts, while the other two go exploring the other NPCs. Actually, that's a good back. idea. That's a good idea. One of you one of you sit down here for a bit. and, and Sit in the heartbeat, please. <laughs> it's a good idea. All right, Mala can join me. And we'll come back. We'll come back. That's a okay. good idea. Um, all right, Set so time. you're a kid now, you're a squid now, or is it the other way around? Um, anyways, that's that's both. thanks for letting me hang out here. Stay fresh. No, that's custom line then. Yeah. Stay fresh, because you taste better fresh. Also, oh, for some reason, there's some teleporting below us. I don't know why. Also, uh, I do like how the squid kid's belly is, like... I mean, technically, I have a proper skin tone, so I don't really know why it's black. Maybe it's like, actually, maybe it's like a. I don't know. I don't really. I don't know why it's a black belly, but it looks good at the same time. Huh? I guess it's a skin tight suit. Close. Skin tight suit? Yeah, it could be. Hmm? Stay fresh. <laughs> Hi, Epic. Oh, good night, to Epic. Delayed animations. I've had it on go to one FPS. Fortunately, I have a decent computer now. Come back any time you feel like a stay in a warm squid kit belly. Bum. Yum. What do you need? Yeah, talk to him a bit. See what it, if he says, it says anything else interesting. I'm curious to look up who's like, teleporting. Actually, if you just close the gates, yeah, go 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 check if you want. I'm kind of curious myself yeah. at this point. Okay, one quick happen. It looks like one of the prey. One of the prey, probably. They're pro just if you close their gates, it'll probably be fine. I mean, it tastes better than usual. I think you just said. It's like a spandex undersuit. Think of Under Armour. Fair enough. Guess it helps protect you from getting splattered by tons of ink while playing Splatoon. But yeah, spandex plus volor and such. Good stuff. Generally. I think I might have got it. I think it might have been the Zora Demi. Yes, that's right. Sydney is feeling I good. It might have been the one above them. Did, oh no, they just teleported again. Okay, I see who it is. It's Shin. Makes sense. But he just teleported back up to his normal place, so he should be fine now. Mm -hmm. 
Not too many unique dialogue lines here. Yeah, at least there's a few. Yeah. But should we go one more before we check in? in yeah, the yeah. one more. Just be sure. Okay, so here we. Well, anyone who I can overpower, I eat. Also, blush it uncontrollably. Quinn. What treasure, so what what's treasures the do we get? Land? I should get the live here for free, but I'll play along and give you these silly pixels. Thanks for playing along. Who gave me a bomb? A predator for me versus predator or something or no? Uh, no, it, this is actually uh, St. Kelly. Uh, uh, elites from Hela. St. Kelly, technically, is their actual oh, species name. Oh, they look similar. What, aren't you having fun? Well, you, you want to die, hmm? Well, if you insist. If you keep thrashing around, I'm going to let you out. <laughs> well, you asked for it. Seems like generic voice lines. No, they actually aren't. What, just went out already? What is it, something about Dana soon? Mm. Wanna be eaten? Weirdo. Wait, there's another line there. Good prey. Maybe listen next Maybe next time I'll let you listen to me digest another prey. Hmm. Some mala? Mm. Not comfortable there, huh? Mm. If you keep staring at me like that, I might not be able to restrain myself anymore. Yeah, the least Their official species name is St. Kelly. Maybe yes. for, so. I had people get on me for not calling them that for a full point. Also, I think Come you on, have tired. forgotten to label the dragons. They can hold three prey each. They can? Yes. Mm -hmm. Alright, we'll try it. Only if you'd ask nicely, weakly. Well, it says on Still the chat. Okay, fair enough. There's not much to the elite aside from the. You know your place well, slave species. <laughs> That's me. Well, they're supposed to have another gimmick, but we can't show that. <laughs> hmm. I actually am not legitimately not aware of what the other gimmick is. So why don't you DM? Why don't you DM? Go into the Discord and DM what it is. Meanwhile, we'll go to one more room. Here's a random cat, Javrin. Mm -hmm. Saw to cover it, thank you. Mm -hmm. Hi. Nom. I put it in the group chat that we're talking in. Okay, let me check that. All right. Wait, on the dragons? Oh, on the Sangheili. Oh, right. Okay, I was very confused. I was like, dragons didn't have anything else. No, yeah, yeah. This one just says hi. I mean, do you really need to say much before eating someone? I guess not. <laughs> All right, let's, uh, I think blood is, let me pull, let me pull this back over. There we go. Yeah, I should have been cooking in here long enough. <laughs> I think you've been, I think you've cooked long enough. Let's see. Yeah, let's see. Oh. Yeah. yeah. There was a, there was another line there, actually. I didn't recognize, but egg! You've been egged. Hard boiled or soft boiled? Uh, you. Would have been neat if you came out as a harpy. That would be kind of cool, actually. <laughs> I'm just wondering what that other line was. Actually, uh, let me hop in for a second. I'm gonna test something. I didn't realize I was eating it. Where? I'm just testing. See if I can get another line. I think there, she may have said, "You know, what, I'm gonna actually." I bet that was a line because of the egg. So I, I'm, I'm legit curious. I'm just going to do a quick little check. I'm looking back at my own footage. That is a way, that is a potential thing I could do to check this, but... So also, I'm also lazy, so I don't generally do it. I just wonder why we never mark the dragons with a three, when it says on the chart three prayer. 
It doesn't right. seem like something we'd miss. Is that, I, don't, I feel like it didn't work, but we'll try it. It could be. Alright, I'm gonna check the line now. The line she said really fast was... Resting soundly in an egg. I'll see you in a while, my dear. That's what she said. It was just so fast because she... Because the, the NPCs are very good at interrupting themselves, so... Yes. Oh, I got... I got bellied again. Alright, so... Let's talk about these dragons. Starting with Nobu, Nobuyuki. A sample by treasure! Maltov! Okay. Your lair is impressive. Is it just dragon breath in a bottle? Alright, hop in, I guess. Ah, yes, it never worked. All right. I thought so. I told you why. I was like, I'm pretty sure I didn't make any mistakes. Is that note on the table making a noise, or is that my brain? Yes, it is. It's a geode. Geode. Yeah, when you go near it, makes a noise. Huh. One person time, then. Mm -hmm. Why is your other is oppressive? I'm slipping between the bed and the dragon. Okay. <laughs> so yeah, this dragon is supposed to eat you three times, I think, but... Does the dragon have anything to say besides your lair is impressive? No. I don't think so. Nope, that's... You summoned me! Okay, there's the second line, I guess. I make a, I can make a bunch of fun. I can make a bunch of fun noises by entering in and not a bunch, but yeah, the dragons are pretty. They're actually, surprisingly, kind of boring. You wouldn't think they would be, but they kind of are. This one blushes though, so I like it more. Please accept some coin. I think some someone dropped some more in my gut. Okay, that's a bit different. That's a flat, not a coin. Do you not? Yeah, do you not feel scared being this close to me? Hmm. No. I mean, try stacking up in this dragon, I guess. That's not accepted. It. Hmm. Room service? There's a few more lines of this dragon than the other one. That's surprising, considering they're recolors, effectively. Well, they, are, they have a few other differences, admittedly, but... Yeah, it doesn't look like strict recolors, like... What's this do? It oh. shape is different, I think. <laughs> Yay. How many of these do I have? Yes. Oh, that many. Okay. <laughs> I'm assuming this will go away eventually. <laughs> yeah, they burn out. Let's go give them a bunch of light. <laughs> um, right, Christy, which we saw as Pred, but she's or Prey, but she's both. Wanting to become mayor. Okay, go play Animal Crossing. Throw as much as you want. You're going in. Also, she gave me a gift and said something about the gift. I missed. Oh, it. she has an animated swallow. Oh yeah. I didn't even well, mark that. The best thing is we eat it, but this is okay too, I suppose. Uh, how about you want to stay? Oh, oh, yeah, multiple prey. You're eager. Get in now. Oh, she did a cat face. See how three. Caller left. There we go. She still has that stray damn pixel, though. <laughs> yeah. A nice big house that. is always great. I'm fine with, fine with small houses, though. I'm fine with giving people small houses, typically. I think we'd be quite generous with the room sizes. <laughs> <laughs> Give them the number of tenants? Yes. Mm -hmm.
Oh, so I'd give you a fire and rock sign, but it's in the chocobo. It's fine. <laughs> and I was enjoying having you, ha myself having you become one with me. It's a weirdly second course will. That's a weird way of wording it, but fair enough. Uh, how come you won't stay? That's I, I'm asking you this question too. Get back over here. Second course will. It was fun! Like I was suggesting you, it was nice. What's that? A stray pixel that appears in front, it's like a sparkle. Struggle as much as you want, you're going in. It's a bit sad. It is, it's like, well actually sometimes it's, only if you're highlighting her. If you're not, then it's not. Yeah. Mmm, you feel so good going down my throat. Struggle more! Struggle as you realize you're mine! I was always getting a little tense. Looks like I'll just have to feed someone myself then to get- I'll get a belly still. I mean... Not, kind of, I guess. It tastes so good. Got your own. Hey, not so fast! Well... Hmm? Oh, already? Say Laura next time. She has a lot of lines. Gulp, swallow, hot, wet, throat drags you deeper. Oh, wow. <laughs> I'm confused, like, it was gulp, swallow! It was like, comma, comma, and then hot, comma, wet. But relax, don't fight. You two will be gone soon enough. But what was weird is, like, it started out with verbs, and then it went into nouns, but it was, like, still verbiage in them. It was kind of weird. Mm -hmm. Again, too soon to leave. Again, a lot of these lines, very forty. Forty is good. Can't fold my teeth. Oh, the poor version of Vaughny. Careful of my teeth, they'll scratch you. Never mind, stay forever. Uh, you felt good, but I guess it like, can let you out for now. Come back soon, I'm always around to say hi to. Not getting out at all. Hold on, she... Well, I guess that leaves me free to feed someone else now. A lot of good lines here. It tastes even better today. Thanks, I use a different shampoo. <laughs> I'm gonna keep you for a long time. There's a lot of lines here. Still hungry though. How many lines are there? You're eager. Get in now. There's a lot of lines here. Keep swallowing over your body, slurping you down inside. Christy is very fleshed up. Very much so. So delicious. Oh, maybe stay longer next time. Don't fight it. This is a one-way trip. You'll make me so full. How many? I keep expecting to run out, but then I get another one. <laughs> Today's pretty good. Mill on the way in. I'm just just... You'll be mine, stay forever. Foods for eating. Your food. Get eaten. How many... This is such an insane number of lines. This is how I would do it if I was making a character for this, though. I would have, like, an excess... Excessive number of lines, because I like writing these sort of things. Alright, I think I'll move on. That's, that was a lot of lines. There might still be some, but... Goodness me, that was definitely the most lines of anyone. So anyways, here we have Dallinson. Thinks something bad's about to happen. Hmm. Does it have to do our Death Star plans, bud? I didn't need this anyway, so what, why not let you have it? So you provide home food for me. Yes, we get a food part. 
Hello, what's the galaxy like? I don't know. I've been I've been through like two planets. I'll happily do it, and I'll be gentle too. And then I'll run in place. That's how gentle they'll be. <laughs> what are they doing? I think I ever tried to go to bed. I think you took it. How rude. Uh, you come out. I won't force you to stay. Any other lines? Ah, uh, you feel really good in there, but if you want out... I'll be gentle about you. I have nothing to worry about. If you don't like it in my belly, I'll let you out. Sure, if you want. Okay, I promise not to hurt you either. This is a nice print. I think I found all the lines. Good character overall. So we got the Finnegans, or not Finnegans, but Finnick Fox kind of. Very pleased, nice home, take gift, okay. Mm -hmm. Friendly, strange, or feeling awkward, cautiously optimistic. I feel like this is default dialogue for them, but I'm not sure. Mm -hmm. It makes me wonder if the NPC could have you in the belly when they go to bed. Yes! But it may not work, it may glitch, mm -hmm. like physically. I'm me, conversing now, let's chat. So it feels like their default dialogue. Anybody know this race at all? Uh, Alright, I'm gonna move on. Sure. <laughs> he tried to leave. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, anyways. Oh, okay. We have William here. Default. Okay, that's what I thought. Enjoy the rewards of Gaia. I don't play Sonic Unleashed. What's up? Reindeer. Reindeer Tar, yes. Oh, you know what? The pole, the pole. I never actually put the... No, I did put it on. Never mind. I was wearing it. Always a pleasure to be in my sacred glade. I don't think there's a lot of dialogue going on with this guy. Yeah, but it's Christmassy. Yeah. We uh, honestly the next four are can technically just reskin, so we'll just go through them a bit quickly. We have the unicorn. Girl. Guy? Actually this is a guy, I just remembered. Partake of nature's bounty. Mm -hmm. What brings you to glades today, my child? <laughs> I wish to visit the Swabby part of the glades. Mm -hmm. Back to my sanctuary. Your sanctuary is your belly, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is some sort of default dialogue again. Not sure what exactly, but... The race with the weird ears is known as the Finrox. Yeah. Yeah. I, can't, I just forgot their name, but I forgot. You good? Give me Thanks for the throwing darts. Why does everybody give me these? Back to my favorite hut. What, Pizza Hut? That's my favorite hut. Mm -hmm. Dog is a bit generic of these, so I'll just move on. Beer is. I <laughs> All don't right. know how to talk in my laptop. Huh, I think there's a. Huh. Oh, whatever. Hello. Mm -hmm. What do you seek, child? This is a deer. Oh, the clock's making a noise. Mm -hmm. 
Thank you. The rewards of Gaia itself. Okay. And again, just kind of the same dialogue as the others. Then we have, I kind of like this. Wait, the blessings of Gaia? Hmm. I wonder what. Oh, you know what? I, what's that? Here's your writ, Slim. Oh, wait, this might be unique, actually. Hold on. Nice meeting you. Hmm. That sounded a bit unique, I don't know. Oh, well, they're in the... <laughs> I like how they're in the outhouse, but I see their tail poking out the back. <laughs> I'm just impressed they could fit in there. <laughs> they went in the outhouse with me. Apparently, I'm like... Tacos. I, I tend to pass things. I pass along quickly. Home on the range. So this seems a this seems a bit uh, themed actually, but I don't know if it's themed for more. It's just it is themed though. This cowboy horse girl. Not that main line stuff from what I could tell. So let's move on. Yes, it keeps going, guys. Here is, um, well, okay then. Well, look how you slid in. Wasn't that fun? Here's, uh, Octopus Lady. Huh? Hello, you're looking delicious today. Huh? You have a, you're a great partner. Have this gift. Thanks. What do you, I don't know what I get. I, what did I get? Hey, wait, didn't you want to stay longer? Huh? Hmm. They were eager. Yes, they were. Very hungry, I guess. Huh? Just be gentle on your way in. Huh? Come back next time you want to cuddle. Huh? Of course, I'd love to cuddle. Come on in. Belly cuddle. Show your time together? You're a bit big, but I'll manage. There, you're all inside now. Huh? Why did I hear what I th sound, thought sound like a villager going, huh? I have no idea what that was. Huh? My tentacles are tired. I'm glad I can rest them here. Huh? Hmm. I never turned down the chance to feel so full. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You were fantastic. Come back anytime. Ooh, I sure love tummy cuddles. There's a few lines for this character. See you next time. Erp, did you gain a little weight? Always. That seems to be about it, though. Oh, actually, I didn't see a new line. I'll be waiting with open arms and open tentacles. A friendly hentai greeting? <laughs> right. And here we have a cat. It's just a cat. Windlance. That wave, though. That was a weird... It looked like an intimidation roll or something. I don't know. <laughs> it's intimidating you for your catnip. So you have some catnip. I don't know about that, but the cat sure nipped you. <laughs> Is that all you care about? I mean, it's a cat. Why wouldn't it care about that? I think we just need to have an intervention. My new home. If you like, yeah. By the way, the cat is so basic that it literally requires nothing but a lo some light. This is the most basic room. 
Yeah. And that's why he wants catnip, because he just wants something. And wolves. What's that? I'll share the same. Uh, the three basic tenants of Barbod are cats, foxes, and wolves. They all yes. share the same. This is true. And here we have uh, Key, who is taking their time. Mm -hmm. How about Mm -hmm. Now there is a special volley we can't actually create because they die upon spawning like instantly, but uh, we can do the normal volley. So, oh well, I even asked to go in, but sure. And they volley like pretty good. Squish, 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 jump, jump, jump. Notice that when they fall, the bottom of the belly is round. Huh. <laughs> Well, it was easier to trigger falling animations. For Cliff. Hmm? Yes. Hmm? I don't know. Experimenting for the... See if there's any dialogue. Okay, this is a very boring on the dialogue front. Okay. It's a good belly, though. Nice and shiny. Shiny bellies are good. Then we have all snaps, which we saw as prey, but he has a print form, too. Thanks for another pick. Why do people keep giving me these? <laughs> Alright, um. Look! Ah, enjoy your stay. Enjoy your stay? Question mark, actually. So, weather's nice, ain't it? A little damp. <laughs> Enjoy your stay. Look, I will. <laughs> oh, hi, I didn't see you there. Oh, hey, it's you, what's up? Mm -hmm. So that's nice, eh? Sorry, you're uh, gonna have to wait your turn. Mm -hmm. Huh? You wanna go in too? Mm -hmm. Oh, sorry, excuse me. Mm -hmm. It's got unique dialogue when yeah. you hear it. I'm, uh, I'm busy here. So, yeah, indeed. How about when it comes to removal? This, mm, this is nice. <laughs> also some good gerbils. Charm, maybe they're giving you picks because they want to pick you up and eat you. Well, I mean, epic level pun dedication there. Oh yeah, another unique detail. He uh all snaps has a unique uh different facing sprite, left and right, if I recall. What is it, what are his eyes doing, by the way, when he's happy, I guess you could say. Look at, the, look at that. But yeah, like a weird chimney with his eyes. Yeah, his ears if you look at his ears you can tell the left and right facing sprites are different for the head. They have an existing volley. I'm surprised. Yeah. They, uh. Pretty popular. Uh. Species. Yeah, I'm falling with nice. Ah, that hit the spot. I take it you all want tips on this one, Beavis, mm, with the bean A tad dips. heavier than I'm used to. Yes. Yeah. Yes, yeah, so I do. First, see if all snaps any additional dialogue that I miss. I think Erp, mm, excuse me, was perhaps new. Okay, I think it's it for all snaps. Let's move on. Uh, what's next? Oh, look, we're at the top. Holy crap. And Beerus has claimed dibs on this next one. Uh, which one? Which one are we doing? Oh, this one? Because of the digestion? Yes, please enjoy yeah. the Cheeto Crocodile. Mmm. <laughs> oh, I am on that min mode. Thank you. <laughs> That's fair enough, right? I wasn't on that min. Whoops. Uh. 
upon just taking damage very slowly then, I guess. You were healing earlier. Yeah, but my food wore off. He's dying. Ah. He's, he's dying, I see he's dying. So let's talk to the crop while he does that. I'd like to become a librarian, but it's a lot of responsibility. Hmm, I wonder. What was that quest for pro- that was quest progress. I guess that's like a default race line or something. A great <laughs> idea for a video game. Maybe it involves eating moths. Huh. That's like a little quest. That's like, there's like a little quest pop up. So like, for some I reason that was progressing quests or something. This I wonder what the unique animation for this is gonna be. Something to do with digesting, probably. I believe so. I'm not sure. His body just might get smaller as you as you digest. That would be nice. That's always nice to have. Yep. Tends to be, anyways. Ugh. <laughs> so he does have some four lines, okay. Yeah, actually, you are digesting, because the belly went from distended to not distended. Like, distended to the point of the scales uh, segmenting apart. Good. And now Good. they are back and taut. If only all of these showed off a bit more poor. Oh, you. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I can hope stuff, can't I? <laughs> I mean, if you wanted to, you could have made a, a accelerated paw with the toy box. Hmm. Almost, almost there. there. Yep. Finished. That might be a one where I have to come out to be digested. Probably. Hmm. Yep. Yep. Digest. Oh, Seems to have a very limited amount of extra dialogue, so I'm gonna get out. Yeah. I'm also just going to quickly look up to see what his special was. What do you mean I think special? it was we... just the belly getting smaller. That was a special. marked for the special animation. But that was a special animation, we just saw it. Oh, was it? Yeah. His belly shrunk his beard to just. Oh, yeah. I thought it was like a different. Come, come over here, sleepy boy. Get over here. You both are tired. It's, it's late in Europe. Um, let's finish this up. <laughs> Alright. So, and then we have Alan Esther, who can't stop blinking. Well, he'd be in a lot of trouble with that one SCP. And we actually have Yapon Mouse, which is... Uh, one last pretty fella. Here you go. The last one's left is here with me. Down you go! Okay, well... <laughs> Chirp, I mean, rar. Wait, where do you go chirp? <laughs> Come on in, there's plenty of room to rest in. Now he's wondering if someone is secretly controlling their life. <laughs> you secretly control your truth of people's lives. <laughs> also, I like I mean, the big gray on the belly on this one, even though it's a bit simple. Or are we controlling his life? Ooh, gurgles. He fell asleep, I think. No, wait, wait. Blood fell asleep? Is blood <laughs> Owen and Zizing? I see. Uh -huh. Gurgle. Oh, wow, he went to bed? 
<laughs> so somebody was wondering about what happens if they go to bed while being all boorish. Well, they... <laughs> Look at the belly. Take a look. It's, uh... I mean... Oh. Oh, wow. Quite a flat belly. It's not quite meant for a bed. That was so nice. Please do come back again. Stay there. Stay in there, guys. So I see something. But this doesn't seem to change between two and three. Come in, there's plenty of room. You ring? I will say, it does have a very nice indented belly button. Yes, I agree. I'll take good care of you all. Hmm. Alright, what if you hop out? Just see if there's any extra animations or sounds. So belly size one and belly size two does have a variance. Does belly size three? I don't think it does. No, it doesn't. No. Which is really odd. Why 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 fit three if you're not gonna make it a little bit bigger? Oh well. Seems to be it for this guy. We just super compact the third. <laughs> Hi, mouse. Time to feed the mouse. Being adventurous is pretty fun. Still not used to being devoured, though. I'm really sorry I can't get all the requests, but I thank you for making them shites. Oh, this is actually shites, isn't it? I mean, he's not oh. named that right now, but I just realized he's, he's shites. So you pop mouse, yeah. Oh. Dreaming of the mouse. The more mod creator, for those wondering. Oh, fitting that he was the last NPC. Yeah. Place is worth its size of carrots. What's that mean? Mm -hmm. Hello. Mm -hmm. Oh my, hello there. There you go. <laughs> mm -hmm. Did you need. <laughs> yes, I want to eat you, mod creator. <laughs> I shower daily. Did I really taste that bad? Mm -hmm. No, it's just fun to have you slide up and down. Oh my, hello there. Do not to be eaten. So the do not, he does. He's doing that. Do not want to get. <laughs> All the place a sundary like that. Did you need something? I'm all ears, ha! Huh? Oh, mouse, mouse jokes. Mm. <laughs> The scrolls are concise in this matter. They say hello! What scrolls? I think that's an Elder Scrolls thing. Oh. But where am I? Hmm, good question. <laughs> Just experimenting with his lines since he's the mod creator at all. Yeah, um... Rolls are concise, they say hello. Yes. Well. <laughs> Why does he chirp, though? Is he secretly a bird? I mean, I guess... By the way, secret... Here's a secretly a... Here's a bird. His parents are visiting. Dragons can chirp if I if they want to. Who are you say what sounds a dragon can and can't make? There's that noise again, guys. Hold on. Okay, that proves it. Hey, blood, mute yourself. <laughs> okay. 
Okay, unmute. Just check that was not in game. One of your mics is fucking up. I'm not sure whose. But I'm gonna say Bloods. Occasionally it makes a weird noise. I just turned the game down to prove it wasn't the game. Doubt it's mine since I'm using push to talk. Fair. Yeah, it's just this weird noise. I don't know. Well, anyways, um, up here then. There's not a teleporter on top of this roof. But uh, this is the sky bridge. There's nothing particularly interesting to see here, but it just takes you to the other tower. This is also a good way to compare the size of the two towers. If you were curious. There, that different size. But. Let's see, am I an admin or off admin? I'm off admin. Let me turn it on. And all the way down. There we go. Skybridge is neat. I don't know what I was doing. I just kind of like threw it together because I was like, I want an easy way to between the towers. Because why not? But uh, hey, there's one last thing to do. But before we go do it, what is everybody's zoom level on? I would like you all to be on zoom level uh, four times if you could. At least for right now. Right. How do you set the zoom level? Uh, escape, options, graphics, zoom level. Pretty much the most logical place you'd find it. <laughs> I'm on three times. Put it on four times. Four times now. There you go. Briefly. I'll explain. In a bit, we're going to actually have you guys bring it all the way down to the low, to the furthest out, but sure. not yet. About now. So there's one last thing. It's one last thing. So it's over here. So. Read the sign here. Pixel art. Bye. Charo. <laughs> And Selena. Selena wrote the sign. I'm surprised she fit my name in there. Look at that. So uh, if you walk over here. All right. All right, zoom out. We did some art. Oh, wow. <laughs> Great. Oh, that's really cool. <laughs> Who's in that belly? So this is a, uh, originally this was an animation. Uh, one of the frames of an animation that Emu Sal and me worked on together a long time ago for my Charmillion self. With a nice wobbling belly and everything. We took a, we took a frame from yes. that. Figured out how to pixelize it. And uh, dress it up for, for, for Christmas. So... So who's in that belly, huh? Everyone. <laughs> Good. <laughs> and and stand between the stuff. stand between the words, Smala. There you go. I guess the best ex the best Christmas gifts are the friends we ate along the way. <laughs> right. <laughs> Beef down. Yes, I know. Beef. And yes, I know yeah. what I'm doing. That mistletoe. Mistletoe. <laughs> Yeah, the mistletoe on the tail's a nice touch. You might get <laughs> unexpected kisses. Right? Unexpected <laughs> Perhaps an explanation for the belly. Yeah, I guess. Also, I... an explanation for the uh, smoke look. <laughs> yes, yes. Yeah, I guess the mistletoe just ends up being a, some more feed alting. <laughs> Yes, that was the application before you just decided to spell it out and ruin the magic, but, you know. <laughs> I mean... Someone's about to say it, right? <laughs> yeah, this was a lot of fun. Selena and me put this together, and I was like... Because I was like, you know what? I'm not satisfied with how much I put together. I want to do one more thing. I want to do something to finish off with. And I don't think there's any better but way to finish off. Be, we have been spending the past few days working on this for Xmas. <laughs> yes. Yeah, it's really nice. Also, if you full bright, it's easier to see. Is there, is there some way to... Actually, there is, isn't there? If I just hit... No? Is there some way to make the chat go away? Just, like, yeah. leave it for a bit, I guess. Hold on. Yeah, it's gone now. It's 
gotta be a way to remove. Ah, fair the enough. The chat's on now. I'm sort of about something else now. Hold on. Uh, hide, hide. Left all and Z. Oh, that's an interesting combination. All right. Ah, fair enough. Well, in any case, uh, let me just go ahead and. It's in left all and Z opens my chief boss experience. <laughs> I was gonna say, like, this sounds, a button com this sounds like a button combination I'll have to be careful about. But. There we go. In any case, everyone, I wasn't expecting the Starbound Vor mod to actually take the entire stream, but I'm not really complaining either. The, uh. I actually kinda like it with Alpha right now. There we go. Um, but it did, and I'm okay with that, because we put so much effort into this, and this was the big Christmas thing I wanted to put together for you guys, so. I very much hope that you all enjoyed it. It did seem like we had a very engaged chat. We had, we had, we had like, 50 viewers and 60 viewers, and then 15 and 40, so. Honestly, pretty good, pretty good, pretty good, um, set of viewers today. So thank you everyone for coming by. And, uh... Yeah, I I will see you guys for something else on Sunday. Well, actually, hey, it peaked you on Sunday, obviously. But uh, I'm going to just chill out for the rest of the night and tomorrow. But in any case, guys, I hope you had fun. Blood and uh, Beerus, thank you very much for joining me and helping me out here. Anytime, Char. It was fun. And, Even uh, if I'm getting very tired. <laughs> On that note, I'm going to end the call and let you guys get to bed. So, Merry Christmas again. Okay. and uh, Merry Christmas to you, too. <laughs> Hope you had, like, a good day. I did. I did, overall. I'm a little yeah. tired. I've been tired all day, but it was a good day. Yeah, hope you got lots of treats. <laughs> Ate a few Riolos. <laughs> I'll, I'll have some treats <laughs> after Merry this Christmas. stream. Merry Christmas. <laughs> yes, good night to you, Blood and, and Mears. <laughs> good night. I take care, big boof. <laughs> And as for you, streamgoers, and those on YouTube, I hope you guys had a good time. And uh, thank you very much for all the donations, streamgoers. Like, we had an insane amount of support earlier. Thank you so much. I think I'm going to turn some of that around and get some food delivery tomorrow because I've been, I've been a bit rough. It's been a bit of a rough time lately. Um, last week, or actually earlier this week, we had the... Uh, I, had, I had a problem with my uh, downstairs, downstairs tenant in this apartment. Uh, I feel bad for her. She had a bit of a mental breakdown, but it caused a lot of problems for me, and I had to help, and it was really stressful, and it kind of messed with me. And it's still been messing with me for a few days, actually. Kind of gave me a little PTSD, I'd even say. But, regardless, I'm starting to recover. It's not so bad now. And, well, <laughs> let's Beerus do another light. He made light. Why am I not surprised? But, uh, yeah, just recovering, getting things together, try to relax a bit. And, uh, but yeah, I'll see you guys on Sunday for more Hey You Pikachu. Do come by for that, because that's been a lot of fun. But will be part three. It might be the last part. I don't know, so you can come by and see. Um, but in any case, I wish you all a very Merry Christmas. And I hope that we can have 2021 be a much better year than 2020 in a lot of ways. And I hope to keep expanding this content out. You know, growing my channels, doing more cool stuff. Hopefully see more of you guys watching along the way. So, uh, yeah. Good night, everybody. And I'll see you soon.